shit. <laughs> Poof, hello, can you hear me? Thank you. Probably. I don't know whether it's... I don't know what's going on, but something is causing my mouse speed to be so fast that it's impossible to aim. The mouse speed sensitivity on this mouse all of a sudden, on its own... <laughs> I don't know. I updated OBS. Maybe that's it. I don't know why that would be it, but maybe that's it. That shit is so fucking fast, dude. It's crazy. Jesus. It was, like, very difficult to... You know, the the volume... <laughs> the volume, so I, you know, so I could fade the song out. That shit was impossible. How's it going? Happy New Year. DPI. What the fuck is that? Who cares? I got the skills. I'll aim. Uh, shiny green mage blood. Nice, nice. Happy New Year. <laughs> thank cool. you. Cool. Hey, thanks for the subs. I gotta thank. Hey, thanks Citizen Phoenix and Roger and Hood, whatever, and Slime Ball. Thanks Strad and Radioactive and Easy LP. Red Storm and Dead Phenom and Darth Bane and OG Floss Boss. Thanks, Mega Guy and Kid Indigo and Dharma and Felicia. And thanks, Cook Class and Boki and Banging Your Mom 420 and Oolong Milk Tea. Thanks, Jimbo <laughs> Thank and you. Avan and Bathazid and Snake Edge. <laughs> Thank hey, you. thanks, Happy Feet, and Almighty whatever, and Earth Boy, and Alpha Kamiguru. Did all this shit happen right now? Yeah. Hey, all right. Happy New Year. What happened? Everything cool? Hold on. I'm not even done. Uh, thanks, <laughs> Bohij, <laughs> and Lazy you. Ace Jace, and also Dr. Derm, and uh, Thumpa. And also, <laughs> Thank you. whatever this shitty fucking name is. <laughs> Thanks. Thank you. I mean, you know someone's going to need to say this shit to thank you. You don't even consider that? What the fuck is this name? What is that, an I? <laughs> Thank you. I don't even know what that is. Hey, whatever the fuck that is, man, Happy New Year. Thanks. Uh, thanks, Nosey. Thank you. And thanks, Wizzy Fox. Tombstone? Just saw Tombstone? The movie? Thank you. Tombstone the movie? That movie is sick. That movie made me want to grow a mustache. That I remember seeing that movie. I was like, well, now I gotta grow a mustache. I was like four when that happened. I'm kidding, but I was pretty young. Um that movie is amazing, dude. That movie is amazing. One of the best fucking western movies. So good. Man, Val Kilmer, like, got sick. Like, he got mouth problems, and he can't talk, I think, or something. Is a... I love bits. Well, look, man. Any kind of name where you gotta explain how it's said can <laughs> fucking eat a Thank dick. You. you know what I mean? Hold on. I'm busy. Uh, <laughs> top player coming through. <laughs> Out of the way. The All right? Line. Out of the fucking way. Top player coming through. You know, I wonder if Junior is still funny. Junior is, he, I haven't seen him in a long time. And now he's a dad. But he used to be so funny, dude. So funny. He got dad nerfed? You think? Unbelievable. Hey, Anonymous, thanks very much. Happy New Year. Thanks for a hundred gifted subs. Thank you. This guy never gives up, dude. <laughs> I've been doing my best, Thank but you. he never gives up. Thanks for not giving up. Nice job making it to 2024. One step closer to getting to 2025. That's how far we need to get. Wow, people are messaging me. Wow, man, that's cool. Thanks. Um, Happy New Year. Don't drink and drive. Are you guys drunk? Or any kind of inebriated like mango grandma's fentanyl Thank you. i'm hype about tekken i always tell you my my range is one month 
My range is one month. So it's within one month of Tekken, and my excitement is now here. Uh, I always tell you, I can't get excited about some shit that's farther than a month away. That's my maximum. Thank you. Hey, Juan and Anonymous, thanks very much. Hopefully, you get everything you want in 2024. The rest of you, too. Uh, hey, thanks. My name got banned. And Zlobin McDev. McDev? Thanks, Neen Panini and Mike Squints and Doodle and Wizzy and, and Nolsey and Iza. Nice shitty name. Anyway, thanks. Uh, <laughs> Iza. Shut up, bitch. <laughs> Tell me how to. He told me how to phonetically pronounce his name. Like I give a fuck. Hey, thanks. Um, uh, you know, I've been. There are people who have like a hundred plus month subscription, and I still say their name wrong. So what? Should have picked an easier to say name. Six years of joy, Eros. Hey, thanks. Hold on, let me get there. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks, 800-588-2300-EMPIRE. <laughs> You're a fucking stupid bitch. You know that? I'm angry. <laughs> Empire. Stupid bitch. Thanks, PayUcon. And Mungo's Dan's Game. Thanks, Good good Game TV. And Bash. And Taser. <laughs> Thank you. I was gonna yell at you because your name sucks. I was going to yell at you because your name sucks. It was just a bunch of numbers. You know how I hate people with stupid robot names like that, right? So I was getting ready to yell at you. And then I thought, wait. Decode these numbers. What are these numbers? That was funny. You got lucky, you motherfucker. Happy New Year. That was funny. Uh, thanks, Miso and Narrows and Tian. <laughs> You got lucky. You got so lucky. Uh, thanks, Mustang and Clown with a K and TV Skywalker. You got lucky. Thanks, Yo Pimps and Snoop and Don Chauffeur and all the rest of these shitty ass names. Keep up the good work picking <laughs> whack ass names. Thank you. Thanks. Happy New Year. Thanks, Low Tier, for the 10 gifted you sub. Can bid me when I try. <laughs> Happy New Year's from the East Coast Playa. That was a funny name. Hey, Happy New Year, Yamasaki. <laughs> Whatever, man. You guys are taking advantage. Thanks. Uh, thanks, Foot Clan HNIC. Hey, Happy New Year, East Coast. Uh, hey, you guys are all right by me. I know everyone over there hates the West Coast, but as far as I'm concerned, you're cool. Uh, except Florida. Except Florida sucks. Uh, hey, thanks, Kirby, for the whatever that thing is, pa party raid. Thanks, man. Hey, thanks, Mostly Positive and Graves and Roger and a few people that I probably missed, but I can't fucking tell. Upside Down Smiling and Dumpster and KD Zen. Thanks, guys. I'm sorry if I missed your name, but Happy New Year. It's really difficult to... Man, that shit made me laugh. That was funny. Bitch. Uh, what's new? Anything <laughs> cool you. going on? Or fun? Uh, thanks, Muted Mimic. Thanks, Anonymous and... Papa Dosio and mostly positive. And thanks, Thank Red you. Queen. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks. Thanks, Sally Nightshade. 150% humidity? Mother. Sounds whack. Mierda. Thanks, 
exhaling Tom Brady. Did you get that right? It's still pretty good. Get up in there, will ya? Happy New Year from the band community. Hey, Happy hey, New Year, Liquid. Happy New Year, sir and chat. Hey, Happy New Year, Armored Prime. That's cool. I like that everyone's in a good mood. I also like that there's no bad news. I like good news. Good news. You, know, I never liked you, you guys want to play some Dark Souls? I'm so ready for fucking Tekken 8, dude. Even if it sucks. <laughs> I don't even care anymore. You know? Uh, I'm ready. Um, hey, why can't you see? Hold on. I'm ready for MGS4. This guy, no one's ever been or is going to be ready for that trash. But me too. Uh, it's just, I don't know how that's going to happen. I think the best chance for MGS4 is I'm waiting for them to release a ripoff version of it on Steam. Isn't that supposed to happen? They did it with one and two. One, two. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, thanks, Desperado. <laughs> Thank you. It can't be done. Are you sure? Hey, thanks, Kayla Ellis. Happy New Year. Thank you. Cool. Uh, thanks, Chin Goose. Thanks, Princess Bride on VHS. Hey, thanks, Desperado. Did I already thank you? Whatever. Thanks. Thanks, I want to suck men off. You're not... What the hell? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> That's not like uh, how the joke works, you dumb ass. What are you doing, my friend? What? <laughs> That's even better. That's even better than the way the joke. I never even thought of that. Forget trying to make it sound like a name. This guy's neck. Yeah, new meta. Forget it. Just write a fucking stupid sentence down, right? Take all the cleverness out of it. Wow. <laughs> Thank you. Game changer. Hey, thanks, Eden. <laughs> See, this guy's in the past. This guy's in 2023. His name's Eden Diaz. Lol. You're not doing it right, man. It's 2024 now. Thanks, baby duck. And, <laughs> dude, <laughs> that fucking empire shit. Got me, you lucky son of a bitch, dude. I hate that guy. <laughs> Been getting really into washing my hands. <laughs> uh, hey, thanks, Mike, and thanks, Fat Dracula, and <laughs> mi you. milking whatever, and thanks, Toby, and Bullet, and Nachos. Thanks, guys. His name is mostly Thank Suck. You. She's bald. Thanks, Kunkel. Happy New Year, bros. It was a pretty good one, right? Overall. A little weird, but I mean... <laughs> Thank you. Aren't they all? Naked. <laughs> Thank you. It's your birthday today? Happy birthday. That's pretty cool. Mm, nice. Happy birthday. So it's like a... I always see birthdays and New Year's as similar in the sense that you kind of like got a new PB. So yours are lined up. That's kind of cool. If you think about it. Nice. Happy New Year. Don't, don't like drive. But have fun. I mean, you know, if you're drinking, they'll get you, the cops. You're going to be doing a handstand in no time if you fucking do that. They'll get you. <laughs> Thank you. Ed209. Thanks, Leaf and Scully and Cross Contour and Kunkel and Toby. Thanks. Which one of these are you supposed to pick? Master Key. Uh, let's just do a quick. I mean, you got to put a little hair on her. Something, you know, princess-like. Whoa. Weird bald spots. This is nice. Everything's good, except... Oh, what about a name? Uh, what do you think? 
chat. There is set. You guys see him? You guys are morons. Any resolutions plan? Yeah. Um Yeah, actually a few. How about you? Could join us. <laughs> Happy New Year, please. <laughs> Almost made that shit plural. Uh, Kajina. <laughs> what a stupid fucking moron typo. What do you mean commoner? How do I accept? Oh, physique? Average. Okay, accepts. Merry New Year. Giving all of you my luck, amigos. Hey, thanks, lucky bitch. Yeah, I'll take it. Me too. Yes. I think it's gonna be a good one. A little fishy told me it's gonna be a good one. It'll be something like this. I heard. I mean, you never know. These kinds of things could just be a game of telephone hearsay, but I heard 2024 is gonna be a good one. We'll see. Yeah, I'm very, very ready hey, for Tekken 8. It's yeah. gonna be fun. Hi. <laughs> Thank you. This is your Eight divines from a blue shrine? What's a blue shrine? Oh. Uh. Altar? Eldritch altar? Cool. I need to start rolling my flasks for mage blood. I'm almost there. Yeah. Oh, you. <laughs> Hey, thanks, uh, whatever. And Happy New Year, Smile, and Poro Hub, and Ship GED. And thanks, Happy New Year, Riot Kitty. What, only her? The hell. Uh, and thanks. And thanks, Leaf. And New DKC 2024, trust me. <laughs> trust me. Yeah, okay. Thanks, Orange. Hey, Happy New Year. Good shit. I'm ready for Tekken. I don't know if there's anything before then to hold me over. Or us over. The royal we. We we. I wonder if you really do get a dad debuff. Like if you're a funny guy and then you get a... You, you have a kid. Do you just automatically... You're less funny? This is not the first time I've heard of this. They're called dad jokes for a reason. My first car ever, it was a police car, which I've told you about, and it didn't have a radio or speakers or anything. It had like a CB, you know? So I had no music. I had no tunes, right? And my friends all said that the reason why you're funny is because you don't have a radio in your car. So all you do is you just drive around and think of jokes all the time. <laughs> and so so they were once I got finally I saved up money and I got a CD player, you know, CDs lol. And everyone said that I was going to get a debuff, that I was going to get less funny because now I had tunes in my car. I wonder they could have been right. Who knows how funny I was back then? I could have had a career in comedy if I didn't get that CD player. But man, I had to bump those tunes. How can I not? Mm, hey, thanks, Fat Shaggy. Thanks, a blue whatever. And see those mountains over there? And thanks, uh salt and whatever and high meme and <laughs> Caltorac. thanks Caltorac and Loyus Joe and HB whatever these fucking names are <laughs> uh hey thanks names suck 
Um, but thanks. Happy New Year. I'll be nicer. That's one resolution. Be nicer. Um, to you. Uh, I'm already maximum nice to everyone in real life. But to you, be a little nicer, but not that much. Happy New Year's. Your favorite, my streamer smile. Thanks very much, Real Tear and Ahmed. A, a doo doo. Thanks. A doo doo. <laughs> The chat room laughed at it. You're cool. <laughs> it's not my fault. The chat room laughed at it, dude. It was not my fault. You guys made me laugh because you thought it was funny. That's not my fault. Do I have a stupid <laughs> weapon that swing? Where do you get this weapon? Oh, is this it? <laughs> I hella got influenced right there. Grab this piece of wood. Beat his ass. That was funny. You guys are funny today. Maybe it's because everyone's drunk. Drunk. Cool. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, thanks, Anonymous. <laughs> and thanks, Thank Ferris Metal, or whatever. And Mr. Lowrider. And Sushi the Kid and Aaron Sticks and Compound. And anyone I missed today, sorry about Thank missing you. Thank you. Thanks, Cal Torak, for the 10 gifted subs. Hey, thank you again, Juan and Anonymous. That guy is a legend. Thanks. Beat this guy to death, stupid ghost. Uh, thanks, Proceeding Hairline. Remember that guy? That there was this guy, I forgot his name. You know, what's so funny about that guy. Thank you. The funniest thing about that guy isn't his proceeding hairline. The funniest thing about him is when I, I thought I was meeting him, right? I was like, hey man, nice to meet you, you know? He was so appalled that I didn't remember him, that we had already met. We had already met once before. And I didn't remember him. And I was like, hey, nice to meet you. He was, I've never seen someone before so appalled. He was like offended, obviously, and verbally. It was not like, a, like a, he was not hiding it. He was literally saying, I can't believe you don't remember me. And I was like, all right, dude. What, you know, like, what do you want? What do you want me to do, dude? What? You want me to remember you? What do you want me to do? And and his proceeding hairline also was pretty good. That guy was a two-pronged funny guy because he created two laughs. I like I like it when people are funny. Uh, thanks, Cypher Black. Uh, thanks very much, Bald and Gay 3. And thanks, Brand Doni. Appreciate it, bros. Thanks, Cal, Torak, Thank and Chucky Lou. Thanks. Happy New Year. <laughs> Thanks, Melt Thank Man. You. Oh, I forgot about this guy. It's the first time. <laughs> Thank you. Are you drunk, dude? Hey, someone tell Java Stout to never talk again. You, you, do you realize that I'm gonna ban you? <laughs> Don't fucking talk to me. He's drunk. I can smell you from here. You. Smells like shit. <laughs> Having you, your bitch. Someone shoot him. Uh, thanks. Uh, fifty percent nicer, Papa John. Man, Papa John, dude, where is that guy? Remember when he was bragging? He brags about the weirdest shit. He bragged about eating forty pizzas in thirty days, and he bragged about not saying the N word for twenty months straight. 
Wow! <laughs> wow! What an accomplishment! 20 months straight! Amazing! <laughs> That's a nice PB! I didn't think he'd make it that far! Incredible. The Papa, dude. <laughs> that guy's pretty tight. Where's he been? Where's he been? I think he sleeps in liquid. Oh, drink some juice. Look at this guy. Don't you like fall down or something if you don't do it yourself? I don't remember. Oh! 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 I missed my fucking bonus damage! I knew there was some stupid shit I was forgetting. I missed my bonus damage, damn it. Oh! Alright, alright, that's very funny. That's very funny. Get these bongs out of the way. Oh! Alright, alright. I was thinking, like, what's gonna happen that makes me have to hurry here, but now I remember. It's that jerk off jumping up. Damn, he's got hops. Fat bitch. Oh. Oh, that is that is a ripoff. Beat his fat ass to death. Again. Ah, simple as that. Man, what a splendid game this is. Speaking of splendid games, speaking of speaking of splendid games, I think my PS5 broke. The one in here, I have two, right? The one in the living room's fine. Okay, I think it did. I think it did. Let me tell you what's going on. Maybe you guys can explain or maybe solve. I don't know. You're pretty smart. Uh, hold on. Let me think. Uh, thanks, Stark and Largu, and thanks, I mean, look. That's a good one. Thanks. Thanks, Socron and Valkuma. And thanks, everyone. Domino, Blue Cupcake. I don't know if I missed your name. Look, so the place... First of all, let me give you a thing that I saw a long time ago. I saw a video that said... Yes! Look at this! Did you have it standing vertically? I saw a video a long time ago that said that if you have your PlayStation standing vertically, the goo that connects shit together in there melts and gravity pulls the goo and then the connection fails okay the one in the ribigarumu is horizontal the one in the ribigarumu is horizontal the one in the streaming rib streaming room is vertical and it broke you know how it broke it won't connect to the internet and I tried everything. It can't be the cable. It can't be anything. I tried everything to make it connect to the internet. It won't connect to the internet. Do you know how to fix it? You know what I did? Try. I did try Wi-Fi. Okay, here's the ultimate test. I took my computer, my, my computer, right? It's connected to the internet. I unplugged that plug. I put it in the PlayStation 5 does not connect to a wired <laughs> LAN local area network. So the, the plug is good. I did call no pants. He doesn't know shit. He said uh, check the warranty. <coughs> is the date set properly? Is that a joke? <laughs> Thank you. Change the Ethernet cable. You're not listening. I already tried multiple Ethernet cables and I like literally tried the one that works from the computer. I unplugged it and it doesn't work. And when I try connecting to Wi Fi, it d call 800 588 2300 Empire. Man. <laughs> Listen, dude. I don't want to... <laughs> Have you seen that video? There's this guy. I don't even know who the guy is. 
But he's like some guy that works at like a liquor store in the hood. And he says shit to the customers. And the customers are all like fucking, you know, thugs. And they get pissed. Have you seen that one? There's this like series of videos. Dude, yeah. He calls that guy Pumpkin Pie. That's my favorite one, dude. He, first he says, I, I forget what he says, right? But the guy's mad. The guy is mad that he called him whatever the fuck he called him. And then afterwards he goes, what if I call you Pumpkin Pie? And he goes, man, Pumpkin Pie. He's so shocked that this guy just called him Pumpkin Pie that he had to start laughing. Like he, he dropped the aggressive street you know, step over here and i'll fuck you up kind of attitude <laughs> and he just fucking started laughing at that pumpkin pie shit that's my favorite one dude that guy could not be pissed he just could not be pissed it was so funny against his will you could tell he wanted to be pissed like he wanted to be aggressive <laughs> but he couldn't he couldn't do it dude that shit was tight. Pumpkin pie. I think he calls him, like, uh, baby girl. That's what it is. He goes, hey, thanks, baby girl. And he goes, baby girl? What you mean, baby girl? Do I look like a baby girl to you? Man, what? He gets really pissed. What the fuck do you mean, baby girl? You know? And then he goes, sorry, you know, uh, you know. How about, how about if I call you pumpkin pie? When he says pumpkin pie, the guy goes over the edge. And then it comes back to zero. It's so good. It's so good. Is that it? How did you find it? Is that it? Let me see that. That's it, dude. That's it. Hey, why did it change to the next one? I don't know how to use the internet. This is it. How do you, like, what is this website? Oh, this is YouTube? I'm just saying, like, have a go. I'm saying, you said, baby girl. What you mean by baby girl? I'm just like, I do not like, have a going. That's it. No, you said, baby girl. What you mean by baby girl? Do I look like a baby girl to you? Nah, bro, you look like a man. I'm saying, though, so, so what the you mean, baby girl again? I'm just saying, like, you, like, you I'm saying, help me understand. You said, baby girl, have a good day, baby girl. Do I look attractive to you? Or <laughs> He's I mean, pissed. Like, let's say, like, let's say, let's say I have like, a good look kind of attractive. But, but I'm not with that, though. I'm not, I'm not about that. Listen, 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 listen. All that baby girl, all that, all that, this, that, the third shit, see, we, we not doing none of that. Yeah. You know, bro, but it's like, you know, like, I'm just just joking around. All right, all right. You know what I'm trying to say? Do no baby it's like, how, how about if I call you pumpkin pie? <laughs> wants to be pissed he tries so hard at the end you could tell he's using as much of his street meter as he can to be pissed but he can't he smiles that shit was tight dude that's what you guys do to me dude against my will when you guys say these stupid fucking joke names that's how i feel i'm trying so hard to be pissed dude do i look like a baby girl to you but I can't resist. That shit is so funny. What can I do? What can be done? Hate that shit. Do I look like a baby girl to you? Thank you. Thanks, Cheeseburger Prince and Daxter fan. That's my favorite video of that. You know, that guy has a series of them. Thanks. Thanks, Chucky Lou. Thanks, Stanley. Hold on. Baby girl, hold on. Thanks, Stanley and uh, Home Shopping Network and Bago. Yeah, yeah. Hey, Crims, happy new year, man. Mm, thanks. Did I already thank you? Whatever. Thanks, Shioro and Filled Up and Big Boys. Thanks, thanks, Kill Your Hero and thanks. Resident Beevil. Hey, Shino Slav. Happy New Year. <laughs> you guys are already in the future, right? That's cool. How is it? Mm, I think this last one was pretty cool, and I'm hype about the next one. The next one's going to be a good one. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, thanks. Um, Tekken Tim's PS4 controller and Balzac 
thanks Deep Cheeks and Forever Frog and Stark and Mayo whatever and Alex with a K. Thanks, bros. Sorry if I missed your name. There's a lot of you. Uh... <laughs> Thanks, sucking dicks with my butthole. Man, I hope I grow up one day. Uh, thanks. <laughs> you know, I never liked you, Rick. Thanks for the big laughs. Thanks. Thanks, get thanked. Uh, anyway. One day. What are you guys gonna do when you grow up? But not today. Only in the ancient legends. Be an astronaut? But one day an undead shall be chosen. When I was a kid and all the adults used to ask me, uh, what I want to be when I grow up, I used to say, I don't want to get a job. <laughs> Thank you. Since I was like five. <laughs> Thank you. My parents tell me about that shit. Like other kids were saying shit like astronaut and fireman. I don't want to get a job. <laughs> the trophy's mine! Happy New Year, stoners. Hey, thanks, Compton's finest pumpkin pie. That was <laughs> so funny. <laughs> pumpkin pie? What you mean, baby girl? Dude, in that series of videos, some of these guys, like, get, like, mortally pissed. They're ready to engage in Mortal Kombat because this guy gives them a pink lighter. That's all he does. All he does, they say, let me get one lighter. He gives them a pink lighter. And they get so insanely angry, they start destroying things in the store. Not even kidding you. They're so crazy. That shit is so weird. So weird. I get pink lighters all the time. Who cares? Pink lighters are cool. What's wrong with pink? That's a nice color. But, you know. Everyone's different. That's a big deal in the hood. <laughs> Why? Why is that? That's a big deal in the hood. <laughs> what makes it a big Thank deal? You. Pumpkin pie. Uh, hey, where's a nice big axe that I can get? One that has all tier ones. How about the Black Knight axe? Can I get a nice big axe there? Mm, thanks, Toilet Pony. Hey, thanks, Sarnian. Thanks, Chibbles. And Soy Sauce. What'd you say? Man, the chat's going fast and I don't have a mouse. To get a mouse, I have to minimize the game. Sewers has a great axe. Uh, you can get one in the catacombs. Yeah. Excuse me. Axe in the depths. Uh, we're headed towards the graveyard then, right? That's gonna suck. I forgot what the strat is. Uh, catacomb, Black Knight, Great Axe. Just right off the bat? Run for my life? Run for your life. Thanks, Nayo. Thanks, everyone. Happy New Year. Congratulations. I think it's definitely noteworthy to have reached this year. This year is going to be cool. Nice job. Hey, what are you looking at? Yo, Aris, thank you again for the dope raid last. <laughs> <laughs> Get buried. Uh, hey, thanks. Hey, damn, thanks, Joe. Happy New Year. It's a lot of shit you said. Thanks. Appreciate it, man. Thanks, Contrast. Happy New Year, Robo. Hey, Happy New Year. Happy New Year, Joe. Thanks. Thanks, Contrast. 
I gotta run for my life. I don't quite remember how this goes, but... Uh, should I get the bonfire? I think ideally you go all the way down here without getting any bonfires so that you could just die and come back to the shrine. God, this is impossible. Let's try it. No? Don't get the bonfire or no? Uh, no, yes. <laughs> no, no? Or no, yes. Fuck the bonfire. Alright, I'm with you on this. Oh, fuck. Don't get the bonfire. That's it. Ah! Oh! Alright, let me try that one more time. Let me try that one more time. Oh, also I just realized that maybe I should, to get the BK axe, don't I need a lot of humanity? Get humanity. That was just a button check. Uh, hey, thanks. All day, be day. And insert Cox. Thanks, uh, yawn and contrast. Thanks, guys. Happy New Year. Anyone getting drunk? I like alcohol, it's pretty cool, but I got the gout, so don't really have it very often. Getting crunk, baked, baked calzone. You really have gout? Yeah. Look at that horse. Hey, thanks. Thanks. Thank you. Um, dog head. And thanks all day, big day. Schneider Thank Lens. Thanks. Cut that bitch off. Ouch. Happy New Year Central Time. Oh yeah. Hey nice, how is it? I still got two hours left. Thanks, I'm getting messages too. Happy New Year. Ah, don't go in here, you dumb fuck. Not you. Oh, God. These guys... How do you fucking open this door? Oh, there's a lever in there! How many times do you have to play this game to remember this shit? There's a lever in there you have to push. I forgot about the lever. Don't worry, I got this under... Oh! Fucking bitch threw a fireball at me. Oh! Oh! Well, look. Now... The lever has been pulled. So in this next try, I can omit the lever from the equation. No more need for lever pulling. I already did it. It's already pulled. Now watch this. I forgot. Uh, thanks. Con, whatever his name is. And thanks, uh, the man called Nova. And Master Wong and Toad. Happy New Year. Good shit. Sounds like New Year's is pretty sweet. 2024 is pretty good so far. Mary Central Standard New Year. Hey, nice. Um, Happy New Year. Central Standard. Cool. It's headed this way. I heard. 2025 hype? 2025 hype? Hey, how far away do you live? The hell? How's GTA 6? Is that shit tight? Watched your stream for 2,300 hours this year. Thanks. Thanks. Is that a lot of hours? How many hours are in a year? How many hours did I stream is the real question. Probably less than that. That sounds like a lot. Am I going the right way? <laughs> yes. Thank you. Oh, fuck. I forgot about that. Excuse me, bros. Hey, thanks. Happy New Year, everybody. I like that everyone's got a lot of good news and 
Seems like everyone's having a good time. That's sick. Just the types of people I want to hang out with. Perfect. Oh, I was looking at the chat. Hey, do you just go now? This is it? Yeah, thank you. Oh, wow. This is a fucking... All right, but is this where you fall off? Forget those guys. They won't all be here next time. I don't remember where it is. It's like around here. That's good. That's still progress. You don't... Like, the lever is going to be pulled now. The other lever. They're shooting guns off, like, Call of Duty lobby out here. Where's out here? <coughs> Just stay inside, dude. The first time I saw that was, like, when I... I think I had just turned 21 or maybe 22. I went to a house party on New Year's Eve and there were like cholos there who started shooting upwards. I was like, wow. Just like the cartoons. That's like Yosemite Sam shit. I didn't know people do that. <laughs> like, you know, just shooting your guns in the air. Cool. Um, don't do that if you... I mean, I'm not your mom. Do whatever you want, I guess, but... Um, the important thing is you stay inside. That's a big deal in the hood. <laughs> Where the hell do you fall? Is this it? Oh, these dumbasses are dying. What a bunch of morons. That one seems kind of smart. How smart is he? Damn, he's the smartest one ever! Fuck you, bitch. Stupid legs. Uh, oh! This guy's trying to kill me. How do you push? Oh! Oh my god. I, I, I wanted to kick. Is he dead for good? What? No way. I didn't know that. What the hell? His bones went from all the way downstairs and they got sucked all the way back and reassembled. Well, anyway, he rolled off the cliff. Uh, is it here? Oh, is that it? I think that's it. Okay, make sure you're fully loaded and I'm going to go off the cliff right here. Okay, now reload your shirt and then... Is it in that hole? Oh! <laughs> I'm out of here! Fucking bitch. Don't you sit inside the coffin? Is there a coffin in here? Hello? No? Oh, dude, the guy's chasing. One of these coffins is open. Is that it? No, that one's already occupied. <gasps> oh! Is it in here? I missed it? Uh oh, look at this fucking guy. This one? No, that one's Occupado. This one? No. What the fuck, man? Uh, this one? No, this one? No, this one? Where the big guy is? Oh, thanks. I didn't know that. This one? Nice suit. Found it. He didn't see me. Happy New Year, Miko. Hey, thanks, Afrodina. Happy New Year. Thanks, Sticky Greens and Quick Sickness. Thanks, One Pink Lighter, please. And Don't Panic. MK Ryan Seacrest. Bach. Thanks. Thanks, Crystal Melody. Happy New Year. Big smile. Oh. Uh, hey, thanks. That's a lot. Hey, you know, you're really funny. Hey, she's pretty funny. 
Anyway, thanks. Thanks, Hosho Show. And a man called Nova. And thanks, uh, Maxon. And Am Fuji. And Hamet. Thanks. Thanks, bros. Oh, yeah, I'm getting messages. Happy New Year, everyone. Excuse me. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Messages and shit. Don't drink and drive. Streamer of the Year smile. You need the Eye of Death from the grave for the Grave Lord? What's the Eye of Death? <laughs> Thank you. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> Thank. <laughs> Thank you. I'm trying to get the Black Knight axe. Oh, I have to go get the thing behind the big guy. Oh, I could do that. All right, bitch. I want that thing behind you. Ha! Oh, yeah! F oh! oh! Hey, thanks, sorry. And thanks, NP Mango and Empty Pockets and Garfeld. Thanks, break time, pumpkin pie. <laughs> Is it really break time? Break time pumpkin pie. Pumpkin pie. <laughs> uh, let me try one more time. He got lucky. Cool. Oh, I spent some time with my cousins yesterday. That was really cool. They're all so like good at being adults and shit. It's amazing. They're all smart and, you know, have degrees and are intelligent. It's pretty impressive. Two of them are pretty girls and one of them is a dude. Ouch. My uncle's two kids and my aunt's daughter. But there's a huge gap between our ages. I think th the oldest one is 26 or something. Thank you. Um, 40 year gap? It's not that big, bitch. Speaking of, ouch, what the fuck? Uh, speaking of, I have a couple of things to do before I turn 40. Man, I also gotta figure out what kind of midlife... That didn't count. Crisis to have. I haven't decided. 50? Yeah, that's gonna be later, though. But for now, I'm concerned with 40. I only got nine months left. That's soon. Buy a dog? That's interesting that you said that. Other people have been suggesting I do that as well. I might. Start roiding? <laughs> okay. It's another idea. Uh, what? <clears throat> hey, I know you're drunk, but do your best to not say stupid shit. I mean, I said I'd be nicer next year, but you guys gotta help. Because, I mean, I could just, like, um, not be nicer easily. I reserve the right to not be nicer while still feeling as though I'm being nice. What is this guy, dude, with the fucking flamethrower? This guy could see so far away. Oh, what the fuck? When did that start happening? Oh, you just killed that guy once, right? 
If you kill that guy one time, then that guy's gone forever. I know, Tiger Shot. Stupid bitch. I forgot about that. It's a one time only. That's why. They patched that out. Yeah, sure they did. Thanks, Doc Daily and Yerby Mate. And oh no, she knows Madik too small. Um thanks. And empty pockets. I don't know if I've thanked you guys. Sorry. And Fudrick. Thanks, bros. Great time, Shaloshaska. Oh, come on, man. Dude! Let me just do one more try and then I'll take a break. Thanks for playing this game. This game's tight, but it's not like there's much else to play. I mean, what the fuck is everyone playing? Um, you know? People are playing that weird ass game. Like, you know that game that people are playing. What's it called? <laughs> the one where you gotta talk to your fucking friends on Discord. Yeah, Lethal Company. That's how you know there's like fucking nothing to play right now when people are playing that shit. <laughs> Thank you. That game is tight. Yeah, yeah, that's my point. This is exactly what I'm trying to tell you. Thank you. I'm not saying whether or not it's a good game. I'm saying there's nothing to play to the point where people are willing to say that that's a good game. Good? What's even good? That's in question here. What's good? We need to like identify your opinion of good before we can even continue this shit. Because if your opinion of good is, let's say for example, let's say you suck dicks with your ass, right? <laughs> Okay, so then don't you think if that's the case, then we're going to disagree on perhaps what good means? Man, where is the drop? Is this here? No, is it there? Is that it? That's it, right? All right, all right. <laughs> Thank you. That's it, right? Right here? Fully, fully loaded though. And don't get shot by Tiger Shot. Sagat's over there. Perfect. Oh! Oh, what the fuck was that guy doing? I'm on break. Man, what the hell was that guy doing there? Yeah, thank, you. <sighs> thank you. I'm on break. Uh, thanks, Cossum. Hey, DDR Muchacho. Happy New Year. Thanks. Uh, thanks, Michael Jackson, Dicks off. Thanks, Cholo Socks and yeah, Faze Alec Baldwin you. and Stock Daily. Thanks, Yerby Mate and Jake and everyone. That guy shot someone in the face. That must be not that sick for him. Right? That's crazy. That must not be that sick for him. <laughs> or the other guy. It was planned? Woo. Damn. Is that true? I'll pass it along. Pass it on. Uh, thanks, Jake. You know I heard that shit was planned. <laughs> From a reliable source. God, they are dumb. Let's see here. I'm on break. Five to seven, please. Lightning! And shit. Poof. Love that song. Happy New Year. Everyone's all turned up and shit. Me too. Is that Ace Ventura? I haven't seen that movie in ages. I like part one. I like the setting of part one. Part two's fine, but the jungle, not that funny. You ate 10 churros? He's fat. 
10 churros. <coughs> I mean, I like churros. But 10? Ah, fuck. He's from San Antonio. Is San Antonio the fattest place on earth? Because I think it's the fattest place in the U.S. And the U.S. is the fattest place in the world. It is. Whoa. <clears throat> I wonder what it is about San Antonio that makes, uh, makes them so fat. Butter water? Cool. Butter water. <laughs> cool. God, would you fucking leave me alone, dude? Churros? It's all the culprit of churros? Churros kind of got ruined for me the way ramen did. If you go to Japan and have ramen, ramen gets ruined. And if you have those churros that I had when I was in Amsterdam, man, <laughs> those you. were the best churros on earth. Yeah. Excuse me. They were so good. Oh, fuck. Ah, shit. Oh. Well, I need to get there to kill that guy. He's right here. This is my destination. I just, when I get there, I need to be not dead. Need to be alive. Those churros were really good. And the girl making them, she was making them in really large batches. And so the thing that she was using to like fry a huge batch of churros required quite a bit of work to really, you know, she had to really put effort into it, which caused all types of stuff to happen. So, it's quite the memory. I found those churros from miles away with my nose. Maybe not miles, but maybe at least like, felt like miles. I found that shit from miles away. If we had to walk, could have been, I don't know. It was far. Hey, how far was it? You were there, right, No Pants? Oh yeah, you were there. How far was that, dude? It was like a quarter mile. I got winded. I remember it being pretty far. I found that shit with my nose from a quarter mile away, dude. I'm not even fucking around. I wanted that shit. I didn't know it was churros. <laughs> I just knew that I wanted it in my mouth. And I just told him, listen, shut up, No Pants. Follow me. And he did. And it paid off. I found that shit. That's totally not what happened? What happened, dude? You're full of shit. Thank you. What? What are you talking about? There were other people there, but they didn't go with us, right? They were like... When the mission started, people... We're like, no, and they left because they didn't believe that I could find the churros, right? I don't remember who was there. There was a group. We were with a group, but I remember just you and me being there for the churros. Like everyone abandoned the ship. I think it was longer than a quarter mile. It's true. You know it's true. You're, uh, you're remembering it wrong, unless you're remembering it the same way I am. What did I, what, which part didn't happen? It was like two blocks. I got the plain churro and you got the Nutella? This guy's making shit up, dude. <laughs> Thank you. Man, those churros were good. Which part are you making up? Then one of the babies looked at you. Shut up, bitch. And you see, he doesn't remember anything right. 
probably inebriated. Um. Oh, the skull guys. Okay, you can't. Ah. Uh, are you sure that I have to go in this coffin? Is that how you do this? I want to get the no. No, no coffin. All right, cool. Uh, then I'm going this way. Oh God. Oh yeah, you go through this hole. And then, oh! That's the guy. <laughs> Man. That's the guy, right? All right, I got him this time. Does he guarantee drop it? No, huh? I think it's gotta be lucky too. No? <laughs> Is he a one time no respawn enemy? It's a one in five drop? Really? And it's a it's a one in five drop and it's a one time only? So if I have humanity, how much humanity do I have? I need some humanity then. I got a couple. I'll eat these four before I beat his ass. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks, Dr. Philium. Anybody getting lucky? It's been a pretty fun PoE league so far. I like it. <coughs> Dropped a div, a big div. Um, I'm almost there to a mage blood. Got a brother's gift from a stack deck. The best card I've gotten from a stack deck this semester is the the cat one. The insane cat. The one for a corrupted mage blood. I sold it for 11 divs. Dude, you know, I don't know how lucky I've been getting, but I've been, I feel like I've been getting really lucky with heist. I found, like, so many really rare, rare lol. Is it rare? I don't even fucking know. I found, like, all of the good bases except for the amulet. Multiples of them. I And I split all of them. Yeah, yeah, I'll watch out for the, the guy. Yeah, how rare are they? I got the, I got the distillery belt, like, three times. And I got the helical ring, like, three times. <laughs> like, how many times are you gonna get these things that are expensive? Uh, did you ever hit that axe roll? Hey, check out the Twitter, kid. I got the best axe in the world of PlayStation. Uh, thanks, June, bro. And K Plox. Thanks, Philium. And Dusty and Sakowitz. And Zoramir. And Jack. Thanks, E Town. And Public. <coughs> thanks, Mike. And Jake. And Bromo. Chazzy. <laughs> and. Uh, Yarcia. Happy New Year, everyone. Glad we all made it. Uh, yeah, my PS5 broke. Do you guys think it's really broken? No pants, like, had instantly, he was like, well, we better check the warranty instead of, like, trying to come up with a solution. Um, I feel like they're, you know what my solution was? Uh, I left it turned on upside down. So, like, the idea is, if it melted and went downwards because of gravity, if you turn it upside down and then overheat it, then it'll remelt in the other direction and fix itself. So that's what I'm trying out. I don't know if it'll work. That's my idea. We'll see. Puzzle God. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know what the fuck's going on, man. It doesn't work. I tried, like, a lot of different things. I tried a lot of different things. You know? I can't figure out what's wrong. I know that it's not the cable. 
I know the internet works. Ah, fucking son of a... Oh, no. Watch out for the guy. Wait, what's over here? Oh! Now, what are you supposed to do about this? How am I going to get down there, kill that guy, without dying? I'll show you how. There's probably an update. What? What did you just say? Dude, my mouse speed is insanely fast. Uh, an update that is downloaded and you might need to install it. Well, how the fuck do you download an update when you don't have access to the internet, dude? I don't know that the, the thing that that guy said that broke... You know, like, I saw this video a long time ago, and it said that if you have your PlayStation 5 vertical, it's gonna break. And I was like, yeah, whatever, suck my dick, bitch. And all I can tell you is I have one PS5 in the living room that's horizontal, and it's working like a charm. And one in here that's vertical, and it won't connect to the internet. I don't know if that shit's true or not. I'm just putting two, to, two and two together, or... Whatever I'm putting together, I'm putting it together. Everything. Download the update on USB from PlayStation's website. What do you think about this guy? Shoot him? Yeah, thank you. Nah, don't shoot him. Happy New Year. Uh, but, is he right? How could it be an update? It won't connect to Wi-Fi either. Thanks, Giant Robo and Key4. Happy New Year. Good shit. Fuck, failed three, enlightened, corrupts now. Ouch. But isn't that a one in six? How could you say fuck? <laughs> isn't that a one in six? You could easily fail ten in a row and it wouldn't be without, like, uh, you know. It's one in eight? Dude, you could fail a lot in a row. <laughs> I didn't know it was one in eight. That's not good. But... It doesn't go up eight times in value, does it? It goes up, I feel like it goes up maybe four or five times in value. I assumed it was a one in six. New Year's Eve food, I ordered a pizza. It was good. Um, yeah, I'm doing great. I'm overall very satisfied with my 2023. Thought it was pretty cool. They all can get weird sometimes, but still good. Nice. Hey, happy new year. Uh, I don't drink alcohol, I have gout. But I do like it. I like alcohol. Being drunk is pretty fun, as long as you're responsible. You might need to accept a new TNC so you can connect to the internet. Hey, what is this guy talking about? Is this, am I about to say some stupid shit? TNC these nuts or something? <laughs> no? That guy's drunk or me? Oh, terms and conditions? <laughs> I've never heard anyone call it TNC. Alright, well, cool. Um, what? Why is this shit only happening to me? This didn't happen to anyone else? What the hell? Am I being, uh, whatever it's called? Targeted? Is 
there a fucking ladder? Oh, yeah. We need tr Ouch. What the fuck? Ladder PvP? Alright, you mother... Oh, no! Get out of there! Now, what are you supposed to do about this scenario? The guy's downstairs somewhere. These guys are unkillable, right? Oh! What's up, bitch? Not you! <laughs> Thank you. Are these guys unkillable? How dead is he? He's gonna be reassembled. He was he's reassembled. Drop down, quit, and reload. Ow! Drop down, quit, and reload. Nah. Oh! What's up, bitch? Ah! Fuck you. Oh! You got a little homie? Okay. What's up, motherfucker? Oh! Ah! Perfect timing! I'm stuck! Ah! Oh, the timing was good! I got fucking stuck, dude! Ah! I, the timing was good! I mean, I would have been home free. Rolled off the cliff, then gotten killed by... Um, uh, those guys down there. Oh, wait a minute. If you, no, I was gonna say, what if you go down there and then get killed? You have to touch the bonfire down there. Man, ah, uh, thanks. Me, Mish Cube, and Bo Bobo. <coughs> thanks, Giant and Key Four, and <laughs> the you. the Sea Man. And moldy guava. Ooh, I had passion fruit for the first time. I took my cousin home and my aunt gave me passion fruit. Have you ever had that? I've only had passion fruit flavored stuff. But I've never had the actual fruit itself. It was so good. And some of the most weird looking alien shit I've ever seen, dude. It was really good it was weird it had seeds but you don't even chew it it reminded me of clams oh no oysters it reminded me of raw oysters except it was delicious and not gross um it was really good super tart i like super tart fruit it was really good i would recommend it Highly. I would highly recommend it. I had never tried it before. Passion fruit. It looks, from the outside, extremely dry and, like, leathery. Ow! Bitch. Oh, my God, dude. These fucking guys. Did he die? <laughs> Thank you. Hey, Happy New Year. Apocopter. Oh, dude, that guy is camping me. Hey, thanks, Appreciator. And Panda Sandberg. What are you supposed to do about this fucking guy camping down here? There we go. That's what you're supposed to do, bitch. Okay, then what? Next plan. Uh, get down there. And then save and quit. Are you sure that's a good idea? I don't know how far down to get. There should be two dads coming up these stairs, right? Oh, you can't fucking slide. Oh, God. Dude! Ah, fuck you. Excuse me. Okay. I'm going to climb down these stairs now. Weird stairs. Oh, what the hell was that? Oh, oh. No. Oh, where's the hole? Ah. Okay, okay. Okay, now what? Oh my god, it's a fucking nightmare! Ah. Where's the other guy? Oh. Oh. Oh, 
Oh, where's the guy? There's supposed to be a hole there. Hey, Happy New Year. Oh, I have to spoil that guy's focus. Well, how do you spoil his focus? Oh, God. I know how to spoil his focus. So I've been doing it all wrong this whole time, right? You're supposed to go the other way, dude. Happy New Year. Halfway, not all wrong. Half wrong. So Happy, what? what are you doing, my friend? Shut up. Don't tell me how to drive. Merry Christmas. Hey, huh? Hey, uh, thanks, a blue Aladdin de sewer. And appreciator. <laughs> thanks, guys. Thank you. Thanks, shivs. Okay. I gotta get past Sagat. That's where I'm supposed to go. Instead of falling down the hole. You fall down the hole if you want to get the Grave Lord S word. But if you want to get the other thing, you got to unlock the bonfire because it's going to fucking be like a million tries. So this way, then let me kill these dudes and chill. Mm. Glad to see you going straight for the OP. You're missing a G. Is something wrong with your... Year G. Anyway, I'm not going for that dumb fuck. Oh, and Happy New Year. I don't know why I called you a dumb fuck there. Maybe it's just because I don't like you. But, Happy New Year. Why don't I like that guy? It's weird how some people will just rub you the wrong way, right? It's hard to explain. The Rave Lord? <laughs> The Rave Lord sounds <laughs> Sounds like a cool boss. How do I get to him? I'm gonna try that guy out. Rave Lord. <laughs> nice typo. I like you now, by the way. <laughs> now that you're funny, you're cool. You got lucky though. What do you do about this fucking guy? I went the wrong way again, didn't I? I did. Oh. Okay. Well, I'll just readjust my shit. I'll go up here. Oh, no. You got ladder PvP. Oh, what is the deal with these fucking guys? I'm not even allowed to slide down that ladder, but they are? What is this shit, dude? How is that allowed for them? Hey, get, hey, get in this hole. Rolling for Beavis. What? Okay, good. Now you get in that hole. Asshole. Uh, thanks, Ivana Jerk Menov. And thanks, Obstinate Orange Octopus and TDC and Fo Das Fox. Hey, what are you looking at? And hey, Riot Kitty. Smile. Hey, Riot Kitty. Uh, Happy New Year. Thank Someone you. earlier set, uh, donated with a name that said Happy New Year, Riot Kitty. And like no one else. I think you have a secret admirer. Uh, thanks. Happy New Year. Uh, thanks, BC Ragon. Cool. Uh, and. <laughs> Happy New Year. Damn, everyone's taking credit? Ooh la la. I always think about Marty thinking that he got the the sports almanac and he's so relieved finally after all this fucking effort I got the sports almanac and then he opens that shit and it's just the book cover and it's for Ooh La La magazine magazine lol first of all secondly it's a porno magazine 
And he can't believe it. He's like, ooh la la. This is my life on the line, dude. Ooh la la. Love that movie. This is not the right way, dude. Go up that ladder. <laughs> Get out of there! Where is he? Hey. Hey. Where is that guy? Oh, is that him? Are those him? Can they get up here? They sure weren't moving around like they can. They probably gotta go up there and drop down. You think they'll do that? <laughs> uh oh. I hear something. Maybe they're stuck. Well, I need to. There's a BKH around here. Or a Black Knight. Okay, there's activity. I don't know where that sound's coming from. Aha! Oh my god, dude. Mama Mia! That's one less to worry about. Oh, two less. They're forgetting about me. God, they're dumb. Oh, wait. They remembered. All right. Take the shit! Uh-huh. Ah, uh-oh. Okay, okay. Okay, moves. Yeah. Okay. Oh! That didn't go well. So, uh... Hmm. Where was the guy? I wanted to kill that guy. I got him this time. Nice try, pumpkin pie. <laughs> pumpkin pie. <laughs> pumpkin pie. I got beef. Hey, thanks. Eat my ass. And thanks, some some big nads. And and everyone. Happy New Year. Baby girl. That guy was offended, dude. What you mean, baby girl? <laughs> I look like a baby girl to you? <laughs> That's such a funny thing to be so offended about. To the point of threatening. Like, some of these guys will threaten. Like, they'll show their gun. Because this guy gave him a pink lighter. They'll show their gun. Like, damn. I heard that's a big deal, though, in the hood. It's like that, dude. Just for a pink lighter. Tiger shot. Tiger shot. Okay. Okay. Now, don't drop down. Go over here. Let me kill this. Oh, God. First, let me... She runs? Oh, my God. She runs for it. Look at her fucking run and get your ass over here. This isn't going to kill her, is it? It did not. No. All right. You know what? I'm going to let you live. Fuck. Uh. uh hey, thanks, yell me. And flows off. Happy New Year. One hour left for me. You guys are in the future. I heard it's pretty cool. In the future. I should uh, maybe grab a slice of pizza or something. <coughs> Ten year sub? Who, did I miss it? <laughs> Thank you. Which one? There's a lot. Uh, thanks, Panda Unleashed. Happy New Year. Thanks, Fox <laughs> Thank Gaming. You. Thanks for gifting five subs. Twenty 
2024 is overrated? You're just doing it wrong, dude. Fucking scrub. I need to start rolling my flasks for our Mage Blood City. I'm I'm probably like 20 divines away from a Mage Blood. And then I'm going to start magic finding. Or I'll try it out. I've done it a little bit. It's pretty crazy this semester. But I'm going to magic find with bone shatter. See how it goes. Are you going to do the shout? I heard it sucks, but I might try it. Did you do heist? Yeah, I did heist the whole time. I was just saying how lucky I got. I think I got lucky. I guess I don't have anything to compare it to, but it feels like I've gotten a ridiculous amount of profit from heist. Like, the things that are highly expensive and none of them are available on PlayStation, I found, like, all of them. I've been supplying the entire PlayStation League with heist bases. I found, like, <laughs> so many of them. The only one I didn't find is the amulet, but all multiples of the belt, multiples of the rings, and I split them all. Oh, man. Oh, man. I also came up, like, crazy twice i dropped two fractured amethyst rings that had t1 fractured intelligence and i just threw a couple of essences uh that give stats and sold both of them for 10 divines each <clears throat> they rolled t1 t1 t2 stats and of course i catalyzed them before i did the roll so those are like huge profits I did stuff like that. A lot of stuff like that, actually. This league, I did a lot of crafting for morons. Those fucking lightning arrow cucks. I, last league, I played lightning arrow. So I knew what these fucking scrubs want. And I know they don't know how to make that shit. So I made that shit for them. And sold it at a premium. At a high price. Scrubs don't know how to play. So I had to make that shit for them. I was like the guy downstairs. You spoil my focus. I was crafting shit for these dumbasses. That's basically how I made most of my mage blood. That and fuck. That and um, heist bases and stuff like that. From heist. Man, heist is crazy. But I'm sick of it now. It got to the point where I'm no longer interested in any of the chests except currency. And at that point, I think it's time to move on. So I'm pretty much done with it. <clears throat> Do you have the channeling mana craft? Um, you mean non-channeling minus mana cost? Is that what you're talking about? Yeah, I have that. But I didn't craft them with that. If they didn't have... All I did was I just crafted life on that shit and sold them for 10 divine each. I just rolled them with essences. I got... T1, T1, oh god, yeah, I'm okay. T1, T1, T2 attributes and put life on that shit. I have the craft, yeah, but there was no room on that, those rings. It's That's not how it rolled. If they rolled with life, I would have put that on them. I'm not going to waste any more fucking shit. It was like an easy turnaround for uh, omniscience builds. This is not the right way, dude. Fuck, what is the right way? I don't even... Oh, alright, alright. This is the last try. This is the last button check. Uh, but I'm gonna still give it a try. Like a college... Oh my god. Okay, good. Oh! That is not fair! Alright. Alright, look. I'm going to go unlock the guy. Unlock the guy. That way you can just attempt this multiple times. I'm going to unlock the guy. I got this. That was not fair. He's fucking straight up as soon as I landed. Bitch. Yeah. You Excuse know me. I never liked you, Rip. Thanks for streaming. Smile. Hey, thanks for liking my stream. Happy New Year, Capone and DB Blues. Oh, you. <laughs> 
Just watch Twin Peaks. Here's your cut. Hey, all right. Thanks. Happy New <laughs> Thank Year, you. Stanny. And Mr. Boris. Happy New Year, everyone. Good shit. Nice work. The chat room is such a huge part of my <laughs> day and, like, life that it's impossible to not at least, like, acknowledge how big of a part of my year being good involves you, you know? So, good shit. Nice work last year. Ah. This time. Damn, fireworks like crazy today, obviously. Yeah, man, that guy gets me every fucking time. Okay, okay. First thing I need to do is kill Sagat. Get over here. Oh! Bitch. Kill this motherfucker. Dude, these guys are assholes. Assholes. Oh! Don't shoot. Oh my god, another one? Oh. Kill this fucking guy! Aim at the right guy. Okay, forget it. Forget that guy. Oh, fuck. Uh. Oh! Fucking moron. Hey. You too? Oh shit. Get off my plane. Oh! No! Ah! No! Oh, come on! Harrison Ford Air Force One, dude. What the fuck? Hey, thanks, E Warlord. And Sentient. And thanks, Lego Feet. Thank and Super Wario World. Uh, thanks, thanks for gifting 10 subs. I think I'm gonna have a slice of pizza on the break. I think I could do that. Happy New Year from Spain. Hey, greetings from America. Happy New Year. Thank you. Hey, thanks, Boodles. Thanks for all the generosity and whatnot, everyone. Thanks, River Pond Lake. And Air Fryer. Happy New Year. Good shit. Next year is going to be a good one. That's what I heard. I heard that from No Pants. Heard that next year is going to be really good. I wonder in what way. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, thanks, Anonymous. Hey, thanks. Thanks. Hey, Valdezzi, thanks for the tier three. Happy New Year. Good shit. We made it. They said it couldn't be done. God damn it. Oh! These fucking guys, dude. All right, this time this guy's not going to hit me. Yeah! Oh, he did. And they're going to kill me. Man, fuck! I got it this time. This game's so sick. I love how you can start in so many different ways. From the beginning. Uh, thanks, Arcanum. Happy New Year. Yeah, Tekken's coming out really soon. I'm surprised that there's... It feels like there's literally nothing coming out between now and then, but I'm sure there's some <laughs> Lego Star Wars or some shit coming out between then. But I'm pretty hype about it. I'm excited to try it out. Hey, thanks, Uni. Thanks for the five gifted subs. Thanks, Isaac. 
<laughs> and Boodles. <laughs> Thank you. Um, my bad if I missed anyone. Lego feet. Another year of laughs. Thanks, happy boy. Yeah, I laughed a lot too, obviously. I usually laugh way more on stream than off. Some people are pretty funny, though, that I know. But you know what's weird? All of the funny people I know, when I see them, we all kind of, at some point, bring up how... Where are all the funny people? It's like we laugh so much when I hang out with people that I think are funny that it's weird. Like, nobody's funny, dude. <clears throat> it's really, really rare. It seems like it was more common back in the day, but I think it's because everyone got dad debuffed, right? I just heard about the dad debuff. <laughs> if you become a dad... You stop being funny. I didn't really know that. I've heard of dad jokes. Of course. God, dude. Fucking Sagat. Okay, one down. Okay, two down. Kick this bitch off the cliff. Get lucky. Alright. Thank you. Now, if I could somehow manage to... Oh. I could somehow manage to kill that dude. That would be sick. I wonder if I can do that by maybe aggroing her homies first. Oh shit. It's a Mexican standoff. Oh! Alright, very funny, bitch. Fucking curved bullets. I'm out of here. Fuck that guy. Oh! Don't go anywhere! Kill this bitch! Oh, she's buff! This damn piece of wood's no good! Uh, alright, alright! Oh, Psycho crushed me! Oh! Alright, then, I okay, after that try, I now know that I, I'm not going to be able to kill her. This weapon I got, it doesn't do any damage. So forget that. I'll let her live. She got lucky. That's not even what you're supposed to do, dude. You're supposed to ignore that. That's the advanced method. Ignore that hoe. And just dodge all the skeletons. Bitch. That's cool. Seems like everyone's having a good night. Me too. A little bit on the hungry side, but a slice of pizza will solve that. Are you allowed to drive while on fentanyl? I keep saying don't drink and drive, but you should probably not f do fentanyl and drive. No. Yeah, you you shouldn't do that. <laughs> You shouldn't even do fentanyl, man. If you if you do that shit, you're gonna be driving a sarcophagus in no time. You know? They're gonna be talking about your ass on the radio. Lol. Oh! Are you kidding? Two hits? Driving under the influence of pizza. Dude, one time my friend Char went to go get pizza. <laughs> Dude. He went to go get pizza, right? So he got pizza and it was in his passenger seat. <laughs> so he thought... I, you tell me if this... I thought this was so funny because the, when he told me this story, he didn't really... He, kind of just grazed over this part he got in a car accident on the way back but he really kind of grazed over the part where he decided to start eating the pizza <laughs> on his way home he was eating the pizza 
I thought that was so funny that he he got a pizza and he was eating a pizza while driving home and he's Korean. Let's not I don't know whether or not that matters. Okay? I'm just giving you a clear picture. So you can decide whether or not that has anything to do with it. But he's Korean and he decided that he was going to eat his pizza and he got into an accident. But I think the accident was not his fault. He was innocent. So he's currently being framed right now. I think that's what I remember. I thought it was so funny that he was eating the pizza on the way home. <laughs> and he thought that wasn't weird. Like, what? You? I went to get pizza. What do you mean? Like, dude, yeah, I know you went to get pizza, but you don't usually eat it while driving on the way home. He thought it was totally perfectly regular business as usual. Eating a hot, hot pizza. I mean, right out the oven melting while <laughs> driving. I thought that was a little weird. I never eat while driving or anything like that. Even in the car, like, same way like in here. I don't eat in here. And I don't eat in the car. I don't like greasy fingers and greasy steering wheels and greasy controllers. Hell no. Not even taquitos? No. <laughs> Not even taquitos, dude. I know. I know what you mean. Shocking. Not even taquitos. <laughs> yeah, dude. No taquitos. I love taquitos, though. I especially love flautas. You know the ones that are, like, fluffier? Not so, like taco shell like the really fluffy flauta ta taquitos man i must have eaten a million of those at that um that last evo that i was at i think it was 2019 the last evo i went to is that really right that's crazy it's like a lifetime ago <laughs> thank you uh thanks eel zap Appreciate it. What is a flauta? Did you mean to hold down that button on the bottom of your phone so that your phone would ask you that? Is that what's going on here? That's the kind of shit I ask my phone. Hey phone, what is a flauta? Happy New Year. Greetings from America. God, what the hell? Fuck this guy. Don't kill Sagat. Just run past Sagat. I got no business. You motherfucker, dude. Kick this guy off the bridge. Roll him up in a carpet. Throw him off a bridge. Oh! Oh! Bushwhacking sack shooter. Alright, now we got those two dads. All gotta do is wake him up. Hey, over here, bitch. Ah. Then he's gonna go overboard, but I gotta dodge this guy's tiger shots. Are you gonna go overboard? Yeah! Perfect. Okay, now, this guy. Hey, over here, bitch. Go run past him when he falls on the ground. Okay. Perfect execution. So that guy's gonna jump off the cliff. After he breaks the bong. He's pissed. He's mad I called him pumpkin pie. Okay, now I gotta go in here, top speed. But ignore this guy. Oh, I forgot about that guy. It's no problem, I don't give a fuck about him. Oh, are you kidding? Oh my god, I hate that guy! Two, two swigs. Oh, arrow. Right turn. Okay, now this is gonna be a little finicky. Oh! 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 No! Yes! Serpentine. Don't shoot! Oh, she fucking did! Get up! No! No! I can't believe it! 
shit, of all the things, this fucking guy killed me. Oh, I'm gonna get this bitch when I get back. Tiger. Uh, break time, Shalashaska. Man. Uh, thanks, Napkin Box and Eel Zap and Unox and Tejubi. Thanks, Cypher Black. Uh, for the 20 bucks. Blood work, roast beefers. Thanks, guys. Thanks, Mulder Knight. Hey, thanks, King Zen and Woody and Gandhi. Thanks, bros. Happy New Year. Congratulations. You made it to 2024. I heard it's going to be one of the greatest years ever. Little Fishy told me it'd be something like this. Dude, you know what Vandiri says? One of his voice lines is, he goes, I'm old. But you'll die sooner. That's one of the sickest things I've ever heard, dude. That's one of the sickest things I've ever heard. I'm old, but you'll die sooner. That guy is tight, dude. Uh, thanks, Das Fox Gaming. Thanks for gifting five subs. I'm going to get up and do a stretch, and I'm going to eat a slice of pizza. So factor in chewing time. Patrick Chewing. Uh, what the fuck is going on with my mouse? Something occurred. Man, can you believe my PS5 broke? I'm pissed. Hey, do you guys know how to fix it? I'm calling all the PS5 experts, all right? If you know how to fix my PlayStation, let me know. My PS5 won't connect to the internet. It's like you press the small button on your mouse. Are you fucking kidding me? You, what small button? This? This is not a button. Is that a button? What the hell does this do? It doesn't need to be red or green. Whoa! Wait a minute. It's, it could be blue? What does blue mean? There's like 10 colors. What is DPI, dude? What color should it be? Red? Nah, red's too slow. I think green is just right. Uh, hey, thanks, SSJ, dude. Hey, thanks for uh, helping me with that. But I didn't ask you to fucking help me with that. Oh, yeah, I guess I did, did I? No, I indirectly, I was complaining about it. But listen, I'm directly asking you to uh, help me with something else, okay? Um, my PlayStation 5 won't connect to the internet. It won't connect with a good cable. It won't connect with a Wi-Fi. It just won't, and it says failed. When you plug in the cable, it says Ethernet cable connected. All right, and then, then it says connecting to the internet, and it won't receive. Why not? Actually check the date and time? Should I do that now? If that works, dude? No way, I don't believe you. You think that will work? Date and time? On break? Yeah, right. You think I'm gonna do that? I'm gonna do that shit on the clock. Fuck you, on break. Yeah, right. You spend 30 minutes a day at the office in the bathroom playing Nikkei. And you think I'm going to fucking do this shit off the clock? Um, <clears throat> hey, what clock? In-game? Sometimes you need to log back into your account? Oh, dude. I better not have to do that because I don't know my password. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, yeah, it says wired LAN and then connected, but... It's like when it tries to, the next step is internet connection and then it's checking, but it never gets it. I did ask No Pants. He said, we're going to have to figure out the warranty. Mama mia. Uh, thanks, Frank Lee. Happy New Year, bitch. Thanks, Frank Lee Manutsic. Thanks. And thanks, Abit. <laughs> My meat. <laughs> Frank Lee Manutsic. Um, yeah, thank you. We're 42 minutes away. I could hear fireworks this whole time. Uh, what do you mean the date? Why would the date matter, dude? 
But you're the second person that suggested it. System, date, and time. It knows, man. How does it know? It's how does it know? That's suspicious. How does it know then? It says 12:31:23, 11:19 p.m. How could it know if it's not connected to the internet? That is suspicious. It saves the date. Hmm. Well, I don't know what to do. My best idea is, since I, you know, I told you, since the problem apparently is that it melted, like there is a goo substance, a pasty substance that makes a connection between a male and a female. And... If you set your PS5 vertically, it gets hot and that goo melts downwards because of gravity and then the connection becomes broken because the goo melted. So my best plan was to turn it upside down and then fucking leave that shit on and let the goo remelt in the other direction. New Year, New Waldo. I don't know if it's going to work, but that's my plan. I'm trying to come up with good ideas here, not just look up the warranty, you know? There is a solution. There is always a way. You have to be, uh, think outside the bun, you know? Unconventional problem-solving skills. Could put a fan on it. You don't seem to be listening. I need to put a heater on it. To melt the goo back into place. Uh, if it sees your router but no internet, it might be firewall on your router. But let me ask you this. Maybe you weren't here. But this computer is plugged in to the internet right now. And what I tried was I unplugged the ethernet cable from my computer, the one I stream with. And this, this thing's hot. This is a live cable. Hot cable. I took it, unplugged it from my computer, and plugged it into my PlayStation, and it was cold. Then I plugged it back into my computer, and it's hot. You see what I'm saying? So, right? What I'm, you get what I'm saying? I tried to use Wi-Fi. I already tried it. It doesn't work. It does not connect to the Internet. Wi-Fi, regular. It's upside down right now. There might be an update for the PS6. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, you guys are saying a lot of high-risk shit. Are you guys drunk? Uh, PlayStation 5 is still using your 2.4 gigahertz Wi-Fi channel. What? How does that have anything to do with the wired connection? The Wi-Fi shit? What? Force an update? The problem is not that it won't connect to Wi-Fi. The problem is that it won't connect to any internet, wired or Wi-Fi. I only tried Wi-Fi as a test. If that worked, then... I would know it's cable related only. Know what I mean? A bunch of drunk nerds? <laughs> All right, well, cool. How's it going? Uh, thanks, Tech Zero and Zero Sleep and Tree Fitty Bong Rips. Thanks, Jeff Fishant. Happy New Year, bros. I'm on break. It's going to start now, though. <clears throat> restart the router dude you have no idea i restarted the router i unplugged the router i fucking unplugged everything i tried a different router you don't even get it dude you think that i don't know what i'm doing right you think wow i know so much more than eris about computers and the internet 
but you don't know shit, dude. I I would run fucking circles around you. You have no idea. I know about it all. I tried all this shit, dude. I'm telling you. I haven't heard a good idea yet from you. Uh, sign in again with your account and it should give you a new T and S accept it. Man, if that's the problem, I am fucked. I don't remember the password for this fucking account. God, I hate passwords, dude. Try eating a piece of pizza. The first piece of good advice I've seen yet. Um... You have to manually choose LAN connection when you plug one in. And you have to switch back to Wi-Fi after. Oh, uh, listen, um, I know. Yes, I tried that manually. Yeah, I know. First fucking thing on earth that anyone would try. First idea that anyone ever had. The original first. Hey, I had that idea too. You know I'm on break. I'm going to go get a piece of pizza, dude. That'll solve everything. What are we going to listen to? That's the real question. It's almost New Year's. Well, for me, I mean. Uh, I think we should listen to this banger. I'll be back. Lightning! <laughs> and shit. <laughs> Poof. Hey, Happy New Year. Don't drink too much. I mean, at least drink some water. Not just gravy either. Real water. Thanks, Hybrid. Thanks, Fast Furious. And Giznad. Yeah. Excuse me. Thanks, Charging Spirit Cow. And Giblets. Citizen Erectus. Thanks, guys. There's an earthquake in Japan? Uh-oh. Uh, that sucks. Let me Google it. Earthquake, a big one, in Japan. Uh, strong earthquake prompts tsunami warning northwestern coast. Really? 7.4, that is big. 7.4 is fucking huge. Holy moly. Whoa, is that a live... Uh, action replay? Whoa. It's shaking. I'm a Californian, so we eat earthquakes for breakfast, you know? Like when people say, oh, there was an earthquake. Holy fucking shit. Holy fucking shit. That's a big ass earthquake. Those walls are made out of paper too. Holy moly. You gotta hit that shit like a uh, uh, snake. Call me snake. He rides the wave, tsunami wave. He's never even surfed. And he just got shot in the leg. And he rides the tsunami wave and then jumps off of the surfboard onto a moving car. It was trying to get away from him. One of the greatest movies of all time. Um, I wonder what's going on over there. I hope everyone's alright, but man, how could everyone be alright? 7.5 is a ton. 5, 5 is like, you could eat that shit for breakfast. Assuming that the buildings are not made out of like corn uh, or Xboxes like Kowloon where it says I don't know where but it says strong earthquake prompts tsunami warning for Japan's northwestern coast that's crazy I wonder if there's any videos I saw videos did you guys hear that like the ocean overflowed in California and people died that's crazy. Yeah, thank you. Like the ocean just overflowed and just like fucked people up. Yeah. Literally like it was like a horror movie or some shit. Crazy. Hmm. Yeah, earthquakes are pretty weird. Um, well, anyway. Yeah, thank you. Hope they're all right. 
Uh, thanks, Shin Goki and Ferrari Beats and Hybrid. I like, um, I'm, I find them fascinating, you know? I, I guess. Hey, am I gonna give up on this whole PlayStation thing? My PlayStation's still on. Yeah, Ventura Beach, is that where, or where it was? Ventura, I don't know where it was, but it was in California, SoCal. Uh, have you tried a network test? Thank you. What's a network test? I mean, my internet works. I mean, I'm on it right now. You could see me, right? Can you hear me? I think my PlayStation's broken. What's... Okay, when you go to the PlayStation 5 and then you go to uh, settings and then you go down to network, right? When you do that, on top it says wired LAN and it's connected. And then the next thing it says, like the next step is internet connection. And it says checking. And it just checks forever. <laughs> and then it says failed. <laughs> Thank you. Put it horizontally. I will eventually once I remelt it back into place. Uh, test internet connection is what you're saying. But when you do that, it does the same thing. It, it always tests the internet connection without you having to test the internet connection. It automatically tests the connection, dude. Like, yeah, it's doing... All this did was did the same shit. It says, well, basically, it's more itemized, right? It says, obtain IP address, successful, internet connection, checking, and then it's going to say failed. You know what I mean? What's the problem? Um, my PlayStation 5 stopped connecting to the internet via wired or Wi-Fi, and it's not the cables. It's not my, it's not the connection, the, like a hot wire that's working on another device. When I plug it into the PlayStation, it doesn't like it. It's been this way for like a day and a half too. It's not like right now something's down. Is it connected to an ethernet switch? No, it's got a cable going directly from the PlayStation into the router. Factory reset it? What does that mean? Do I have to log in again? Because I, if I have to log in again, then I, that means uh, I'll try that first. Any software update? It doesn't connect to the internet, so I wouldn't know. Have you tested the internet cable with another console? I just fucking said it, but... I unplugged the cable that's currently connected to my computer, which is giving it internet. And then I plugged that cable into the PS5 and the working cable did not work on the PS5. Then I plugged it back in the computer and it worked fine. My phone is connected to the Wi-Fi and the PlayStation 5 won't connect to the same Wi-Fi that my phone is connected to. LOL, so patient today. I'm, I'm, I've turned a new leaf, dude. Mr. V told me the only leaf you know how to turn is the kind you smoke. When I told him that, I wanted him to let me back in the class. He didn't. He kicked me out. I was framed. I was. He just didn't like me. Anyway, I've turned a new leaf, dude. It was auto shop class when I was in high school. Guy was a bitch. He had big ass hot dog ears. Fuck that guy. Change the DNS on the PS5. Sure, but what does that mean and how do you do it? Change the DNS on the PS5? Uh, wait. Check your advanced settings by pressing start on wired connection. Uh, uh, by pressing start. Advanced settings. Okay, I'm at the advanced settings. DNS settings automatic. Manual? There's two choices. DNS settings automatic. Even though it doesn't connect to the internet, a pending update may be blocking use of the internet. That's one of the solutions that people mentioned. Like I should use a memory thumbstick. The network adapter on the PS5 might just be fried. Yeah. 
8.8.8, what's that mean? But probably won't work. It's probably an ISP issue. Internet service provider? Is that why my fucking computer is streaming right now? And why my phone can connect to Wi-Fi and my PlayStation can't connect to the same Wi-Fi? Did you just want to talk? Is that what your plan was? Just, let me just chime in. Hey, all right. Uh, thanks, Key and Smelly Fart and Mint Kyle. Hey, thanks, Salty Beezy. Thanks, Happy New Year. Thanks for the 10 gifted subs. Uh, primary DNS, secondary DNS. Hold on. Settings manual. Whoa. I've never done this before. Why did, do I have to put the dots too? Invalid character. Oh, they, I have to put the dots. Oops, hold on. One sec. Does it end with a dot? There's no dot at the end? How many eights? Done. Okay, I'm gonna try your plan and then say okay. Nothing else, right? Leave it. I did eight, 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 and then eight, eight, four, four. With the dots correct. Proxy server don't use, leave everything done, right? I had pizza for dinner, what did you have? I just ate a slice on the last break. It might F? Well, it won't F for you. It's not even connected to you. Okay. I, now it's saying connecting to the internet. I feel like it's already taken too long. If it was going to work, it would have already worked. <coughs> connecting to a wired internet takes five seconds or less. It takes one second. It's already taken too long. It's not going to work. <laughs> Thank Tamales you. and pozole? I would eat that. Did you happen to plug a different HDMI into the PS5 from usual? Um, no abnormal behavior has occurred other than unplugging and plugging in the Ethernet cable. That's all I've changed. I've unplugged and plugged in the Ethernet cable. It didn't work. You're, it's not working. It's got a stupid message. Go to settings and check if there's a system update. None of the USB stuff. Just check that. Uh, do I need to change that shit that I just changed back? All those eights? Remember? I don't want to leave a f trail of fuck-ups. No? All right. Uh, do you have a USB to Ethernet adapter? No. Uh, what was the next plan? There was another plan you guys had. If you guys fix this, dude, I'm going to fire no pants and hire you. Uh, someone just got shot. Or maybe I guess I could hire both of you. And you guys could ride around like Batman and Robin. And he could be in the sidecar. He could be Robin. Um, check for system update and settings. But how could it system update? Uh, okay, fine. I will. Don't argue with them. They know what they're talking about. Especially that guy who said it was my ISP. Uh, hey, don't go anywhere, man. I'm going to need you for this. Go to system settings. Go to system. System software. But... Uh, I don't... Oh, system update and settings. Checking. It's checking. How could it check? Again, I won't argue with you. How the fuck is it going to check if there's an update without knowing about the internet? It's checking. How can it check? <laughs> How can it check? 
is checking. Worst case, you can swap with the living room PS5 for now. Thanks for the stupidest fucking idea I ever heard. Uh, appreciate that solution. Nice solution. Uh, that's not a good solution. <clears throat> I'm gonna have to, like, uh, buy a PlayStation 5 and then put this shitty one in there and then return it. <laughs> now that is a solution. <laughs> that is a solution. Uh, that I could get behind. And then order a pizza. Dude, I am a genius. It didn't fucking work. I mean, it's still checking. What am I supposed to sit here and watch this shit check all day? How long does it take to check, dude? It's not going to work. If if it's checked this long, that means it's not going to work, dude. It checks. If it worked, it would check in 10 seconds. Leftover sausage spaghetti. Uh, what? Get the PS5 Slim? I really hope that's not the case, but... Uh, just give up? I heard the PS5 Slim is shit. Man, shut up, bitch. Uh, hold on. Settings, system, advanced, reset options, reset network settings. Whoa, look at this fucking guy. Hold on. Uh, what'd you say? Uh, settings, system, advanced, settings. I'm gonna go back to step one. Ah, excuse me. Um, okay, I'm in settings. System. There's no advanced in system, dude. Uh, there's no advanced in system. Are you looking up some fucking ancient shit? Reset options? I don't see anything like that. Date and time. System software, maybe? Oh, reset options. I found it. You skipped a fucking, uh, you skipped a uh, step, dude. There's a step you skipped, but it's cool. We found each other in the middle. Uh, reset network settings. Reset options. Okay, well, listen, we lost each other because it says clear learning dictionary, restore default settings, reset your console. Those are the three options. None of those are what you said. He obviously has internet access or he wouldn't be streaming. So the issue is PS5, which probably means reset to default options. Uh, yeah, yeah, I know, man. You said a lot of shit there that, like, everyone who is not an asshole knows everything you said. So, <laughs> except you. you. You know everything you said, but you are an asshole. Anyway, listen, man, I'm trying to be nicer here. Yeah, I know about everything you said. Uh, uh, which one of these should I pick? Don't shoot him. Hey, don't shoot people unless they're bitches. Was that guy a bitch? All right, maybe you could shoot him. Thanks, Boom2 and Komari. Hey, Happy New Year. Troubleshooting my way to 2024 in style. If you reset, you have to sign in again. Oh, my God. Mierda. Wake me up and let me fix it. Uh, Thanks. W whatever and uh everyone else oh thanks again salty beasy happy new year bros don't drink and drive but have fun next year's gonna be sick i could smell it from a mile away like churros made by a beautiful big tittied woman take the ps5 to the pawn shop oh man <clears throat> Let's see what happens if I push restore default settings. What? Enter your console restriction passcode? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I don't have that. 
What? <laughs> Thank you. So it's just a bunch of zeros? Should I do it? Whoa, zeros worked. The following settings will be restored to default values. Uh-oh. I'll have to log in again, won't I? I'm not going to do that yet. I'll keep it in mind for a last resort. Because uh, if nothing else works, I'm going to have to try that. It just seems... <laughs> I don't know. You. you guys probably know better than me, even though it doesn't seem like it. Thanks, <clears throat> thanks Gamma Kuma. And thanks, Frog. And, and everyone. Dark Bravado. Try setting static IP on the PS5 settings where you change DNS. Uh... You didn't drink for New Year's? No, I don't drink because I have gout, but I like alcohol. It's just uh, that it's really bad for gout and it will cause me to not be able to walk. Um, uh, okay, system. Fuck. Hold on, let me, let me retrace my steps. Network, settings, setup connection, advanced settings right okay so now all these eights and shit are still here what did that new guy say uh he he uh he had an instruction and he was like do it where you did the other thing okay now i'm where i did the other thing but i forgot about the instruction step number one uh try toggling connect to the internet in settings uh, i've done all that kind of easy shit dude If you try the cable on your PC, you would remove the cable as a possibility, TBH. Are you an asshole, dude? No shit, bitch. I did that. I just got here. Thanks for the great advice. I already fucking did that, man. Happy New Year. Yeah, TBH. Uh, <laughs> um... What was the thing I was supposed to do? I tried that in two different ways. You know what else I tried? I took a different, unrelated fucking Ethernet cable. I ran that shit. I walked with that shit in my hand. And pulling it when it hit a snag. I was so pissed. I was like, Gah! pulling it when it hit a snag. And I plugged that shit in. And it fucking doesn't work with this. But it works with the other device. I mean, it's like, like, I've tested all this shit, dude. I tested so many different things. A lot of people are saying re-signing in fixed the issue. Something to do with TOS. Wow, a lot of people are saying that. Man, re-signing in, though. Um... I'll never fucking do it. it I'll be, it'll be lost. I don't know what the password is. It's uh, it's tied to, like, you know when you say I forgot the password? It sends an email to an email that I forgot the password for. <laughs> and then when I try and retrieve that password, it asks me for security questions that I've never even heard of. Like, it's asking me for these, like, questions like, what? This can't be my security question. This has never occurred to me. You know? This... This, oh, I hate logging into shit, dude. Logging into shit sucks. Um, uh, time for a new account. What about all my sweet achievements, dude? Uh, log in with a new account to test if it's true. How do you do that? Uh, hmm. That's an interesting. Wait a minute. You can't do that. If you're going to fucking log in with a new account, that means you're going to log out with an old account, right? And that's going to make me have to need my password again. Who got banned? Me?
Oh, it's New Year's in five minutes. Just let me know. Create a new profile. Settings. Account. Oh, when I click users and accounts, it's not even like loading that shit. And when I try and click accounts, it doesn't work. Why are you counting down, dude? It's like in five minutes. <laughs> Thank you. Excuse me. They're already shooting fireworks outside. I'm hype. Is a router from, what'd you say? Is a router, shut up. Um, then ISP has to add a PS5 Mac address. I don't know what you're talking about, man. This shit worked fucking yesterday. Hey, happy new year, Nick. How's it going, man? Uh, are you meant to sign in again if you can't connect to the internet? Yeah, that's another great question, too. Maybe during that process, during the login process, it asks you to uh, agree to something. And then that passes a step. That's what they're saying. Network setting options, network connection you're using, forget, reconnect. I did try that, but I'll try it again. Uh, three minutes left. I did try that. This is what I did. I go to connection, I go to settings, set up internet connection. Then I push start on this and I say forget. Yes, I forgot it. Okay, it's forgotten. Now push start again and I go um, advanced. No, that's not what you do. You go set up internet connection, set up wired LAN. <clears throat> do I say advanced settings or connect? Three minutes left. Reconnect. There's two options. It says advanced settings or just connect. Just connect. Advanced. I don't know why you guys won't agree on anything. Uh, IP address automatic. DNS settings automatic. Proxy server don't use. MTU settings automatic. Uh, all right. Well, I unplugged. I mean, I network... Connect. I'll just try connect, see what it does. It says connecting, connecting. I feel like this is what it always does. And it's already taken too long. If it was going to work, it would have been done. Is there anything in downloads? You mean you think I got attacked? You think it's an attack? Um, what'd you say? Network settings set up. It didn't work, by the way. Uh, set up connection, advanced, change, MTU, try three of these. Uh, uh, advanced, MTU settings, manual. Hey, what are you looking at? Made it to 2024. Here's your cut. I'm not going to fuck with this. It sounds like trouble. Hey, uh, thanks, President Eleven and Obelus and Festive Foliage and Roxy and Fruit Pie Magician and Grego. Hey, Happy New Year in one minute or less. Less than a minute. Thanks, Trunks and Gamma Kuma Wow. Thanks, guys. Uh, happy New Year. I'm getting messages and stuff. It's exciting. Is the fireworks loud? They are. <laughs> they Thank is. You. Um, it's got nothing. Hey, happy, happy. I can hear them. They're getting crazy outside. Woo, woo. Happy 2024. It's going to be sick. Damn, that shit sounds like guns. Man. Everyone's saying Thank Happy you. New Year. Oh, yeah. Hold on. I want to say Happy New Year, too. 
Ooh, did you hear those big ass bombs outside? Holy moly. Oh my god, dude, that was a 7.5. Uh, too soon. Um, that was a big doozy though. Dude, they are crazy out there. Holy moly. Oh! Did you hear that? They are fucking going crazy, Fuck dude. Jack Miller, Fox hey, Day. Happy New Year. Me too. I wish I had some kind of explosive fucking Afghani rocket I could shoot in the air. Cool. Damn. That's hype. We made it, dude. That's really, really good. Trust me. You may not realize it, but that's pretty tight. Not everyone did. Not everyone gets to see 2024. As long as you make it through this one, you'll live long enough to see GTA 6. Oh my god. That's illegal. Where are the cops? Happy New Year. Damn it. It's crazy loud, dude. They're close. Fucking street punks. Uh, hey, thanks, Chen Tai and John Man. And C. Drake and Shadow Boy and Ashterio and Dubin and Creative Kid. Whoa, whoa. Excuse me. Happy New Whatever. Hey, thanks, Bonnie. It's new. It's called New Year. Uh, thanks, Ganon Perps. Thank you. Oh man, that one was like a combo of explosions. I bet it looks cool outside. I really like 4th of July because of that. Because it's like uh, in every direction, you know? No matter where you look, it just is like sparkles. It's pretty cool. It's like an IRL benchmark test for a really good computer. It's pretty sweet. This shit has good graphics. Hey, what are you looking at? Happy New Year, Baldy. Hey, fuck you. Thanks, Toad. And... Uh, Altar of the Sky uh, and everyone else. Just because I said that I'd be nice doesn't mean I won't erase you. I'm old, but you'll die sooner. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I love that line, dude. I love that line. That's one of the sickest things I've ever heard, dude. I'm old, but you'll die sooner. That is so sick. <laughs> Uh, thanks, Taco Face, and good year incoming. Yeah, yeah. Make way. Mm. <laughs> the trophy's mine. One year of watching you. Hey, thanks, Claire Redfield's pussy. Thanks, man. I've been thanking you that many times, dude. Thanks. <laughs> Thank you. You wouldn't happen to also be Ada Wong's pussy, would you? <laughs> you don't you're not also Ada Wong's pussy, are you? Just just a just wild guess. Uh and also um Tifa Lockhart's pussy. <laughs> Thank you. Are you also Tifa Lockhart's pussy or are these three different guys? Oh my bad. I'm profiling. My bad. Just someone that l reminded me of you. You know? My bad. My bad. Honest mistake. Uh, thanks, Greg. And Cloudmeister. And Meowing Ocelot. And thanks, Mushy. Um, what were we talking about? Oh, yeah. You guys are fixing my PlayStation. So did we come to a conclusion? Set up internet connection. It failed, by the way. I did the thing you said. Remember you said forget and then set up a new internet connection? Uh, it failed. <laughs> Thank you. Manually set the IP? I don't even know how to do that. <laughs> the trophy's mine! What does that even mean? Um, like, it's so weird. It, 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 you... 
Okay, when you go to Wi-Fi, right? When you go to Wi-Fi, it shows all the Wi-Fi networks and it shows the strength of their signal. And then when you pick one, like the one that I have, you know, mine, it tries to connect. Whoa. It connected. Okay, nobody move. Nobody move. If it's connected and the Wi Fi is working, <laughs> thank you. What's the next step? 2024 was the answer? <laughs> you think it will connect? No. If I try to connect it, just. No. Hold on. I, I won't accept that. Set up wired LAN. I'm just going to say connect. If it works, I'm going to be so pissed. Wi-Fi connected. <laughs> Thank you. Wired doesn't seem to work. But why did the Wi-Fi connect? What the fuck, dude? It's not the cable. I'm trying it. I already tried it. It says connecting to internet. It's not going to work. It failed. I already reset my modem. I tried a different modem. <laughs> I tried a different modem. Luck used up on Wi-Fi. Hey, thanks. You can't use up luck, you fucking scrub. Thanks, IP freely. This guy doesn't even know the first thing about luck. It can't be used up. It's not a resource like that. You moron. Anyway, uh, thanks. It's ISP router blocking MAC address. It it needs to be add in allowed list. I kind worked at ISP. <laughs> Someone just got perma banned. What'd you do? Hey, why'd you perma ban that guy? <laughs> Thank you. That guy got perma banned. First ban of 2024. No pants doesn't like you, bitch. Happy New Year. <coughs> oh, I have to call the ISP? First perma ban of the year. Factory reset is the quickest way to confirm it. Yeah, but that's not going to work because... I don't know how to log into my account. Hello, ISP. It's me, Arachnid. Yeah. Excuse me. Thanks, Dana Scully's pussy, and Danny and Elbow Drop, and Five Finger Turkey. Excuse me. Uh, oh, check for updates when it's connected to Wi-Fi. Wait a minute, but it would have already updated, dude. Right? Automatically updated. Okay, but I'm connected. Look, I'm, I'm connected right now with Wi-Fi. So now what? Check for updates. System. Uh, software update and setting. It says up to date. It says up to date. Happy New Year. Thanks for liking my stream, bros. You have the latest version of system software. Yeah, it's a new leaf. It's a new leaf. I have some pretty big uh, resolutions. What about you guys? New you survive? You could do better than that. Minimum survive. Uh, you could do way better than that. Don't die. I mean, that's all your resolution is. I mean, a fucking anything of could not die. You know, that's pretty easy. Buckle up. Don't do fentanyl, and you won't die. Do a little better than that. Losing weight. Me too. I'm trying to lose forty before I turn forty. That's gonna be tough, but I could do it. 
It's probably your router not giving the IP. Yeah, but look, the thing is, like, I, I, I know what you're doing right now. You're trying to be, like, helpful, right? But I don't need a problem. I need a solution. A, like, telling me why it doesn't work, it, it doesn't help. You need to fix that shit. Solution. You want to quit your job? You should. If you want to, what's stopping you? If you're afraid of, like, what you're going to do, you got to believe in yourself and you will fucking do it. There's nothing wrong with having a little bit of fire under your ass that makes you move around. You're too comfortable anyway at that shitty ass job. That's really what it is. You're just too comfortable. You should be a little uncomfortable. You could use a little discomfort. You know, that way you'll get a better job. A little discomfort is good. Oh, you. <laughs> Happy New Year. Here's hey, thanks. Weather. Thanks, Kojima's Kojina. And festive foliage. And thanks, Raiden's pussy. Oh, Raiden's. <laughs> You're a man? Thank you. Uh, thanks, K-Bean. And Sean the Sniper. And everyone. Uh, Happy New Year. Thanks for liking my stream. I'm honored. I am. Nice year. Uh, maybe <laughs> USB update. Dude, it doesn't... Like, like, I'm currently connected to the internet with Wi-Fi on my PS5. Connected. <laughs> Thank you. It says, System software up to date moving on um uh what were we talking about <laughs> thank you hey thanks Pelosi and anonymous and inverted reality happy new year bros cojina and titties yeah, I guess that's a good point. I don't really know why the fuck the Wi-Fi connected this time. It's so mysterious. I tried this multiple times. It could be the PlayStation 5 is broken, right? All that's left is logging in now? <laughs> what? Dude, what do you mean all that's left is logging in now? Uh, thanks, Applesauce. Let's get some Dark Souls. There's no let's. <laughs> Thank Stupid you. Bitch. Uh, I'm trying to solve this problem, dude. New leaf is uh is going to get returned. I'm going to unturn that leaf. Speaking of lettuce mains, isn't it crazy how shitty salad is until you're actually eating it? Like it sounds like shit before you eat it and then after you're done, you immediately think the salad sucks. But while you're eating it, it's all right. Like I ate this salad yesterday. I got a, I went out with my cousins, I got a chicken Caesar salad, it had a bunch of stuff in it, shaved parmesan, it had like a little avocado on top, tomatoes, it was a fancy salad. And while I was eating it, while I was ordering it, oh by the way, the guy who worked there recognized me. Uh, and my cousins were all hype. I was like, dude, they're everywhere, man. They're everywhere. I don't even... It doesn't even surprise me anymore. But... <clears throat> anyway, um... Uh, the salad was good. I forget what I was getting at. Oh, yeah. Salad sucks. That's what I was getting at. Isn't it crazy? Salad sucks all the time, except while it's in your mouth, it can be good. But you immediately forget how good it is. Because of the idea of it sucking. It just... It could be good. Did he get your order right? Yeah. And I don't think he put any cum in it or anything. Because it was a fancy place. It was like a fancy salad place. Uh, which was weird. But it was good. 
No, no, no. Way fancier than Panera. I wish it was Panera. I would have fucking gotten turned up, dude. On that good stuff. Panera lemonade, dude. If I, I would have got an extra large. Hell yeah. That's the good stuff. Unlimited. Mmm. Uh, thanks, Orange Cat City and Applesauce. I'm connected with the internet, dude. All right, I'm going to try it one last time. And if it doesn't work, ah, then I'll try it two last times. Excuse me. I mean, what the fuck? I mean, what could be wrong? It can't be the cable. It can't be the cable. If it were the cable, it can't be the cable. It could be the port. It could be the port. Or it could be inside the PlayStation. It sounds like your shit's just all fucked up and retarded. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks for that advice. Sounds like uh, that guy might be right. Hmm. <laughs> Thank Thanks. You. Thanks, Pancake Mix. And uh, everyone else, Happy New Year. If your Wi-Fi is connected, then it's definitely the port. Fuck, dude. What would you do if you were me? Buy a PS5 and then return the broken one? Or sell it to, like, a heiress fan? Like in Dumb and Dumber. Sell my dead bird to a blonde heiress fan. You know, selling it is, doesn't solve anything because I gotta figure out how to log into the new one. Oh, no. How am I gonna log into the new one? Sell it to Kenny? Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. Damn, these fireworks are crazy. Hope everyone's okay over there in Japan. Uh, they had an earthquake. I guess I didn't look up the videos. I, I did see one, a live streamer, like, uh, they had an earthquake. It seemed big. Yeah, they're going to be shooting fireworks for the next three days straight, dude. What do you mean they're still shooting fireworks? They've been shooting them since 9 p.m. It was just like the 12 o'clock moment where it was really crazy. Happy New Year, green name. Thanks, Nevermore. They've been shooting since March. Damn, they never give up. They take three months off? What about... Oh, yeah, yeah, you're right. It adds up. Illegal lull? Yeah, everything is illegal around here. Isn't it? They just do it anyway. I don't even hear the helicopter. The cops gave up. You, before you'd hear the helicopter show up and like try and arrest them. The cops gave up, man. Ah, fuck it. Let them have fun. Bullets will just go to space, right? Thanks. Hey. Hey, thanks, uh, bald Tesla driver. Thanks very much. Well, I guess I'll give up on the wired connection idea. So weird that it just doesn't work. I'm just doing one last try. There's a possibility to port your plug and port on modern interface there's a possibility to port your I gave up on that shitty ass sentence dude uh thanks happy new year English is hard for the chat dude it's it's the ESL people in the chat dude obviously anyway greetings from America happy new year I don't get it, but whatever. The, I mean, there's always going to be a solution. 
I don't really know it. My next solution is I'm going to buy a new router, one of those eSports routers. I actually did that already, and then lightning struck. Fuck. Happy New Year, bitch. Hey, Happy New Year. Thanks, ESL Second Language. Um, I had a fancy router, yeah, that looks like an upside-down dead spider with all the legs. And then lightning struck it. And it broke. I didn't know you have to put a surge protector. What a fucking... Why don't they integrate a surge protector into the fucking device, dude? Why the hell do you need to just put it in the fucking device, you shitty engineers? Why doesn't this device have... If it needs a surge protector, then fucking pr protect it. You know? It's got a plug. You plug it into the fucking wall, dude. Sucks. Anyway, it got struck by lightning. But I'll buy another one of those. And this one is going to be protected. I'll buy one with a protector. Fuck. Mm, that's my first step. Um, if your house is grounded properly, you don't ever need a surge protector. Those are a scam. Shut up, bitch. Um, can you switch your accounts? If I switch accounts, doesn't that mean I'll have to log out of the one that I don't know how to re-log in with? Like, okay, look, there's a chance that I'll, I'll figure out the password, but it will take possibly a day. Full, straight. Just like straight up sitting here, capital letters on. Oh, that's not it. How old was I? You know, I <clears throat> know it should keep you signed in. <laughs> Thank you. Hmm. Uh, you do realize that the Wi-Fi works and the wireless, the Wi-Fi works and the wire doesn't work, right? They are a scam. Look, dude. Shut the fuck up. I just banned you. You're the second guy who's ever been banned in this year. Uh, if you want to be unbanned, you need to suck on this next guy I banned's dick. And then I'm going to ask him how you did. And if he gives you good reviews, then I'll let you back in. So make sure you do a good job. He's never going to be unbanned. But he will get his dick sucked by you. And as a twist, you need to suck his dick with your ass. <laughs> Bitch. <laughs> All right. Now, Happy New Year. Uh, thanks, Lucy Lou, and thanks, Manuel, and Second Language. Thanks. Um, I forgot what we were yelling about. What did that guy even say that deserved to be yelled at? I don't remember. Uh, I had the same thing. It wouldn't let me connect online unless the new TNS was accepted. A lot of people have suggested that. When I go to accounts, when I go to users and accounts, it says can't display this page. <laughs> Thank you. View details. The DNS server can't be used. The DNS server isn't set. If you selected manual under IP advanced settings or DNS settings, when you set the internet connection for your PS5, verify that primary DNS. Do I have to read all this fucking shit out loud, dude? I'm getting sick of this. Uh, suggested actions. Select settings, network, connection, status, test, internet connection. I already fucking did that, bitch. Restart your router. I did that. Restart your PS5. I did that. Reset your router. Select settings, network, settings, set up, internet connection, and then connect to the router again. I already did that, too. Uh, update your router firmware. What the fuck does that mean? Uh... You're going to have to call your ISP. I did manually punch in 8888. 
No, you don't. Either auto or 8888. I did do the 8888. Undo it? Undo it, huh? Stupid jokes. Thanks, Fernie. System. Uh, no, that's not it. Network. Network. Your PS5 isn't connected to the internet. No shit, bitch. Um, I'll do forget, right? And then I'll go set up wired LAN connection. Okay. Advanced settings. Okay. Now, what is all that shit that he said to do? Is that a he? I can't think of a better way to start 2024, personally. Um, I'm having a wonderful day. I've never been better. And that's the truth. Congratulations, everybody. You made it to 2024. So far, it's pretty cool. I'm halfway there to my solution. DNS on auto? It is on auto. Proxy server don't use. MTU settings automatic. DHCP host don't specify. Ah, excuse me. They're not watching me right now because they're watching a PS5 troubleshooting stream. They're watching because they know every other person is going to say some stupid fucking shit that's going to get them yelled at by me. And when I yell at people and get pissed, I start saying stupid shit about how I make them suck each other's dicks and stuff. That's what they're here for. Stupid assholes. You could try being helpful, though. Stupid little bitches. Yeah, all right, I get it. Lol. He yells sometimes when he's pissed. But you don't have Google? Drunk bitch. Uh, hey, happy new year. Good shit. New leaf. Hey, fuck you. I'm getting sick of these new leaf bitches in the chat. Uh, try restarting the console now that you reconnected via Wi-Fi. That's a pretty cool idea, I guess. <clears throat> but I don't see how it'll fix anything. Hold on. What'd you say? Try clearing the system cache by holding the power button until it turns off. I've done that too, but I'm going to try that again. I like that idea. Oh, wait. My PlayStation's upside down now. <laughs> Why is this thing upside down? Um, oh, whatever, man. I give up. I'll do it later. I'll do it later. You guys distract me too much. I mean, there could be a brilliant idea in here, but it's impossible to find. Uh, hot dog in a haystack, dude. It'd take me all day. Um, but thanks for trying, at least. I put my PlayStation 5 upside down so it would fix it, because it... You know, the internet said that if you put your PlayStation vertically, it's going to break. So I figured if I invert it, it'll fix itself. I don't see you coming up with any better ideas than that. No! Just saying. Happy New Year, Miko. It does double damage if I put it upside down. Hey, thanks, Unbelievable. Man, thanks very much. Happy New Year. Thanks. I really appreciate you. And everyone else, of course. It's been a pleasure. I mean, the year has been a pleasure. Not as good as the next one, though. I know it. I heard about that shit. On the streets. Rumor has it that next year's gonna be sick. Yeah, Happy New Year, everybody. Thanks for the generosity and the solid-ass year. Next one's gonna be good. I mean, if this one was solid and the next one's gonna be way better... That's a good deal. Mm, fuck GTA 6 new Monster Hunter. You must be a pretty girl. Uh, anyway. I think I'm ready for a little bit of pizza. I don't know about you. 
It's always a pleasure hanging out and yelling at you, chat room. It's one of my favorite things to do. You really know how to, uh, like, double up on the old smile. I like that. Nice work. I'm going to be back tomorrow. I have a feeling... Oh! Maybe... I, I was going to visit my mom. I don't know if I'll be back t tomorrow during the day. Uh, We'll see. I'm not sure what's going to happen tomorrow. But I do have a doozy of a game to play for you. It might be trash, but I don't want to spoil it. I have a couple of games coming up. The, the worst kind. But... Until then, thanks for trying to help me fix my PlayStation problem over the New Year balls drop. Thanks, bros. Um, I'll see you in the sewer whenever that is. Happy New Year. And thanks again. See ya. Lightning! <laughs> and shit. Poof. Hello. How's it going, everybody? Are you guys in as good a mood as I am? Hopefully. I'm feeling fucking good. What about you? <laughs> Thank you. What are we making fun of today? On this lovely Friday evening? <laughs> Chilling with Thank your shoes you. off? Do you speak Russian? Nope. Do you? Mm, thanks, Slimeball. And Animalio. Hey, thanks for that new sub. GTA RP, is it back again and it wants revenge? Revenge of the colon? Thanks, Sandwich. Thanks, Vile Vibe. Beeria Pizza. Fuck that guy. Thank you. GTA RP, never really, never really got into it. It came out after I was older than 15. Thank you. You know what's really crazy about that? Like, um, uh, many years ago, maybe like seven or something years ago, this MILF I knew told me about how her kid was into GTA RP and he's eight. <laughs> I was like, oh, I get it now. There are a lot of eight year olds <laughs> on earth. You. you know, that's where all those numbers come from. That really like... Like I was like, who are all these people that like GTA RP, dude? Who are these people? But it turns out they're just little guys. Little guys. I didn't know. That's cool. Mm, anyway, what's new? Nacho Day? Are you talking about... Are you... Is Are you serious? This motherfucker. Are you talking about the nachos that you were talking about last time? Is this guy telling me about nachos two times before he's even made them? Give me an update when those things are fucking ready to go, damn it. Shaved, what was it again? Shaved prime rib nachos or some shit? Thank you. I barely slept last night. I couldn't stop thinking about those damn no the nacho countdown, dude. I'm more hype about that shit than Tekken 8, dude. You know? Those nachos. Let me get a pre-order in on that shit. Deluxe digital edition. Tossing around all night over those nachos. Uh, thanks, Drug Card and Anita whatever. And thanks, Tan Tanatos and Bruzos. Uh, Calo Ringer and DC Yeezy and Eastside Eli, the Nacho Countdown, <laughs> launching it into space. Uh, thanks, Ingvar and King Torture. Th thanks, Megan McCocky Hardigan. Thanks, Megan. Um, Konichi. <laughs> Thank you. Let's see here. Bemphis. Squish. Thanks, Crises. Smile. Happy New Year, everybody. I see dots. Dick Boat and Lapex and Devoid. And anyone I missed, it's kind of hard to tell. You know, I kind of jump around, but then I don't really remember any of these names unless they really stand out like Megan. Um, anyway, thanks. Thanks, Pogi. My bad if I missed your name. Mm, anyway, I have a bone to pick with this Black Knight. The other day I got distracted by 
my broken upside down melted PlayStation and New Year's Eve. But I want this guy's axe. I want that shit. So I'm gonna get it. Uh, thanks, choking victim. You know the Black Knight? You don't know him? Have you seen that movie? The one with Martin Lawrence? It is terrible. And at that time, Martin Lawrence was pretty funny. Remember, he made like Blue Streak and Nothing to Lose. I thought Nothing to Lose was just such a good one. I like Nothing to Lose. It's a funny movie. Um, but then he came out with the Black Knight. Yeah, Blue, Blue Streak is good too. Yes, agreed. Blue Streak is good. And it has the... What's that guy's name that always says, Wow. You know the guy. He's got a big fucked up say jam. Yeah, that guy. It's got his brother in it. Owen Wilson's brother, Luke. Luke Wilson's in that. I like that movie. It's good. <laughs> All I can tell you, sir, is that he's gay. <laughs> That's such a funny scene, dude. <laughs> That's such a funny scene, dude. I like that scene a lot. Uh, thanks, Forsaken Oath. And Pumpkin Pie. Thanks. Hey, you guys are funny today. Uh, thanks, Pills Eater and Pogey. And Choking Victim. That is such a funny scene because he's looking right at him when he says it. <laughs> he's talking to this cop. He's talking to this cop, but he's looking at Martin Lawrence because he's talking about him. It's so good. So perfect. Perfection. The execution on that shit. <laughs> All I can tell you, sir. <laughs> it's so perfect. Uh, thanks, Golfred's Hard Lil Pee Pee. Who? Uh, and the guy from Batman? Hey, aren't they making a Joker Part 2? There are a couple movies that they're making that I want to watch. I want to watch Beetlejuice. That sounds really cool if it's with Michael Keaton, because I like him. Um, and I want to watch the Batman sequel to the new one they made. And I want to watch Joker Part 2. It's a musical? I thought they were kidding when they said that. I ignored it. Never mind. Hold on. I gotta tell someone Happy New Year. Hey, Happy New Year. What a dork. Uh, anyway, thanks, Saz, the mailman. Appreciate it, dude. Eight-year-olds. Watch GTA 5 RP. <laughs> thanks, two asses sucking on 22 dicks and Chess Master. Thanks. Uh, I forgot what we were discussing. It was probably very important. <laughs> Thanks, L. Thank Trimp, you. the Golden Prawn. Appreciate it. Uh, how did you guys can't see yet? <laughs> Thank you. And computers. They should Thank already you. be voice activated or some shit. You know, Mom. like the one that Professor X uses. They should just connect to your brain and do what you're what you wanted to do. Disappointed in you know technology. You, thanks, Maybe Bong. You. Bong Fleshlight Combo. And thanks... Whatever. Igor. And Mugs. And EMP Vegeta's Hairline. Thanks, bros. I'm getting pretty good at being nice. I, I've been practicing. On stream, of course. I'm already too nice in person. But... Uh-oh. What is the problem? Oh, it's probably related to the mouse, right? Yes, I knew it. Computers always be fucking some shit up, dude. You're extremely nice in person? Yeah, I already know that. You know? Because, I mean, you gotta be. I like being nice in person. It's pretty cool. You get... Cool things happen to you if you're nice in person. You... It's like a video game, really. Like, you build some kind of stat and it allows you to pass these dialogue checkpoints in life that are holy shit dude really i mean 
Dialogue checkpoints in life, you wouldn't believe how important they are. Whether it's the guy trying to hire you or the pretty girl in front of you you're trying to spit some game to or whatever it is, those red letters that come up and if you pick those red letters and that shit says cha-ching, I mean, you know what I'm trying to tell you? You get what you want or like a deal or sometimes people will just do something for you just because. Do you remember... When I needed those Hayabusa buttons, this is an excellent example. I needed those Hayabusa buttons. They're very difficult to get. Someone said, hey, hit up Arcade Shock. They sell them. I hit up Arcade Shock. They were like, we're out of stock. I'll hit you up in a week. A week later, they were like, hey, we're going to send them to you on the house. Thanks for being nice to us back in the day. I didn't even remember ever fucking talking to these dudes. I don't even know who the fuck they are. But whoever they are, I must have been nice to them at some point. And they hooked me up. And I was like, wow, thanks. They said for free. And I was going to pay them. In fact, I would still. You know? It's just a gesture. You know what I mean? So, point being, this kind of shit will happen if you're not a bitch. Uh, thanks, one dad. And thanks, Tanner and Jackster and Bong Fleshlight Combo. Thanks again. Listen, I need to formulate like a real plan. Last time I was just banging my head against the wall. You're never going to get anything done that way. I'm naked. And I want the Black Knight's axe. Okay? So, first thing I should do is get to the Black Knight. Right? And... The best way to get to the Black Knight is to unlock that bonfire. The one with the guy that's made out of bones. They put a bonfire there, didn't they? In this remastered version? Isn't there a bonfire there? I'm pretty sure they added that. And if that's the case, I gotta get there. But how the fuck do you get there? And even if I do get there, how am I going to kill that guy? Maybe I should go get the Gravelord sword and then use that to kill the Black Knight and then steal his fucking stuff. See what I mean? A plan is in order. Just fucking kill him. Yeah, but the thing is, there are a bunch of bone wheels around there, dude. You're not considering that. You're just... Giving me money and saying the first stupid shit that comes to your mind. Comes on your mind. <laughs> I'm holding a fucking stick. And I'm naked. And I'm not a smooth skin. <laughs> Thank you. Alright? This is not just some regular knight. Okay? This is Martin Lawrence we're talking about. In one of the greatest comedies <laughs> of all time. How the fuck am I just going to fucking kill him, dude? You know? But uh, let me get to him first. First things first, let me get to him. Hey, thanks, bros. Okay, Sagat is still over there. Oh, shit. Kick this bitch. Ah. Okay, Harrison Ford, Air Force One. Oh, okay, yeah, that's good. That's good. So far, so good. Now let me wake up these dudes. Nice and easy. It's not a race. <laughs> Thank you. Synchronized. Butt hash. Jack Miller, Fox 30 News. What up, Lord Harris? I'm feeling good. Thanks very much. Butt hash. Jack Miller, Fox 30 News. <laughs> you know? <laughs> You know that people call me Lord Eris in person sometimes? I'll be, literally, I'll be at the grocery store. I'm at the grocery store. Some dude just walks up and goes, what's up, Lord Eris? <laughs> what? I'm over here checking the produce, dude. It's super funny when shit like that happens. What's up, Lord Eris? Uh, yeah, dude. Dude, I got. I went out with my cousins two days ago. I went and had lunch with my three cousins. And the guy who took our order was an Ares fan. It happens all the time, dude. They're everywhere, dude. They're always watching. 
That's the true eye of Valle. It's like Fight Club, dude. Kind of just like look at each other and like, hey, all right. <laughs> you know? We know what's up. Secret shit. Hey, thanks, Zygar and Majestic. Hey, Billy Hoyle. Thanks, man. Happy New Year. Thanks, Donkey Cuh. And a dude plays games. Hey, don't forget to drink water, you know. <laughs> Thank you. How are your treatment to your fans? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> hey, greetings from America, dude. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> That's a good one. Hey, thanks, Afro and Linguini. That was a pretty good one. I like that one. I'll give it up. Kick this bitch. Ugh. You can't kick him until he's reassessed. Look at this sidestepping. What is this? You gonna make this harder than it needs to be? Get to the edge, Pendejo. Wow, nice moves. Fucking leave it to Miyazaki to make <laughs> skeletons be Thank this you. nimble and roll around. Usually skeletons are all rickety in the lore, right? They're just a bunch of bones. But they made, in this game, they're like gymnastic, double, uneven, parallel bar gold medalists. This fucking guy so got. If I could just like fucking What the hell? Oh this motherfucker dude! Oh get out of there! Oh. Run for it! You know what? Why don't you come over here and fucking say that to me over here then? Yeah, that's right. What the fuck, dude? <laughs> All right, I got rid of them. Well, I didn't even really get rid of them because they're all going to be down there when I go down there, right? Because they don't die. Oh, maybe they're out of range from Sagat. So they can't live. Maybe they're out of Sagat's range. I don't know. I'm not sure. There she is. Where's Wald? Ah, get over ATP here, you pieces. motherfucker. This is a one-time only... Oh my god, why you gotta be so buff? And I wanna kill the Black Knight? Beat your ass. Ah, short ass bald weapon. Oh! No, you dumbass! Abort mission. Oh, this fucking guy's over here. <laughs> Thank you. This guy. Give me that shit. Now let me go hit Sagat. Where'd you go? What the fuck? Oh. Man, you always be running! Unbelievable. Run for it! Oh my god. Fuck these guys. You gonna follow me? What the hell? Holy shit. God, that took a shitload. Get over here. Are they gonna come over here? Yeah, dumbass. Okay. What the fuck? Oh! Jesus Christ, I barely... Thank you. He fell too. What a dumbass. Alright, nice. I think I'm ready to fight Sagat again. All her dumb henchmen fell off the cliff. Except this guy. I hear activity too. Man, what the fuck, dude? Jump scares? Where did you go? Man, this bitch! <laughs> Thank you. Are you dead yet? Finally! Alright. Alright. 
Beautiful. Oh, God. Wait, but with Sagat dead, this guy dies now, right? Oh! Oh! <laughs> what? Which Sagat did that? Was that that guy? Didn't I already... Let me try that one more time. Let me try that again. There's another Sagat across the street. But the good news is the first one's dead forever. And that means all of the skeletons can be killed now. I think, right? I forget the rules. Some of these games make it so that you... Like to kill skeletons, you have to kill them like three times. Or their, their eyes are lit up. Or the rules change. I forget. I think in this one you gotta kill Sagat. Because she's the one... Or he or they is the one that is like keeping these dumb asses alive. So God's a girl in this, right? Ah, excuse me. I got to do some thanking, huh? Hey, thanks. Just a sec. See? So God's dead. Perfect. Oh! Fucking scared the shit out of me! Who the fuck was that? Let me see that again. Let me try that one more time. Now, who the fuck was that? Fucking Psycho Crusher, dude. From off screen. Jesus. Bitch. I ordered pizza today. It was pretty good. You know, the usual. Nothing too crazy. No bison. Remember when I was playing that game yesterday? That colon game? And someone said they thought I was playing Street Fighter V. That was a solid, decent one. Decent one. <laughs> Halfway decent one there. Not bad. Yeah, I thought the game was pretty cool. Not the worst five bucks I've ever spent, that's for sure. Where did the other guy come from last time? Aha, this fucking guy. That's where he came from. Sup, bitch? Okay. Hey. Oh, run! Hurry up. Scrub. Oh yeah, I'm getting their souls now. Now that Sagat died. Okay, perfect. Now. Sagat's already dead, but they're the henchmen are still here. I can Oh! There's a guy here. Forgot about that guy. Hey over here, bitch. Chicken fingers. Beat his ass to death. <laughs> Beautiful thanks. dead. Pumpkin pie. Hey, thanks. Oh, I'll do some thanking. That reminds me. You asking or giving? Hey, uh, we'll, we'll trade. Uh, fair and square. Thanks, Blue Raven. Good luck. And thanks for the luck. Uh, thanks, Joe and the Bean, or ESL Bro, uh, and ESL Bravado. Thanks, uh, Liver Slapper. Hey, man. Thanks. Happy New Year. Thanks, Z Long and Bloody Finger, and Gordon and Kerchais, and Jibu and Prax. <laughs> thanks, bros. Thank you. Thanks, Kerchais. 
Appreciate it. You get free hits on... Oh! There's a fuck another guy. Dude, there's so many of these guys in here. What is this shit? Oh, you could stun loop these morons because of the blunt. This is like a blunt weapon. And those guys are weak to blunt like the chat. I forgot about that. Oh. You could just loop it. Now that Sagat's dead, they don't stand a chance. Damn, he's good. <laughs> Thank you. What the fuck are you talking about, dude? Uh, hey, thanks, Eric, for the Twitch Prime. <laughs> you can see him thinking. Man, I looked at that shit, and I didn't know what to think. Do I ban this dude, or pumpkin pie? I should broke my ankles. This fucker. Baby girl. <laughs> Baby girl. I should turn that shit into a sound thing for a donation. Um, Baby girl. Or pumpkin pie or some shit like that. Anything that reminds me of something funny. Uh oh. Come on. Okay, play cool. Thank Don't get distracted. Thanks, palm trees. Ugh. Oh, run for it! Okay. Ooh, I didn't see what you said. You just said, I just read, Eris got any tips? <laughs> I don't know how that sentence ended, but it could have ended in any, any way, dude. Who knows? I'll never find out, thankfully. Anyway. Yeah, I got some. I got tips. Okay. Damn, the range on Sagat, dude. Man, what the fuck? Yeah, thank you. Yeah. Excuse me. Here, over here, bitch. Over here. No! Oh! Oh my god, that could have hit me too. Oh! Oh, I'm fucking dead. Run for it. You stupid ass shitty weapon, dude. I better juice up. Okay. Damn, it's always two of them. Holy moly. Oh, man, I almost fell off the fucking cliff. Be cool. Where the hell did you go? Ah! Sorry about that. What the fuck? All right. Oh, Jesus, what the fuck? Uh, thanks, Trime Cop 3. Is that a typo? What's Trime Cop? Is that a typo? Uh, what's for a big dinner? I ordered pizza. I got plenty left if you want any. Thanks, Palm Trees and Psychonaut and Jotaro No Star. Thank you. <laughs> 
Thank you. Prime cop. Nice typo. Typos can be funny from time to time. Sometimes they really stick. Okay. It's me and you, Sagat. Are you kidding? Okay, okay, so that be cool. Oh my god, what is this timing? I have fucking two juices left. You know what? I don't give a fuck about that. Bitch. <laughs> Thank you. Oh no! Dude, what the fuck? Play it cool. Be patient. Okay. One juice left, but that's progress. Now. How the fuck do you. Oh. Oh god. I may need more juice just to get to the guy, right? Oh no, that was a mistake. Play it cool. Oh fuck. Okay, okay! Oh fuck. Yeah! I forgot how to do it, but the good news is that all of the Sagats on the way there are dead. So now all I gotta do is just go there top speed. All of the Sagats are dead. You know what I mean? That's progress. Maybe the untrained eye would struggle to identify that, but. Thanks. <laughs> hey, thanks, Rika L. Thanks, Lil Motherfucker. <laughs> thanks, Power Outler and Hachinto. And thanks, Big Jimmy Rustler and Overwatch fucking sucks. <laughs> thanks. And thanks, Kaba Bowie. Appreciate it. <laughs> Overwatch fucking sucks is such a sick name. <laughs> Thank you. That's tight. Cool name. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, thanks, Rain X RX Seven. And Elexo. Thank you. And thanks, Robbie the Rabbit. Oh. Don't stop. Run. All of the Sagats are dead, so all I have to do is perfectly dodge every skeleton. It should be pretty easy at my level. Watch this. Hey, thanks. Thanks. Paula is a cheating bitch? <laughs> hey, alright. Thanks. Damn. That's rough. <laughs> sky riding that shit in the sky. Fuck Paula. I hear that. Oh! Play it cool. Hey, thanks. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. See, all the Sagats being dead makes this much easier. You just, it just requires some perfect spacing. Man, the fact that they put these guys here! Get out of the way! Okay. Oh! Yes. Oh! You know I've never liked you, Rip. Well, what do you do Just about that? Car. Here's your oh! Car. No! Fuck a fuck. There's three dads down there. 
Hey, thanks, Sagas. Cool, man. New cars are the best. Congrats. Enjoy it. And buckle up and watch where you're going. Uh, well... Oh! Now, how many fucking... Oh, God. He didn't reassemble. Oh, damn it! He reassembled. Oh, don't fall in the hole, please. No! Oh, oh. What do I do now? Are there gonna be skeletons down here? Fat skeleton, big bone bitch. Yo! This guy's pretty sick. Today is my five year anniversary of finding your stream. I'm glad to be here, bro. Hey, thanks. Thanks, Salem Witches. Happy anniversary. Thanks for liking my stream. You'll spoil my focus. Thanks, Moonshining and Sarcophagus Dev. Ah! Let me try that again. <laughs> that was pretty good, but I got distracted by thanking. Stupid gratitude. Uh, thanks, uh, um, Baticum or whatever, and JDSM. This game is fucking good. Strawberry Cheesecake from Cheesecake Factory? Nice. That sounds good. Strawberry Why seems kind of boring. Jack Miller, Fox 30 News. Cheesecake Factory has all kinds of crazy shit. I would have gone with something crazy. You could get like a Reese's Peanut Butter Cup Cheesecake. Or you could get like a Red Velvet Cake Cheesecake. Or a Pumpkin Pie Cheesecake. Or a S'mores Cheesecake. Or maybe like a Tres Leches cheesecake. Or you've never had a pumpkin pie cheesecake? It's fucking good, dude. I love pumpkin pie, personally. Pumpkin pie? <laughs> Man, that guy changed pumpkin pies for me. Pumpkin pie. <laughs> I couldn't believe it. Man. <laughs> <coughs> oh, fucking guy, dude, every time. Uh, thanks, Gino. And thanks, Obama. And thanks, Armored Prime. And <laughs> Sauce. Oh, ah, nice. Speed. It's all about speed and taking those corners like a knife. Oh, that's not good. Okay. Perfect. No time to heal. This guy needs to cooperate. Accidental jump should be no problem. Motherfucker. This guy right here. Out of the way. Yes. Yes. Okay, there's another Sagat in there. This guy. Walk off the cliff. Okay. Quick heal. Now, maybe I should... Oh, dude, there's so many dads... What happens if you save and quit here? Ah! Fucking stupid son of a bitch! Quit! Ah! Fuck! Oh! Man, fuck! Alright, let me...
let me try that one more time. Let me try that again. For... That's still progress. Your sandwich? <laughs> you dropped your sandwich again? Man, you ought to put one of those things, you know, like a Nintendo you know, like Wii has those things that go around your wrist so you don't drop your controller. You got to do that with your sandwich. You know what I mean? So that when you drop your sandwich, you're like a kid. And then don't forget a sippy cup. Uh, hey, thanks. Thanks, Agent Chieftain. Happy New Year. I don't know what you said. Something about how good I am at video games, I presume. Ah, excuse me. Fall down to the right. There's a ledge you can enter. Oh! This guy is saying a lot of shit. Fucking guy. What did you say? <laughs> Thank you. Hey, thanks, Rebel Rooster. Appreciate it, man. Happy New Year. Any of you guys going to the World Tour Finals? They're soon. Aren't they? Like next weekend. No. Hell no. Tickets sold out early? Didn't like some bot buy that shit and scalp that ass? I think it's so weird that that happens for something that no one gives a fuck about. That'd be like scalping a bot scalping tickets to go see Dane Cook live. Kind of a weird, weird bot. You know? Man, I don't know why I even... <laughs> you guys are such a bad influence, dude. You really are, man. Especially when some shit makes me laugh. I can't resist. <laughs> God, you guys Thank are dicks. You. So what? Dane Cook tickets? <laughs> shit sounds sweet. Don't wake the other guy up. You woke up! No! Two dads! Woo! Hurry up! So maybe the problem that I'm having is that all of these stupid fucking skeletons that are chasing me to the end, they're falling down from above. So maybe instead of letting them chase me all the way to the end, I'll kill them. And then they won't, they won't give me issues later. I say I'll kill them like it's no problemo, but... Like this guy, do I need to... Oh, God. Oh, my God. There's so many of them. That's four, five, six skeletons? What the hell? This shit will take all day. This bald weapon suck a <laughs> cocky. Thank you. Bitch. I skipped them again. Scuffed them. Dude. Dude! No! <laughs> Thank you. Okay. I guess. Now they're gonna fall from above. And then I'm gonna yell. And then you're gonna drop your sandwich. <laughs> Thank you. Seems like they're not going to drop from above. Do what do you do then? Okay. What happens if you save and quit here? They go back upstairs, right? It resets the homies. We good? Oh, finally. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. What? Wait a minute. Don't sit at that fucking bonfire. 
Don't sit at it. Just turn it on. Right? I'll be trapped. I'll be trapped. Fuck. Well, this doesn't help anything. Hmm. Don't sit on that bonfire. Okay. Okay. What if I kill this guy? If I kill this guy... He's gonna drop his axe, and his axe. I don't know how what how much stuff I need to use it, but he's useful. He's cool, but I could use his axe. <laughs> All right, look, there's like a bunch of bone wheels here. So first thing I gotta do is clear them out. Oh no. Yeah. Excuse me. Oh no. Why didn't he get fucking... Oh! Thanks to Bonzi and Mr. Biggs and NFS X Chris and Ninja Zur and thanks Keon and Aranta. This game is so good, dude. Well, all right. Uh, there has to be a solution. What's the solution? Well, I have a few options. One thing I could do is you could drop down at the bridge after the first three skeletons for a shortcut. Yeah, I know. I tried that on New Year's. Uh, I know about that shortcut. What I was originally thinking is that I would unlock that bonfire. That way when I died, I would respawn there every time and then I'd eventually kill the Black Knight. But... I didn't consider the fact that even if I did do that, all that would accomplish is that I'd be all the way the fuck down there with a sword I can't equip, and I'm naked and wrinkly. You see what I'm saying? So that problem doesn't work. What I need to do is I need to do something or equip something that's going to be strong enough to get down there, kill the Black Knight, Get his sword, then homeward bone back here. That's what I need. The Gravelord sword. Now we're talking. Get the Gravelord sword. Now we're talking. The Gravelord sword. That's behind, that's in front of the demon, the Titanite demon, right? The Ravelord sword. I gotta get the thing from behind him, then sit inside the sarcophagus with a PH, and then I get the sword, and then I'll use the sword to kill the Black Knight. Good idea. Beat the Black Knight. Get ready for battle. <laughs> Thank you. So the Gravelord sword is off the bridge. That's what the guy was saying, right? I think that's what the guy was saying. Jump off the bridge. Man, this game is so good. There's just so many different ways to play it, and I think that's a really important part of good games. Which is one of the things about Sekiro that really, it's, uh, like, to me it's unfortunate because I really like that game a lot. There just isn't that many ways to play it. All good games have to have that. Man, imagine Diablo 2. Such an old game. But it was so good at that. Having so many different ways to play it. <clears throat> Excuse me. Yeah, Sekiro is an awesome game. One of the best single player games there are. But it just doesn't have that same replay value. 
unfortunately. My favorite part of that game by far, the most memorable, was the those birds that fly at you from like the like those kites or whatever on the roof. Those things, that was like the coolest shit I've ever fucking seen. The sound they made, the crash landing, it was just so tight. I also liked a lot of the bosses too. What's your favorite Sekiro boss? It's hard to remember. Honestly, it's been a while since I played it. You might be able to remind me. Do you guys remember what my favorite Sekiro boss was? Hmm. Which monkey? The one that has three phases? You should replay it. Um, I kind of want to, but I don't know why. I just don't. It feels like I've already played it. It's a weird feeling compared to the other Souls games, right? I can't remember which fight I thought was the best one, but there were a lot of really good ones. I even really enjoyed the ones where you fight like that bull that has like flames on its horns and shit those oh and the 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 boss that's got a horse that's a really cool boss too the bridge shortcut <laughs> thank you you're right I did thanks for the reminder speaking of hey do you guys know if there is a way oh god don't fucking get distracted do you guys know if there's a way or like some kind of app or some shit that can make your phone <laughs> give you. you like an hourly noise every hour is that a thing? There must be some shit like that. You know, like a clock? I couldn't figure out how to get my alarm to do that on my phone. Oh, what the hell? I don't have an iPhone. I have a... Uh, whatever the fuck it is, the other thing. Samsung. You have to make 24 alarms? There's no fucking way that's how you have to do it. I just want to go, you know, make a sound every time the hour ends. That would be really useful. Yeah, like an old clock. I think that would be really useful. You could tie that to all types of things like stand up and stretch, drink uh, some water, you know, maybe go outside. You could tie that to a lot of really smart things to do. And then that would become a habit and you wouldn't have to do it anymore. One alarm and hit repeat? Are you fucking kidding me? What if I'm busy? Like, I just wanted to say, hey, it's been an hour. Use the clock app and set the timer. What'd you say? Uh, I'm not going to scroll. My mouse is out of order. Snooze it for 60 minutes? Dude, you guys, I'm sure this exists. This is something that clocks used to do. Ooh! I'm sure this exists. And not like some weird bootlegged workaround. I mean like the real way to do it. An egg timer. Nice. <coughs> <clears throat> yeah.
You could do it from the calendar? In your phone? Ah! Man, what the fuck? He was backing up! Hold on. Let me let me dispatch this fucking bitch. All right. What do you mean in your phone? What do you mean in in the calendar in your phone? I'm in my calendar. Then what? Oh, this fucking guy. Who is waking this guy up? He's not dead. If you set the timer on the clock app, you can just restart it every time it sounds. Wow, nice fucking stupid idea that some other idiot also already came up with. That idea is stupid and old. When that shit was fucking fresh, it was stupid. Uh, you think I want to fucking say, okay, thanks, phone, every time? No, man, I just want to know when it's been an hour. Oh, this thing explodes! Does he wake up again? He does. Come on, you son of a bitch! Oh my god, dude. Ginger. Oh my god, what the fuck was that? I have no Estes left. This is bullshit. <coughs> hey, thanks, Kenny She. Thanks, Dookie Shoot. And I teched. Thanks, Nasty Nate and Druzy and Pet Gargoyle. Thanks, Dubonzi and Mr. Biggs. Break time, Ginger. Android store water reminder app? No way. You have to get an app just for this? The calendar? Hold on. Let me know if I'm going to die. Oh, fuck. This guy typed a lot of shit. How am I going to... Hey, don't... Wait. Could someone read what he said and then, like, make it, like, shorter and then tell me about it? I'm in the calendar app. What... What... Schedule. Okay. Schedule. Then what? No, I don't think that's it. Ah, excuse me. Make an event? How do you do that? No events. Why'd that guy get shot? Did he say I can build a nap for you? You meant to build. Uh. Dude, I talked to my cousins and they were telling me about how everyone uses AI to do their homework now. Dude, the world is... It's over, dude. It's over. It's over. That's what they were telling me. Everyone uses AI to do their homework. Isn't that crazy? And they're like... Uh, like su successful and like master's degree types of students. They're like doctors and surgeons and things like that, you know? <laughs> you know what I mean, dude? The guy doing heart surgery on your brain used AI to do their homework. <laughs> I practiced this in VR. You know what I mean? Hey, how do you make an event? A schedule. Week. Schedule. My phone. Year. Month. Day. Oh, fuck. Hold on. 
uh, open the settings app on your device. Whoa. Whoa. Hold on. Settings. Tap notifications. Scroll down to the bottom of the page and select wireless emergency alerts. Um, I don't see that. Let's keep going in this list of shit. Scroll down again, alert preference and select alert reminder. Um, so I got to find where it says alert reminder. Maybe what he said is like old and they've updated the app or some shit. Oh, I found it. Wireless emergency alerts. What the fuck? National alerts, emergency, extreme threats, <laughs> Amber alerts. You could turn these off. You could turn these off. <laughs> Thank you. Public safety messages. Dude, this is exactly like when they were telling me my life was in danger because of Hurricane Hillary. I didn't know you could turn this shit off. Who gives a fuck? Danger sleeping face. Alert reminder. Aw, oh, man. It says... How do you, like... Hey, what was the end of that uh, shit you said? I'm on this page, but I don't see, like, a... When I click alert reminder, it says once, every two minutes, or every 15 minutes. Or never. Could I get every hour? What the fuck is that about? Once every two minutes? Scroll down again to alert preferences. Alert reminder. Choose sound. Play hourly sound ch chime. What? Choose sound? There is no hourly... In alert reminder, there is no hourly. Scroll down again to alert preferences. Alert preferences? I don't see that. Um, you know my phone? If like you're just sitting around, right? And it's locked. If you tap the unlock button like a bunch of times, it calls 911. Did you know that? I've accidentally called 911 on the road while I, because my phone's in the fucking cup holder and I'm Tokyo drifting and the phone just called 911. <laughs> like, dude, are you trying to snitch? My phone's a snitch. Let me fucking drift in peace. Thank you. Fucking phone's trying to snitch on me. Uh, thanks, Chopsticks and Too Much Starbucks and TMO6 and Kenishi. Well, I mean, I guess I got a little warmer, but I didn't, like, succeed. Thanks for the help, though. I'll Google it. Worst case scenario, there's, like, a free app, but I thought that maybe something on my phone could do it. Calendar has hourly for an event on a day you choose. Interesting. I wonder if that can be looped every day or some shit. The idea is I just wanted to, like, a grandfather clock, you know, just make a gong or something every hour. And I can tie that sound to anything that I want to remind myself of. Oh, I need the thing behind this guy. Oh, break time Johnson? Get an hourglass? Wow, because an hourglass is going to do the thing that I just want? An hourglass? An hourglass is going to make a sound every hour. Wow, thanks. What a fucking amazing idea. Incredible. Solved. Problem solved. Amazing. Get an hourglass. Dumb asshole. What is this guy's problem? Are you fucking asleep? Hello? Ah! I'm taking a break. When I get back, I'm going to get the thing behind that guy, and then I'm going to get the Gravelord sword. Fuck. Playing Sub-Zero. Uh, thanks, Mr. Chopsticks, and too much Starbucks. 
I'm going to get up and stretch. It's break time. <coughs> break time pumpkin pie. <laughs> pumpkin pie. <clears throat> what do you guys want to listen to? Want to go fast? I kind of feel like going fast. Uh, but I got to find it. I'll be back five to seven. Lightning <laughs> and shit. <laughs> Poof. Man, a new Donkey Kong Country would be so sick. <laughs> Thank you. Seems like Donkey Kong games are extinct. Like this is a genre that just people don't really want anymore. Like fighting games, you know? Unfortunate. Uh, thanks, Envy Versus and KG Miles. Thanks, Solax and Bucks and Pro App. And thanks, Medicated <laughs> Thank Neil. Thanks, bros. Tekken 8's gonna be fun to learn, though. It's gonna be so <laughs> stupid. Did you guys see the Paul? There's a Paul combo video made by Guck. He's like a KYSG old school 100 year old combo master. This fucking combo video is absurd, dude. It's so crazy. And it's not even out yet. The game is not even out yet. The damage in that game, and you get, see, see like, in Tekken 7, a lot of the damage relied on either meter or rage, right? Like, you could do a uh, rage drive to extend, dude. This fucking game gives you all of your resources at the start of the round. So in theory, you could first thing you do in the round could be 80%. It's really how it seems. I am, I may be wrong. It's just early, right? I, I don't, I'm not an expert, obviously. But in Tekken 8, you get access to all of your resources at the beginning of the round. So the very first action you do could be 80% into wake-ups. Uh, it's crazy. And I I have a feeling a lot of characters will do that much damage. Seems like the game system allows it. But, well, I've only seen that much damage from characters like Kazuya and Paul. But I have no reason to believe that those characters are special. Because the things that they're doing in the combos, it feels like most characters should have similar formulas but maybe i'm wrong nina's damage looks ass i would if i were you i would say just assume everyone has good damage because of the formula you likely just don't know the right thing to do it, i'm pretty sure because keep in mind dude your resource is available at the start of the round so you could almost see it like having rage from the beginning of the round who made the combo video? His name is Guck, G-U-C, and then some numbers. I forgot the numbers, but it's G-U-C and uh, maybe 11. Maybe it's Guck 11. Uh, and he made a Tekken 8 demo from the demo. Pa uh, Paul video. Oh! He's an old school KYSG combo guy. That video is crazy. <laughs> Thank you. Guck KYSG on YouTube? Yeah, that's it. Maybe. Uh, thanks, Dobie Fire and Medicated Neil. And thanks, Pikachu Lee. Appreciate it, bros. Yeah, I'm excited to play Tekken 8 as well. I think it'll be fun. There aren't many times in history. This is, in a way, the first time ever that everyone on Earth is going to be able to explore Tekken 8, like, together. Or a Tekken game, I should say. Come on! Why is he stuck, dude? Why are you stuck? I can't believe he's stuck. He should be fucking kicked off the bridge already. Oh, man. 
Don't get stuck. Oh my god, stuck again. Forget it. Come over here. Whoa, almost fell. Bitch. I can't believe this shit. These guys are really giving me a hard time. What's the drop down? This is the drop down, isn't it? Okay. Oh, the skull. Oh, the guy. Is he chasing me, dude? What the fuck? And he doesn't die, I'm sure, right? Oh, he died. Perfect. Okay. Now I'm here. So, last time I tried to run past him and he... Now I know it's going to be a one, one shot. He's going to kill me. So what I'll do is... I'll aggro him. Hey, over here, bitch! Now what the fuck, dude? You got to kiss him? Alright, well, I kissed him. Come on! Okay, so now that I got this, even if I die, I'm gonna have it. But ideally, I'd like to... Oh, God. I can't see this motherfucker. Is he stuck? He's stuck, isn't he? No, he's just slow. Oh, fuck. Okay, I could be dead. I'm dead. But the good news. There is good news. That thing that I needed is in my pockets now. So all I got to do now is run up to the sarcophagus and sit in it. And then I'm good to go. Tight night demons don't have dicks. I mean... Yeah, that's true, I guess. I'm going to look into that hourly shit. Whatever, even if I have to get an app. It's kind of annoying, but... I have a feeling that's not the case. I probably just have to Google it. I just forgot to Google it and it crossed my mind while I was streaming. That happens a lot, actually. Big fan, thanks for the streams. Hey, that's nice of you. Thanks very much. Thank you. Am I being chased? Thanks, Hourglass Salesman and Corleonezy. Thanks, Pikachu, Lee, and Dolby Fire. Hourglass. It'll make an hourly sound. Good idea. Fucking skeletons. In hot pursuit. Speaking of, any car chases? They're, they've been getting pretty good lately. That guy in the truck was pretty crazy. The de demolition derby guy. Ugh. Oh. Man, this fucking section can eat a dick. Get up. Whoa, I almost fell. Nice success. Yeah, I can't believe that students do their homework with AI. That's fucked up. That's crazy. I can't believe it. I mean, why wouldn't you if you were a student and something like that exists? Oops. I don't blame the students. I just think that that sucks. Yeah, I would too. You, what do you think? I'm saying I wouldn't? No, that's not what I'm saying. I'm just saying it sucks. This is the way the world turned out. Yeah, I don't blame you, dude. What are you, a fucking idiot? You're going to do your homework when there's AI? I don't know how it works or if you'll be caught. It's possible there's a way to detect it. But just in theory, without knowing all the details, it just sounds unfortunate that that's the way the world works. They use AI to detect AI? That's tight. Hopefully it works.
I made it. We need AI teachers. Enter the covenant. Um, I don't know, man. Teachers can be so good, but they can also be so bad. It's such a weird thing, right? And and it's chance based, and like they can ruin your life or turn your life into like they could give your life meaning and direction, or they could ruin it. And it's totally chance based. It's kind of like your parents. There's not much you could do about your parents. Some parents are fucking trash. They take you to Tommy's and let you fall off the table while they're eating chili when you hit your head and become an heiress fan, you know? And then some parents are just fucking good-ass parents and they turn you into a good-ass human. It's chance-based. It just sucks that that's the case. Maybe AI could reduce the chance when it comes to that. I got the sword, but I can't use it. But that's okay. All I need to do now is like... What do you do now? Homeward bone or something? Do I have one? Uh-oh. Well then, just dark sign out of here, right? Use the dark sign. You can get back in the coffin. Do I want to? I guess I could give uh, the Black Knight a try with my bald stick. Since I'm already down here? Why not? Fuck it. I mean, ultimately, I want to kill that guy. He's not gonna fucking... He, I'm gonna... He's gonna kill me. Yeah, I want the Black Knight Great Axe. Before I kill him, I need a bunch of humanity, too. Don't I? So maybe this isn't a good strat. How much... Let me check the stats on the Gravelord Sword. With that sword, I'll fucking cut that bitch in half. Kill Pinwheel? How's that gonna help anything? Sixteen strength, thirteen dex. And what do I have? Uh, I could do that. Maybe. It would be easy to do if I go kill someone. Maybe that's what you meant. Pinwheel gives a good helmet. It's random what helmet Pinwheel gives. Which one are you talking about? Mask of the Father or Mask of the Little Sister? <laughs> Thank you. There he is! You motherfucker! That's him. That's the Black Knight. That's the guy. How's this gonna go? Oh, that's how it's gonna go. Fuck! He's a black knight. <coughs> well, that was just like one uh, idea. But that's progress. I got the fucking sword. Now all I need to do is use it. Uh, and to use it, let me see. Maybe I have some. Yeah, see? Pop all this shit. Use. What, early game, where do you go to get all the free souls? There's like a bunch of free ass souls you could get. You said 16 strength. Look, that's 16 already. Psh, psh. 16 strength and then 13 dex. Uh, I could probably get that right now for free. Uh, use this giant soul right here. 1,000. Okay, I just need one more level. One more level. You have the master key? I do. I do. Go to this area. 
dragon? Where's that? Remember, this is the first thing I did. The first level, the beginning. Man, this weapon is really strong. I haven't done anything, have I? Oh, I got strength. It probably scales with strength, doesn't it? I was just gonna say, damn. There's 1k soul after the door you open with the master key. Okay, cool. I'll head in that direction. Thanks. This is such a great game. <coughs> Anybody been getting lucky? Pretty lucky over here. Nice and smooth. I must say, thankfully. Got my old job back. Nice. Did you want it? Sounds like you did. Congrats. 2024 is going to be pretty cool. I could tell. It's off to a good start, at least. I think the biggest lesson is going to be... Don't worry. That shit's going to work. Don't worry. Jobs suck. They can. That's true. You know I never liked you. Really. You gotta never Not give up though. Vegas. Here's your cut. Oh fuck. What'd you say? Uh, hey, thanks, Dial Lane. Good shit. Congrats. Vegas is always really fun. I like the food personally. Yeah. Excuse me. There's a couple of pizza places that I want to try in Vegas next time I go. That I've learned about since the last time I've been there. <coughs> Chase your dreams. That's really like... Um, an interesting thing to say because you're saying it in like a good way but I don't think it's good advice in the sense that I don't really I don't like to think of them as dreams because they make it it makes it seem so unachievable you know you don't have to like dude who the fuck dreams about this shit just fucking do it you know <laughs> like it's not that it's not that it doesn't need to be so deep yeah it doesn't need to be so deep just fucking do it you could do it when you start calling it Chase Your Dreams, it makes them seem like they're way... Yeah, like Yoda! Damn, you guys always remind me of shit that I already know, but in a good way. There is no try. I mean, it's simple as that, dude. There is no try, dude. Fucking, I'm trying. There is no try, dude. Just fucking do it. And stop whining. 500-year-old green little bitch. Trying to tell you something. Oh, arrow in the hip. Uh, what was it talking about? Oh, yeah, following dreams. Yeah, I mean, yeah, sure. Whatever you gotta do to get it done. Mm. Make it happen, you know? Vegas pizza? What does that have to do with Vegas pizza? Oh, that guy said he got his job. Yeah, jobs suck. Well, now. You know I never liked you, really. Thanks, XTC. Here's your cut. Thanks, I'm feeling good too. That's nice of you. Thanks, Dial Lane and Ben Benis, Venus. Uh thanks, Chipoppy. Uh thanks. Hey Roselle, thanks for the resub. Thanks, Corleone and Hot Spring. Happy Big Friday. Thanks. I don't want to sit at this bonfire either, do I? If I sit here, then I'll wake up here when I die. When I die. But I'll turn it on. Um. Oh. Hey, uh. what are you looking at? How's my favorite titty streamer? I don't know, but thanks, Tommy Tubbs. I'm doing great if you're asking about me. I need to step up my titty streaming game, though. Bro. OK, 
Okay. <coughs> now, I think I'm going over here. Over here. No? Where's that door? There's like a door around here that opens up. Oh. I think it's over here. Oh, three of them? Yes. Okay. This isn't the one you were talking about, was it? I guess I could kill the Black Knight, this one, but I kind of don't want to risk eating my humanities. You think it's worth it? Uh-oh. Three whiffs? Ah, the triple. Nice. Three whiffs. Cheese the knight? Uh, I usually just parry the knight. Is that what you meant by cheesing? I could probably do it. I don't know how many hits it's going to take, though. How many parries. Let's try it. Can you sneak attack him? Wow, you can. Cool. Okay. Ooh. <laughs> Thank you. How many times am I gonna have to do this? Not that many. Nice! Now give me what I want! He didn't give me shit. Damn it. Uh, but at least he's dead and he gave me the souls I probably need to upgrade. Is there anything else over here I want? No, right? I'll just go back. And then that's gonna give me enough money to, um, be able to carry the Gravelord Sword. Then I'll walk that heavy-ass thing all the way down to the other Black Knight. And then I'll kill him with humanity. And then I'll have the sword I want. The axe, I mean. The Havel ring? Uh, well, I don't really need the Havel ring at the moment because you need to have something to wear, right? I don't have any clothes. Do I? Maybe I do. Oh, I got a shirt. Nah, but... Is that me? What? This fucking shirt jingles? It's like George Costanza's pants. Do you hear that? His thighs are rubbing together? I don't want a jingly shirt. I'm taking it off. Uh, I took it off. Where did that guy come from? Didn't I kill you? What? How did these guys wake up again? That doesn't add up, does it? Oh. Yeah, how did they wake up again? What the hell? The bonfire in the undead burg? I didn't sit at it. I just activated it. You have to sit at it to uh, wake them up, don't you? Yeah. What a great game. I think that in the new Souls games, the way they let you roll in omnidirectional directions, I think that's less cool. I like four-way roll. But well, maybe it's just because it's more old-fashioned. I like four-way roll. 
Omnidirectional rolls for noobs. 13. Can I wear this shit now? Why not? Oh, because I'm two-handing it. Nice! Roasting marshmallows for dessert? Just marshmallows? Dude, you should try that marshmallow dip. That's the real shit. You get like a skillet, put the marshmallows down, squeeze some Hershey's chocolate bars in between the marshmallows, put that shit in the broiler, then get the graham crackers out and get to work. That's where it's at. That's the strap. Dip them. It's like, you know how you get like um, spinach artichoke dip with chips? It's the same idea, except with marshmallows and whatnot. Um, thanks, Mozart. Uh, uh, mozzarella. Man, whatever this fucking name is. Thanks. And thanks, Tommy Tubbs. And XTC. <laughs> hey, all right. You guys are pretty funny today. I got a nice fucking axe. I'm gonna kill this guy with it. What's up, bitch? Take this shit. Wow, he's really buff. I thought that would kill him, like, instantly. But it killed him. Okay, what am I gonna use... To kill the Black Knight. Things that I need to kill the Black Knight. Probably some health. Probably some endurance. Both of those things. Well, I'll go with health first. Okay. I'm gonna go kill the Black Knight. Ah, excuse me. Hopefully. If you increase your strength, your attack goes up. Hey, all right. What sword is that, Ka? It's called the Gravelord Sword. You could get it first thing you do when the game starts. But you have to do what I did. I did it pretty easily. It only took about two and a half days. I'm just kidding. But almost. It's called the Gravelord Sword. And it... <laughs> just fucking Google it, man. It's, a, it's kind of a complex path you gotta take. And it's a little bit challenging for you. But, um, yeah, I went in the coffin, exactly. You gotta go downstairs, get the thing from behind the Titanite demon who has no dick. Then you gotta go in the coffin. Then you gotta get the sword. It's like pretty much the cheapest fucking most over penis um, weapon that you can get in the beginning of the game. But it makes you work for it still. It's not like you just fucking get it, you know? Ouch. But it is early. In theory, you could get this shit the first 15 minutes of the game. Or, you know, or so. God damn it. <clears throat> the the um, great scythe. Uh, I think the black knight halberd is better, isn't it? The great scythe. Oh yeah, the great scythe is a good weapon. Can you get it this early though? I don't remember where you get it in this game. That's a top tier weapon in this game, right? I think the running attack or one of the attacks is like so good. It's like a jumping, cheap as fuck weapon. It's like a really good weapon. Catacombs before the mask boss. Isn't that pinwheel? Oh, I missed it. God, he's dumb. Right here? No. Yeah? No, here. Nice who? I did it. 
I'm gonna go play the or pay the Black Knight a visit. Play him. Martin Lawrence. I wonder how many hits it'll take with this weapon. I suspect it's still going to take a lot of hits. And if I fall downstairs, you know what's going to happen. Bone wheel skeletons. Use the humanity? I don't know if I want to yet. I kind of want to do a test run and see how much damage... Because if I die down here, that means those humanities went gone, my friend. Ah! Oh, fucking scared me, stupid bitch-ass skeletons, dude. Of course he's not dead. Oh! What the fuck, dude? Where is Sagat? Sagat is somewhere keeping these assholes alive. There he is. Yes! Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Well, I should have eaten the humanities. Fuck! Ah! Damn! Oh, damn it. Is that the only one? I didn't know I would do that much damage. Oh, I forgot. I have to start over 100% from scratch again? Fuck. Tower by Metal Bull? He has an axe? There's a black knight. That's not a... He doesn't have an axe. He has a great sword. At least you got the strat down now. That's true. What's not that great? The axe? That's what I want, though. I mean, it's not like I'm getting it because it's great. I already have a weapon that's better than it, right? <laughs> I'm pretty sure uh, this weapon is better than the one that I want. In the forest by the Hydra? That guy doesn't have an axe, does he? I don't want the halberd. Alright, well let's try again then. Fuck it. Might as well. That means I gotta recreate. Fuck it. New. What was that character's name? Sex, very female. Class, deprived. Gift. Master key. Hair. This one. Face. Commoner. Physique. Average. Name, please. <laughs> ah, Thank you. Excuse me. Hey, what's up, S. Talon? How's it going? Happy New Year, man. Thanks. Thanks, Tommy Tubbs. And Georgie. Kajina? Was that the last guy's name? Millie Crystal. <laughs> Do you spell crystal with uh, C-H? Is it crystal or crystal? It's with a K? With K-R-Y? Really? Like that? Oh wait, almost. Like that? Kinda? Shut up, bitch. 
Make her fat? No way. Gotta make her skinny. Uh, no. Accept. Okay, this time. Thank you. Do you have to, like... Dang, you gotta start from fucking scratch. Man, people who do this type of shit, like, you know, speed runs every day, must really lose their minds. Can't imagine that. They're all unstable? That's funny. <laughs> That's funny. Unstable. Lack of stability. Hob went hollow? Yeah, he went hollow years ago. Didn't he become a father? That's amazing. Good for him. X2? No way. Wow. Two kids. Usually people have more than one, right? I think I've heard statistically that it's better to have a sibling in a bunch of ways. I wonder how true that really is. Wow, that guy is Unless your siblings suck ass. I mean, I guess the theory is that even if your siblings suck ass, you're probably more likely to get lessons and values from that experience than you are without a sibling. Because I think that the alternative is that you have to end up being more social in general and, you know, like spending more time with people your age without being forced to. Being forced to spend time with someone who's near your age teaches you a lot growing up about lots of different things. But of course, everyone I've ever known who has siblings fucking hates that shit until they're adults. Like, up until the age of like 30, maybe 25. Fuck! 25, they hated their siblings' guts. But now they're adults and it's like, oh yeah, my sibling is like my ultimate homie. But then as kids, it's like you wanted them dead. That's how it seems to be. You like them all the way through? Yeah, I guess that's the case for some people. Yeah, some people are just, they get along from the start. Probably good parents have a lot to do with that too, is my guess. Keep both of your dumb asses in check. In a coast helps. Yeah, I, I could see that, I guess. Depends on the type of relationship. <laughs> In a coast with your siesta. Damn, that does a lot, dude. Holy shit. God damn, he got fucked up. Kids game. Isn't there something else you can do in here? Feels like I missed something. Did I? Go up? I don't remember. It doesn't matter. I'm gonna go get the shit. It's probably not important, baby girl.
Someone just got shot. Happy New Year. Thanks, Dio Head and Night Buck and Deep and Dare. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, now I'm not going to waste these souls because I know I need strength, right? So we'll get that strength that I'm going to use to kill the, or use to wield the whatever it's called. The Sagats are going to be alive again. But it's okay. I know what I need to do. First things first, I got to go get the thing. I got this. This is going to be easy. Yet the last, like, tries, you know, all those tries, they were just me doing button checks. But now I got the plan. Now all I need to do is take this well-laid plan and put it in my well-laid ass. Wrinkly, ghoul-like ass. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. I need to pull the lever. Don't forget that. And don't touch the bonfire, you dumbass. This lever. Oh, what the fuck? Okay. Play it cool. Woo. Come through. Oh! <clears throat> Nice! Get me out of here! Okay. Not bad, not bad. Now, all I have to do is not get shot by Sagat. And not get hit by this guy. Or these guys! Oh my god. Get this fucking guy! Okay, okay, we're good, we're good. Everybody play it cool. Oh! Fuck this up. Oh, God, you fucker! Oh! Ooh. Okay. Okay. Smooth. Smooth. Now I gotta get the thing behind the guy. I've done this many times. Once. Oh, that was an accidental <laughs> jump. Thank you. Ooh, okay. Now I got the thing. Dodge the lightning. Oh, fucking son of a bitch. Okay. Where's the... Oh, did I pass it? And I had it. All I had to do was get in the damn thing. Get in the thing. Oh, now's my chance. Woo! Perfect. I'm good to go. 100% invulnerability during um, coffin lay down mode, right? That's it. Thanks. That was a first try. That was pretty good. Uh, thanks ever play MGS Ghost Babble? No. Uh, thanks 4AM Pizza and Bob Sagat and Tuffy. And thanks <laughs> Thank Cool you. Aid Man. And I feel alright. And thanks Guy Larkel. Thanks, bros. Okay, skip it. Nice. Break time, Shalashaska. Just in time for me to go back down there and kill the Black Knight. Man, this is sweet because it was so easy this time. I like improvement. Yeah, excuse me. Nice, I got it. So now I dark sign out of here. And that's going to take me back to... Uh, yeah, I'll use... Hum I don't have any yet. That's one thing I need to do. I gotta get humanities and I gotta get... Oh, there's some here. I gotta get um, um, three more decks or one, two more decks. However much you need for, you know, 
to wield this weapon. How do you fucking jump down here? You don't? Break time corn dog. You know what I haven't had, but I keep hearing it's overrated? Those Korean style corn dogs that have all kinds of weird ass bulbous shit on them. I haven't had that, but I've heard that they're pretty fucking overrated. Are they good? They look good. Yeah, they're mid. Overrated AF. I like corn dogs, but the best corn dog I had is from Doghouse. It's that one I've told you guys about that has chorizo and then the chorizo sausage in it is stuffed with pepper jack. It's absurd. Pepper jack stuffed chorizo corn dog. This, this motherfucker. You know? Pepper jack is top. Have you ever had a habanero pepper jack? That's the real shit. That's the secret shit. Because pepper jack is good, but it's just like not that spicy. Habanero pepper jack, that shit really fucking... That makes your bald spot steamy. It's good. Um, that's funny you say habanero is a good flavor. In some applications, I don't love it. But it's okay. I think it depends. Recently, I had a Cholula, which was habanero pineapple flavored Cholula. And that was quite good. Habanero, pineapple, Cholula, I would recommend it. It's quite good. M maybe, yeah, you know what it is? I think mango habanero I don't like. But other habanero applications I do like. It's the mango habanero combination that I just don't like. And I've realized that. And I like mango. I like mango. And of course I like habanero. But... Those two things together, they're very popular, but I don't love them. I mean, it's not unreasonable to like them. They, they make sense together. And I just, I don't know why, I just don't prefer it. Maybe the thing is that, for me, mango flavoring really needs to be a real mango. Artificial mango doesn't really taste that good to me. I like a real mango. The flavor of artificial mango doesn't really go. I don't like it. That much. Maybe if it was like some gourmet homemade uh, habanero mango sauce, but that's not that common. Fucking guy. Chinese chicken, broccoli, and spicy garlic sauce. That sounds good. I love broccoli. I mean, I don't like Chinese broccoli. No offense to you Chinese broccolis out there. But I don't like Chinese broccoli. I like regular broccoli. The one that has hair. Yeah, all stem broccoli. I'm not about it. Thank you. Wow, he fucking sidestepped. That is bullshit. He's gonna fucking hit me. Come on. Okay. They make broccoli with hair in China too? Yeah, they just don't, they just call that broccoli though. What are you looking at? Right? ATP pretty good has. Thanks. That's just broccoli. And then Chinese broccoli is the other thing. It's not the same exact thing. Since you like veggies, you must try beans, bean sprout. Let me tell you something about me and bean sprouts. Bean sprouts are my mortal enemy. I fucking hate bean sprouts. When I order pho or pad thai, if I even see one bean sprout in there, it's over. I hate that shit. The way they look like noodles and they like, they're so fucking unwanted and crunchy. They hide in your chow mein. They look just like a real noodle. But once that shit's in your mouth, it just has a crunch and it just sprays zero flavor fluid into your mouth. I fucking hate that shit. I really, really dislike it. 
<coughs> you know how you guys say oh it's like cr crunchy water well to me lettuce is like crunchy water and don't get me wrong i don't like lettuce but i don't hate lettuce like i'll eat it sprouts i won't eat it it's like crunchy water but like not clean water like it's like crunchy water that is unclean i love asparagus i it's one of my s tier vegetables asparagus and green beans and probably broccoli and also brussels sprouts all those are s tier vegetables in my opinion Asparagus is very, very good. Get up in there, will ya? Bean sprouts are top. Uh, disagree the game. Thanks, John Adams. And papaya is underrated. Do you know what's fucking really good that I just tried pretty much for the first time? Like, a passion fruit. I went to my aunt's house, and she gave me a passion fruit. It looked like a fucking... I don't even, it just looks so inedible. And the texture of it from the outside also was very, like, inedible. It just didn't look right. And when I cut it in half, I just ate it with the spoon. It was so good, dude. It, it blew my mind. Packed with flavor. Like, you can't, you know, if flavor took Thank up you. space it's amazing how they got all that flavor in there that's a small amount of fruit to have that much flavor passion fruit is an s tier fruit yeah yeah i i realized that recently it is good <laughs> thank you thanks hulk and captain Jinyu and pig Venus. thanks what the fuck is s tier what do you mean, what the fuck is S-tier? Are you asking what that term means? <laughs> Thank you. It really shouldn't be a, a riddle, to be honest with you. I mean, if you know what the word tier means, right? Tier, when you look up the definition of that word you'll see that it has a meaning. And then when you apply that to the capital S in front of it, maybe that will give you an idea. Like, oh, that must be like a level. It must be a descriptive way of, it's like an adjective and it's describing something. And in this case, it's telling us what level it's on. And I'm gonna guess that S is the best. So that means that S tier must mean this is a high end fruit among the best fruits. I wish I didn't have to break this down. Passion fruit cheesecake? Yeah. I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to get to work. I'm gonna have to make a few phone calls. In fact I gotta go. I'm kidding. Uh that sounds really good. Passion fruit cobbler. That shit's making my uh, mustache erect. Do I have a... Where's my... Did I not get a... Okay, good. I guess you don't really need it. All right, I got to kill this guy again. I guess I don't have to, but I want to. Shh. Uh-oh. Run! Okay, no problem. Small mistake. I'm gonna have to do that four times. <laughs> Thank you. Maybe five? <laughs> Thank you. Fucking cameraman. Uh oh. Ouch. Not good. Not good. Oh, fuck. Okay. Still good. 
Is he dead? Maybe I could go for the kill shot for Okazumi. Perfect. Now give me what I want. Bitch. Stingy motherfucker. Okay, now uh, I'll, I'll walk back to Firelink and I'll level up and use my Gravelord Sword to kill Martin Lawrence. Right? Sounds like a good deal. Oh, it's break time? Thanks. Pumpkin pie? <laughs> I think I have an unhealthy addiction to laughing. Or a healthy one. Depends. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks, Chewy Cookies. And Big Chorizo. And thanks, the Sad Boys. And Seven Gas. Thanks, bros. Passion Fruit Cheesecake. Dude, I'm on a diet, but I could still think about food. In fact, dude, that's like one of my best strats for having self-control with eating things that are delicious but bad for you. I think about those dudes from Hook. You don't actually have to eat it, you know? You just have to think about it hard enough and you could taste it. You just ate a round table pizza? Nice. That's cool. Round table is hella good. If you order it right. You got to order it right. Sometimes people will just go to round table and pay like 40 bucks for a pepperoni pizza and be like, man, this place is overrated, fucking dumbass. Who the fuck told you to order like a kindergartner, you idiot? Listen to my calls, you know? You got to do the real strats. Um, Yeah, listen to my calls, man. Nobody fucking told you to order that shit like a... Fucking moron. Oh, almost there. Two more levels. Dude, that video is so tight. Triple caution. That's a great video. Uh I gotta use my Thank you. My souls, these. Is it gonna be enough? There must be souls laying around here somewhere, right? Random Shitty ones. Yeah. Is that enough? No! I'll go upstairs and kill a couple of morons. Or I guess I could try to kill him, but he's gonna be tough. He was tough with the Gravelord sword. Yeah, elevator. That's where I'm gonna go. Okay, break time, Shalashaska. Uh, thanks, Down Bad Nate and Big Chorizo. Thanks. What a wonderful day. So far. And the night is young. I'm going to kill this guy and get his axe. I need to get a few more souls. And I'm going to say, I think the cap to get magic find from humanity is either 8 or 10. So, I would ideally like to get 8 or 10 humanity as well. But if I have to get less, then fine. 10 is the cap. Well, okay. Uh, currently, I believe I have three. So, if there are some humanities around that you can recommend, I'll, uh, I'll go get them before I fight the, the Black Knight. Anyway. <laughs> hey, thanks, Raging Raven. First things first, I gotta take a break. Let's see, what are we dancing to? I mean, we could go with the classic. Kind of, uh... Kind of in a dancing mood. All I gotta do is find it. There it is. I'll be back in five to seven minutes. Lightning! <laughs> and shit. <laughs> Poof. Hey, you guys are alright. Thanks, Moth Probe. Thanks for the five gifted subs. Thanks, Jimmy of Yore and Crazy Hindu Man. And thanks, Raging Raven. Thanks, bros. 
I got some work left to do. I need a little bit of humanity, and I need a little bit of a few souls, and then I'm gonna be ready. Born ready. Pepperoni pizza? Let me get one of those. Hey. Fuck. You can burn a Firekeeper's soul for five. Uh, Firekeeper's soul? You could burn a Firekeeper's soul? Where do you get one? New Londo? Baron and Terran. Yeah. The Balding Star! Excuse me. Is it better? How could it be worse than this fucking club, dude? That's absurd. The club scales A with strength. Where's the exit? There it is. It does balding damage? Yeah, that's true. But... I wonder how many, like, how much is the balding buildup? Oh, what about this? Ah, it's fucking chump change, though, and not everyone in town is awake and horny. Whoa, cool bird. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, thanks for the sub. I'm having a good one. I'm having a good day. I switched out my amulet for Owl's Uprising with Pride, so now I can squeeze in haste. Nice attack speed buff. I'm still not level 100, though. Mm, leveling up from 99 to 100 with magic find gear and juicing up the maps? No, it ain't happening. So I took off my magic find gear until I get to a hundred and I'm saving up all my scarabs and shit for the real magic find shit later. Oh, and I dropped the Hinokora's lock. That's the first one I've ever dropped. I dropped the Hinokora's lock. Pretty sweet. Yeah, uh, banners don't reserve mana is Thank really you. good. I'm using that too. So now I have five auras. I have Arctic Armor, Determination, Hatred. No, not Hatred. Haste and Pride. And a banner. That shit's crazy. I'm gonna see if I can't level up one more time. Then I'm gonna go activate the elevator, I guess. I mean, now what other choice do you have? I, oh, oh yeah, I also upgraded my Watcher's Eye to a uh, plus two Impale Watcher's Eye. Yeah, I'm using Determination. Do you think I should switch to Grace? I haven't tried that yet. I might. Uh, you can't level up yet, but maybe with some souls. Yeah, I'm pretty much almost... When I get to level 100, I'll try Uber bosses. I think Uber Maven and Uber Cirrus are going to be the most annoying ones because those fucking bitches teleport everywhere. So it's going to be like your trauma stacks are going to be falling off a cliff every two seconds. Dexterity, finally. Perfect. Uber serious can suck a dick. <laughs> that guy's pretty cool, man. I really like how stupid that fight is. You know? The way he can off-screen you and the fight is designed to keep him away from you. I think that's so funny. It's like designed to own you. Thank you. 
The fight is designed that way. You, you, all these things prevent you from getting to him, and he can off-screen you. So funny. Die. <laughs> what a funny thing to say, too. Die. And then just a red bar from left to right, and you're dead. What? Yeah, his voice lines are great, too. That's an awesome boss. I always loved it. A lot of people shit on that boss, but I think that's the whole point. It's not like they made this villain for you to love him, right? He's supposed to be a bitch. It's tight. Uh, thanks to Joy and Bonk and Seo Blow and Zernel and Ash Cheeks. Thanks. Thanks, Nihao 2 is epic. I didn't like it that much. The ball phase? What ball phase? When he throws them left and right? Those are easy. Uh, I think that the meteor phase can be hard because of visual clarity. It's sometimes hard to see the exits of the maze. So the meteor is a pain in the ass to me. Oh, and I guess the, the, you know, the, whatever the fuck it is at the end. That's a little bit annoying, I guess. The ice clones. Yeah, that's the, that's the worst part. The ice clones is the worst part. Everything else is pretty manageable. Those ice clones are the worst. Um, going up this way. Don't forget to update me on those nachos. I need to know. The Nacho Countdown. Do you miss the bestiary season in PoE? Huh? What do you mean, man? You mean like when it first was introduced? I didn't even play the game back then, dude. I used to shit on PoE all the time. Uh, but I do that with things that I've never tried before because I think it's pretty funny the way people feel about that. And then later on, what I like to do is I shit on things that I've never tried. And then afterwards, when I try them, I tell the person who told me about it and I recommend it to them. Like, hey, you should try this shit. It's tight. The person that I shit on for recommending it to me, I tell them about it. Like, I'm hooking them up with some shit. I've been doing that since I was, like, five. <laughs> I'm not even kidding. It's, like, the oldest strat that I invented. I've been doing that strat since the beginning. It's a classic. It happens from time to time. Yeah. I don't want to touch any of these bonfires though, right? Oh wait, you'll teleport back to... Man. I'm supposed to activate that elevator, which is by the gargoyles. I'm going the right way. This is the right way. I think. I don't fucking know. I think it is. Seventies strat. Are you trying to say that I was alive in the 70s? Because I was not. Disco? You know what's funny though? I like a lot of music and I really love oldies and like 50s and 60s music. I really love it, right? But I never liked disco. I'm very open-minded. You know, people say shit like, I love everything but country. I really think those guys are bigots. Country is also, it can be pretty good. Like, what about the devil went down to Georgia? You know? <laughs> Thank you. That's a sick-ass song. <clears throat> Um, basically my point is I'm very open-minded about music and I like all types of genres as long as it's good. Similar to movies. 
I like a lot of movies that you will probably wouldn't expect me to like, but just if it's good. And I also have to be interested in it. Uh, anyway, the point in my pants that I'm trying to make uh, is that I don't like disco. I just don't like it. I can't even think of a disco song that I like. I guess one of the best disco songs is... Is that... Is it called The Car Wash? <laughs> you know the one? That's disco, right? There are a few decent ones. Staying alive, I'm not a fan. Nah, nah, I don't like any of that shit. I mean, it's okay. I don't hate it, but... Nah. Nah, I don't see any good songs. Earth, Wind, and Fire? Uh... I guess. They're not... The, the, I guess the point I'm trying to make is most other music from the 50s and 60s, like oldies, I really liked them a lot. But disco is kind of like, eh, whatever, I guess. It doesn't move me. I can't think of many disco songs that I find moving. Get real. <laughs> Thank you. I like 80s music too. Hollywood swinging? Some of these songs I won't recognize by name, obviously. Keep in mind, I was born in 84. Don't listen to what the internet tells you, dude. Oh my god, are you kidding, dude? Don't do that. Do this! Ah! Two for one. And the last guy? Beat his fucking ass. Whiff on his ass. Okay. <coughs> yeah, I'm gonna be 40 this year. I have a mission, dude. Uh, we'll see how it goes. But, yep, big 40 this year. A lot of my friends that I went to school with are 40 already because when I went to school I was like I don't remember how this goes but I started kindergarten like at 3 instead of 4 or whatever the fuck it is so I ended up being one year younger than everyone in my class so all of the people I was in school with are ba basically 40 now so it's kind of cool to see them all do it and they all seem to think it's cool. I don't think it has anything to do with if you're smart or not. I think it has more to do with if your parents want to fucking get a free babysitter uh, during the day when you're three. But who knows? Isn't there a guy under here? This fucking guy. Got you, bitch. Nice. Two and one. Give me that. Uh, what's in here? Oh, fuck. I forgot about this. Okay, well, I could probably just kill him easily with this sword now, right? It's gonna be, like, the easiest thing I've ever done in my life. He's gonna get chopped in half. Are you allowed to put uh, sticky white stuff on this weapon, or is it not allowed? Go up the ladder. I don't need to go up the ladder. You can't. Hey, thanks, Patch the Squid and Ghost Dini and 96 Dreamer and Raikuso. And thanks, Genie Diamond and The Joy and Bonk. Happy New Year, bros. Let me cut this guy in half easily. It should be really easy. Should be the easiest. Fuck! Should be really easy. What is hitting me? The fucking guy's upstairs! You guys forgot to tell me about those guys. I just want to point that out. I forgot about those guys upstairs. Alright, let's try that again. No save? Triple question mark? 
Save. <laughs> oh. Save. Yeah. A lot of chocolate. What? I just ate a lot of chocolate. <laughs> All right, good shit. <laughs> All right. Dude, the whole city is gonna be after me. Gotta lose him. <laughs> Thank you. Damn, I think I lost him. Okay. Now all I gotta do is remember the guys upstairs. I just all I need to do is remember them. Simple as that. I didn't remember them. I also didn't uh, manage my stamina right. Oh, and I didn't roll those right either. Fucking stupid bitch! Don't worry, I got. <laughs> oh man, I can't believe that happened. That was sick. This is one of the best games, dude. This is one of the best games. You know that? Fucking, that was perfect. He shot me. The same guy. You don't even have to write these. This is AI generated script directing, dude. I don't even have to do my fucking homework. I just fucking turn the game on and this game will write the script for me, dude. It's cheating. It's fucked up. Twitch writers strike. I could see that. Suzuki. Dude, what if Suzuki has been ahead of the game and Shenmue has always been AI generated? Don't you feel like Shenmue has, seems AI generated? I feel like maybe that's some, like, you know how I say Kojima had technology brought to him by the aliens? I think maybe Suzuki was involved. The aliens brought him AI back in the Dreamcast days. He just used the AI to do that shit, man. About that day. If you want to know more about Chinese, you should ask a Chinese person. Dude, think about how advanced that is. Think about that. Oh, what a wonderful whiff. What a wonderful whiff! Ha! Oh, corner! No! Let me just try that shit one more time, dude. Let me just try that shit one more time. Do it, do it, do it. Ha, ha, ha. Bye, bye, bye. Oh. Oh, wait. He speaks Chinese. I do. I'm learning. I'm learning. Every time I think about that guy, Roger, I think about how he used to do like baseball and golf swings and he would throw like, you know, an air pitch while he's talking to you. He would just be throwing an air pitch. You know, the full, like he's a pitcher with the whole leg up. Or he would just like, he's talking to you and he would, he didn't even play golf. He didn't play baseball. He didn't play anything. He just would do that as like a regular, like an idle animation. He would do things like, you know, 
swing a baseball bat or swing a golf club. What the fuck? And we'd make fun of it every time. Like we would guess what sport. <laughs> you think he's going to be a quarterback for the Cowboys this time? We would like place bets on what kind of sport Roger was going to be playing today while he talked. I was 15. You know, at that time, it was like 14. I was like 14, and I had to ride my bike to that store that I had a job at. And the bike route I took, there was this fucking bush. Even if you were on the other side of the street, dude, it would flatten your tires every fucking time, dude. It sucked. It sucked, dude. I don't need no ladder, man. The ladder is for pussies. I just need to focus. Ow. Oh. I just need to focus. Ow. Wow, these guys shoot you from all the way over there! Fucking sack shooting, bushwhacking, motherfucking trying to combo? Ugh. Simple as that. Give me that shit. It's all about precision. Yeah, that bush used to give me a fucking flat tire on my bike every time. It was so annoying, dude. Oh, man. Crazy. The problems, you know? Life problems were so simple back then. The bush is giving me a flat tire was like the biggest disaster that you could even imagine at the time. <laughs> Pretty cool. I'm gonna kill this guy, he's a bitch. He has humanities. I need those humanities. Give me your money. How many did you have? Two? I'll take those. Andy's got those cool duds. Maybe I'll wear that. It's heavy for now though. Rip Bozo? Yeah, I never liked him. You can farm rats for humanities. Um, I'm trying to get to the fucking, is this really the best way to do that? Man, this is a, this is not close. I don't remember how to do this right. You can't just run, right? You have to wait. Oh, shit. I didn't know it's gonna reach all the way over here. Okay, wait, maybe I should wheeze the juice. Okay, Thank you. so this guy, he's gonna blow fire, but is he gonna be able to immediately when he sees me? No, right? Yeah, we're good, perfect. Okay, so now, uh, all I have to do, open this shortcut. That's a big shortcut. Now, I just gotta run upstairs Let me run over here. He melts all the other guys. And you wait. Eventually, this guy's going to jump off the cliff. And when, I, when he does, i got to run for it. Now! Beautiful. I think he could blow Kaka in here. Can he? I don't know. Open this. Okay. Okay, that's a big shortcut too. He can look. Oh my god! You see how close that was? Holy shit! All right. So now there's a Black Knight upstairs. I could pay him a visit, I guess. See how this sword does against him. 
I really don't want to die though, so I should probably not do this. I want to open the elevator. What's up, bitch? Oh, nice roll, you fucking motherfucker. Uh oh. Stun him! Oh, fuck, he did it get stunned! The Black Knight! Ah! I'll be right back. I'm gonna get him. Fuck. Uh, um, I opened all those shortcuts, dude. It's gonna be way easier. It's a lot of shortcuts. I specifically didn't want to sit at those bonfires. I wanted to. Fuck. Don't worry, I got this under control. Hey, so you're telling me this guy's gonna drop a humanity? Hey, give me a humanity, bitch. You need to drop shit. Yeah, the rats. Maybe you're right. Maybe the rats drop humanity. I can't remember. It sounds familiar, though. I remember those uh, squids in the Duke's archives dropping humanity, and I remember the the things that are humanities dropping humanity in the DLC. Yeah. Excuse me. The rats do? Got it. Oh, I opened the shortcut, you dumbass. Oh, this is gonna be wonderful. Come on, you fucking slow ass short weapon. Ha! Ah, I'll go through there. Yeah. I opened the shortcut. Okay. Um, same thing. Same strap. Be cool. Who's making that noise? Uh oh! Fuck. Oh no! Fucking guys. I'm in trouble. Oh, he went in the other direction. What a moron. All right. Okay. Maybe I should forget this Black Knight. Nah, fuck that guy. I'm gonna go kill him. He's dead. Try that shit again, bitch. Nice roll! God damn it. Ah! Man, what the fuck? Should have gotten some adaptability. I'm gonna get him this time. Hey, thanks, Jaro and Brad Pitt fan and Patch the Squid. Thanks, bros. I'm gonna get him this time. How many humanities do I have? Seven? You said the cap is ten? I just need three more. And then I could go kill the Black Knight and hopefully get the axe. Ten for item find. Hmm. Where do I get three humanity from? Ah! Cameraman! Oh. This guy drops him. Come on. Nothing. What are you snitching about? You know calling someone out for snitching is actually snitching, right? You look like a damn fool when you do that. That's the same thing as snitching. Mind your own fucking business. <laughs> the snitch paradox? That's a pretty good movie script. And title. Fuck. 
Is that AI generated? It must suck to be a teacher. Trying to stay on top of the latest ways to cheat. Like you give a fuck. But then again, a lot of people are pretty cool. My mom was a teacher for like 30 years. And a high school teacher too on top of that. Must be like the worst. got a bone to pick with this guy okay another perfect roll let me see that fucking ass damn big damage now I'll do a jumping finishing whoa and that's how it's done now give me the sweet stuff Ooh, damn that was still cool though uh twinkling titanite would have been cool though that's still cool I like the shield I wish that you could parry with that shield. That would be nice. Unfortunately, you can't. Now I gotta kill this pig. You could barbecue him. But it takes skills. See if I could do this right. Hey, what's up, bitch, over here? Where the fuck are you going? Where did you go? Is he gonna be stuck? No? Yes, perfect. Over here! Hey! Hello! Hey! Right here, right here. Oh, you could get that ass? I forgot you could backstab him because his rear armor is- Jesus Christ, he got killed! He didn't drop anything? What the fuck, cheapskate? Are you supposed to go down there? Or up there? can't remember. This part's pretty dangerous, isn't it? Oh, shit. Nice. Immaculate. Give me that. Mystery key? What the hell is a mystery key for? Maybe that's for downstairs when you fight with that baghead lady? Oh shit. Don't do that. Oh fucking guys. Combos! Whoa. What the? Damn, they slide down the ladder like Ghostbusters? <laughs> They're fucking zombies! How could they have that kind of fucking, uh... Found money on the ground? Uh, money on the ground? Dude, that happened to me one time in Vegas. It was awesome. It was awesome. That happened to me one time when I was, like, in my early 20s. Someone came up to me and said, Hey, excuse me, sir. You dropped your money. And then I looked down and there was, like, three or four hundred dollars on the floor and I was like I checked my pocket and all my money was in my pocket and I was like wow thanks very much for telling me and I picked it up and I took 20 out of it and I said here you go man that was nice of you and I put that shit in my fucking pocket and I had a wonderful weekend it was so sick it was so sick doubled up my money right there tripled i was broke at the time so three four hundred bucks was like a million bucks it was awesome 
Thanks, Blue Fire and Lyces and everyone. Let me drink water. Yeah, IRL magic find, dude. That was sick. <clears throat> yeah, I got a hint of Korra's luck. Uh, whenever what, whenever it was. <clears throat> that was like the biggest drop lately. I want to level up to a hundred, so I took off all my magic find gear. I found that with magic find gear on, by the way. But I took it all off because it, you just die too much. Which is not a problem if you're level 100, which is what I'm gonna be. Now that I took that shit off. I used to gamble before I streamed for a living. Like when I had jobs. When I... For a, you know, like for a living I had jobs, right? When I had jobs, I would gamble. But I don't anymore. Are you going to use the Hinokara lock to fracture another sick axe? I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do with it. If someone buys it, I'll sell it. <clears throat> I don't think that I need to make another sick axe, do I? I mean, it's already pretty good. <laughs> I wasn't going to recraft an axe. I made a really cool hat. All tier 1s except for... Uh, the life roll, had, I exalt slam the tier 2 life, but I got, from a Veiled Chaos, I got 15% uh, increased physical damage reduction while focused. And I'm already focusing for double damage on my weapon, so uh, it's pretty nice. Um, you can also craft an I-84 large bow cluster <laughs> Thank from you. MF Cucks. Um, I only was crafting for profit to get my mage blood. I don't think crafting for profit is very fun. I still do it if, like, I pick up a base. I'll craft something good out of it, right? But, um, I won't, like, actively go and buy bases and craft for profit because I don't think it's fun. I, I prefer to kill stuff and get drops. But, you know, when you're trying to get a mage blood... You don't, it's not about fun, you know? I'm not here to have fun. <laughs> I'm here to fucking farm a mage blood. And so when that, when you're in that mode and you're just farming like maximum, that's when I'll, I'll craft. Do you like Interstellar? Yeah. Is that the one I'm thinking of? The time travel space one? Yeah, that movie is awesome. Yeah, yeah, with the robot named, uh, what's his name? Like, Jar or some shit? Book? Tars! That's it. Yeah, that movie is awesome. I love time travel. I love time travel. It's one of my most favorite, like, you know, imaginary worlds to live in. You know what I mean? Like people, some people love fantasy with swords and some people love the future or or they love like cyberpunk or something. To me, the idea, like when you're just imagining things, the idea of time and that concept of what the way everything needed to happen the way it happened, that is a super cool concept to me. The space-time continuum. I like that shit. Ouch. Wow, dead. Back to the Future and Terminator 2 are both good movies. I like them both. Ah. 
Come on, man. Are you kidding? Do it, combo. I'm out of juice. I'm out of juice. Chandler's up there. Damn. That's crazy. That guy died. Don't do drugs. Are you a Back to the Future 3 enjoyer? I like that movie, but I think it sucks. I think Part 2 kind of sucks, too. I like it, but I think it kind of sucks. Uh, part 1 is the only Back to the Future movie that's like a good movie, you know? It's like a got good acting, good characters, good plot, everything's good. It's like a very good movie. The other two movies are like, you know, cash grabs, and they're good, too. I like them, but they suck. They're like... Escape from L.A. That movie fucking sucks, but I like it. I don't like it because it sucks. I like it because when I was a kid, I didn't know what sucks means. So, I liked it as a kid, and that's why it's special. Break time, Hasho show? Thanks. Thanks, rival Roman. Do I have something I need to do? I have 6,000 souls, so I could definitely go... Uh, oh, and I have a humanity. So you just get humanity for killing things, don't you? That means I have... Oh, where did I get that Firekeeper soul? Someone in the chat said I get five for that. I get five for this. But I don't know how to get it. You burn it? That might be a waste, especially considering I'm at eight humanity right now. I think what I'll do is first I'll level up with the souls. You can't buy humanity from a merchant around this early in the game, can you? Out of avoiding the puddle, why are you playing this old ass game? Hey, what's up, red name? I wonder if you think I ever want to see you again. Six timeouts and 28 messages? You are whack. Uh, anyway, I'll <laughs> never you. see you again. Ah, that's such a wonderful feeling. Um, you know? Because some of you guys probably have jobs where, like, you have a coworker or, a, like, someone that you have to interact with. And if you could erase this person from existence, you probably wish you could do that, right? Like every day you go to work and you see this worthless bitch and you think, man, if only there was a way I could just erase this, my life would be so much better. Well, I just did that. Isn't that cool? I'm really grateful for being able to do that. It means a lot. You can imagine how valuable that would be to you. So, anyway, Happy New Year. Uh, thanks, Madame Morticia. Thanks very much. I'm going to get up and take a quick breather. I'll come back and execute my mission. Ten humanity and then beat the Black Knight. What song should I put on? Let's see. Mm. Any recommendations? Something that really cooks. Oh, Captain America? We need your help. I'll be back in five to seven. Lightning! <laughs> and shit. Poof, good break. I'm on a mission. Beat the Black Knight. Thanks, Winter Bigot. Uh, the guy from uh, Avengers. Thanks, say no to Weebs and Philippa. And thanks, fat motherfucker. Thanks. Happy New Year, bros. Swing your sword. Okay. Uh, what's the mission? Sit at this bonfire. Level up. Uh, get some health. And get some... In Fuck. Yeah. Excuse me. Just get some health then. Uh, now, I just need... 
I have one humanity in my uh, whatever, wherever you keep those. And I have how many in my pocket? I got seven. That's eight. I just need two more. Two more humanity. Where can a guy get two humanity? I guess I could kill that rat a couple times. I could probably eat the humanity. Do you want to eat it now, dude? What if you die? It's a, it's a bad idea to eat all the humanity right now. I'm not going to do that. Because you could die and then lose all of it. And then the whole plan is fucking shitty. And I'm going to have a low drop rate against uh, the Black Knight. I need to have 10 humanity against the Black Knight. Rats under the dragon bridge. Yeah, but this rat is right here. The dragon bridge? Uh, oh, I guess I did open a shortcut. Isn't this rat right here? And he's a pussy. He runs away from you. But I guess he does have to drop it. I think the way this game's droppings work is you don't actually affect the quality of the drop. You only raise the chance that the enemy will give you something. And what he gives you is random based on the table of things that they can drop. So in the case of this Black Knight, I think that if you have more item find, there is a chance that they drop two items. They don't necessarily only have to drop one. And if you get them to drop two items, that means you have twice the chance. And it goes from being a one in five chance to get the ax to whatever the fuck it, it is after that. You can do the math. Oh, fucking poisoned! Poisoned! Oh, shit! And he didn't drop anything. This is exactly what I'm talking about, dude. You can't just take all the humanity and just be holding that shit. What if you get poisoned? Poisoned. Poison, poison. Triple? Oh, nice. Pants. I'll wear that. Better than just my regular loincloth. There were two laugh out loud funny parts in the movie Encino Man, and that is surprising. When I went back and rewatched that movie, I was sure that it was gonna be like one of those depressing moments where you realize you were an idiot when you were a kid. But that movie is still solid, dude. It's still solid. The wheezing the juice guy at the 7 Eleven that gets pissed, no wheezing the juice, that guy. That scene made me laugh out loud. And the scene where they're getting drunk in that bar and that Mexican cholo guy says, don't look at her, about his girlfriend. That part made me laugh out loud too. Two is pretty good. Out loud, it's gotta be fucking funny to laugh out loud. You know? It's pretty rare. <laughs> Thank you. Um... Is this plan any good? Uh, thanks, Santa Pastore. Thanks. We's in the juice, dude. Biodome fucking sucks, man. Are you kidding? Biodome sucks. Now that is a shitty ass movie. Eee! Eee! Fuck, I gotta go get that without dying. I gotta go get that. Biodome rules. Disagree the game. I think Polly Shore sucks. Is Polly Shore in Airheads? Airheads is a good movie. The Lone Rangers? Polly Shore's not in that. He is not in that. Airheads is a good movie. I always forget that that's an Adam Sandler movie, isn't it? When I think about Adam Sandler, I think the only good things he's ever done is those two movies. But that's the third. Man, every time you bring up that comment, people start bringing up all the worst Adam Sandler movies, which is all of them. 
Cole. Adam Sandler sucks. What's cooking good looking? Hey, thanks, Decoy Octopus. Um, I ordered pizza, if that's what you're asking, or are you asking how I'm doing? I'm doing really great. Feeling lucky. I think, honestly, that movie, Uncut Gems, with Adam Sandler, is one of his best movies. That movie, it successfully makes you feel very uncomfortable. And not many movies can do that. It has, You know how Quentin Tarantino is quite good at that? He, like, creates situations that are, like, very uncomfortable. I feel like not many people can do it well. But that movie does it really well, too. Yeah, the tension and, like, just the overall, it makes you uneasy. That feeling, Quentin Tarantino's good at that. Um, oh, almost walked off. Did I get my humanity? I did. Yeah, I thought I thought Uncut Gems was really good. It's not a comedy though. In fact, it's like a I don't even know how to describe it. To warn you. It's a dark movie, I guess, is the best way to put it. It covers like unpleasant topics. Toppings. It's a lot like all of uh, the other movies that Adam Sandler is in, but it just doesn't accomplish it in the same way. Those movies are just like tragically disappointing and unfunny. But still, you reach a similar kind of feeling. Click. Dude, all those movies suck. Everything, Waterboy, Little, whatever, whatever that movie is. <laughs> whatever it is. He didn't drop it. Billy Madison is good. I love that movie. Billy Madison is great. There's a lot of funny parts. I probably quote stuff from that movie all the time, right? And don't realize it. Oh, I definitely... You know when I go, you moron? <laughs> Doesn't a dog say that on the TV in the background in one of those scenes in that movie? There's like a scene in the movie where there's a TV on in the background and this dog goes shut up you moron or something like that I think that's where I got that from that movie's funny I love the scene where he yells at the kid on the phone you blew it I love that part when he fucked up trying to get a date with uh, the teacher that's a funny part <laughs> yelling at this like 8 year old it's a cool movie. I like Happy Gilmore as well. Um, thanks. Little Doctor. Thanks. Appreciate it. Maybe like a year ago, I saw a tweet by Adam Sandler where he like did the Happy Gilmore style putt. Did you see that? It's really cool. Yeah, he fucking clobbered it into space. And then he looks at the camera and goes, <laughs> or some shit. He laughs like he does in the movie, you know? He talks shit about Shooter McGavin and then laughs. I forget what he says, though. Do you? Do you remember? Shooter McGavin tweets him back? No way. My family, my mom and dad didn't let me watch Married with Children as a kid. So I don't connect with it in that way, but I do really think it's funny. And there are some Al Bundy jokes that I think are like 
genius, genius. But because I wasn't allowed to watch it, it just, you know, I didn't watch it until I was an adult. And that changes the way it connects with me. But it's really funny, though. Did you see the video of him and Bob Barker fighting in the hospital room? No, but it must be old. Didn't Bob Barker die several years ago? That guy was a legend, too, though. <clears throat> yeah, that guy was cool. You heard Bob Barker was a scary dude. That's so funny because I heard something about how the movie Happy Gilmore is like one of the only times he's like done something like that. And it gave him a reputation of being a bad motherfucker. But the reality was he was like the nicest guy on earth and like a animal rights, like, you know, be nice to your dogs and shit and like just like an angel and shit. But everyone thought he was like a hard ass and he would fuck them up. Shit's like a total rumor. It's like when I told everyone that Chet Chetty went to jail for home invasion robbery and then everyone thought that shit was real. It's very similar. It's not true. I just didn't want to tell everyone Chet's business. You know, Chet told me, like, it's personal. Don't go around telling people my business. So I was like, well, all right. That's fair. But, <laughs> Thank you. you know, that was a lie. I mean, it's it was to protect my friend's privacy, you know? I couldn't think of anything at the moment, and I just stuck with it. Whatever. What do you mean you can drop down? Drop down where? I want humanities. There's a ledge. I'm not sure that... <laughs> Thank you. We're on the same page. Uh, thanks, Bullmance. Where you're farming. This guy's watching a VOD. You can drop down where you're farming. Are you talking about the aqueduct right there? Where the white thing is. Watch me be nice. Hey, um, that white thing over there is a ring. I don't need it. I'm trying to get humanity. Okay, fair. Yeah. Yeah, uh, Happy New Year. Hmm. Man. That guy would have been shredded. In, ripped to shreds if this were last year. 2023? Hey, if this were 2023, dude, holy shit. Shreds. Anyway, you know, cool. That was easy. Was my childhood. Hey, thanks, Jordan Peele. You think? No way. I would believe that. I would believe that so quickly. That Jordan Peele loves MGS2. And his license plate probably says Kojina. I believe that too. I haven't started making fun of him yet. I still will make fun of, like, you know, Jeff Keighley. But, man, that would suck if Jordan Peele watched my stream. Damn it. Hey, are you out there? He actually loves MGS2. I believe it. I believe it. Did I call it that? Get in? <laughs> That's funny. Oh, 
Oh, I called it Get Us? <laughs> what is it really called? I don't even know what it's... Is it called Get Us? Now I don't know what funny is. Which one of them is the real... <laughs> which one is the real name? Is it Get In or is it Get Us? And which one did I call it? I only called it one of those. I don't even know anymore. The chat's full of stupid morons. Remember that red name that told me to drop down off the cliff by the white thing? That was sick. That guy was pretty tight. Secret advice. Techniques. Lol, what a dumbass. Yeah, I remember him too. <laughs> yeah, he was dumb. Yeah, you're right. Oh, nice! Hey, that last dumbass was pretty lucky. I got it. That's it. Perfect. Now I can load up on humanity. I'll probably do it when I get close to him, right? I'll load up on humanity, go down there, and pay that guy a visit. Hey, thanks, Jill Punching Leon. And thanks... Uh, thanks again, Jordan Peel and Bull Mance and Lucinafer and Prophesize. Thanks, guys. Thanks, Jugs. And anyone I didn't thank. Nice. Success. Can I level up with this amount of souls? You better believe it. I'll take a little bit of endurance. Out of character, how did you like Armored Core 6 off stream? Okay, this is going to be an example of me banning this loser. Uh, just to show the rest of you that just because I was nice to the last guy does not mean I will just be nice to everyone. This guy is about to get fucked up. Hey, how much money do you have on you right now? Just let me just ask you this shit first. How much money do you have? And what size are those shoes? If you could just answer those questions. Stupid little bitch. I'm telling you right now, I'm being nice, okay? If I ever see you in here again, you're banned. So, your best strat will be... First, I'm going to tag you with the ban so that I know, I remember you. Okay? Your best strat. I'm teaching you this. This is Nintendo Power Magazine right now. If you want to be able to participate in here and take advantage of my kindness right now, what I would do is sit out this 10-minute ban, but shut the fuck up for a day. I promise you, I know myself well. I don't give a fuck about some random pink name who rubbed me the wrong way, and I will forget you by tomorrow. I promise. But... You have the ability to make yourself unforgettable. And the way you'll do that is by opening your fucking mouth again. Okay? This is Nintendo Power tips and tricks. Okay? Just make it so I forget you and we'll be cool. But if I remember you, if I see you again, that's it. And this doesn't count as me being rude. Right? You tell me, chat. That doesn't count as being rude. Simple. This is math. I just told you the way it is. <laughs> 2023 Eris is back. I'm pulling you over, dude. Um, he wants revenge. I think I'm being nice. Don't you? The guy is not permanently banned. I don't think I called him anything. Right? Did I even insult him at all? I just explained to him how it's going to go. You're being way too nice. I think you're right. If I remembered that guy's name, I would ban him right now. And I still would be nice. You know that? Hey, you're lucky I can't remember your name. But I will remember it if I see it again. It's one of those pink Yay! names. And I know I'll fucking recognize you. And if I don't recognize you, I got bad fucking news for you. I got... Thousands of stenographers in here who are going to fucking remember you. Trust me, and they are dying to snitch on you, okay? 
They are dying to snitch on you and you know it. They already know everything about you. They've looked at your profile, how many months, every comment. Trust me, you are fucked. All I got to do is ask them and they'll fucking snitch so fast and you know it. All right. So let's make sure I forget you and happy new year. Thanks MGS2 and thanks belt buckle and blooming asshole. Thanks. At Chili's? God, that restaurant is so shitty. Chili's? That restaurant is like awful, dude. It's trash. I don't know how it can survive. How? They must have like the lowest prices. I mean, they must have the like their their cost. What's the term? Overhead? Whatever the fuck the word is. They probably it cost them like nothing to make the food. That's my guess. Like all the food is like frozen fucking Totino's pizza rolls. And they just have some like, you know, some girl puts it in a microwave, comes up and charges you 20 bucks. Wow, just looked it up. Nintendo Power was a real thing from the 90s. How old are you, dude? No shit, bitch. What do you think? I just fucking made some shit up out of nowhere? Out of the sky? How old is this kid? <clears throat> I gotta go kill the Black Knight. Damn it. Kids suck. Yeah, I mean, I think they suck, but I think that it's very important that some people don't mind doing the job. Similar to a gastroenterologist, I don't have to do that job because there are people out there who will do it and do a better job at it, you know? Ah, excuse me. This is the right way, right? <laughs> Thank you. I'm doing the drop down shortcut. I think that's the plan. Thanks, cold ass fashion. I'm not going to eat the humanity until I'm like right at the Black Knight. Oh! Wait a minute, dude. Why is that guy alive? How is that guy alive? Maybe I just didn't kill him this time, you think? I don't know how that guy is alive. How the fuck is that guy alive? Shit. That was the last playthrough? Well, how did I get this knife then? Remember the knife? In my hands? That wasn't the last playthrough. Let me jump off this cliff, you fucker. Is that gonna kill me? My feet! Oh! Oh. No! No! My humanity! Oh, fuck. I had one in my fucking pants. Oh, I gotta go get that now. It's probably up there. I could get it. It's cool. Shit. Didn't I open some kind of note? Thank you. No. Fuck. Minus one humanity. Um, hey, thanks, Hollow Cinder. Or whatever. This is one of the best ever. When you play games like Demon's Souls and Dark Souls 1, it you can really tell that Miyazaki like fucking drew little sketches of these things when he was a kid. Like he was imagining Souls games ever since he was in middle school. But Dark Souls 2, 3, 4, 5 and all the rest, you can kind of tell it has that feeling of like, uh-oh, we got to finish this shit by Monday. You know what I mean? 
it's got that flavor to it. But the originals, I mean, you could tell he was dreaming this shit up his whole life. Why isn't Cigar shooting me? I asked for it. There's my humanity. Perfect. Now all I gotta do is do this. Without fucking up. Perfect. Now I take the shortcut. I might be chased. Coast is clear. Okay. Oh, but these guys are going to interfere with police business. Okay, I'm going to eat all my humanity here, right? This is it. Humanity. Use item 8. Hey! Where's the last one? I thought I had 10. Fuck. We're not a count. Well, alright, well, look. Uh, 9 is gonna have to cut it. I thought I had 10. Nine's gonna cut it anyway. Okay. I just gotta drop down here once. Uh, I can't kill these dudes, right? I think these guys are unkillable. Wait. Yeah, their eyes are turned on. I think they're unkillable. Oh! Oh. Oh. Dude. Dude. Are you fucking kidding me? Did you see that? That was an anti-air. I didn't even fucking land. That was... That was so stupid. <laughs> I can't believe that just happened. You can parry with the Black Knight shield? No way. Is this guy for real? That's not the Black Knight shield. Whoa! You can! Maybe I was thinking of another game. That's a sick dropping then. But it can't be that sick yet. I have to be able to use it. And I have to be able to use it with the... Um, axe. So if I get the axe, I'll use it. That'll be awesome. The shield and the axe? Cool. That's a rarer drop than the axe? That makes... That doesn't make sense. Uh, there are more Black Knights that hold a shield per playthrough than there are the axe or the halberd. So... I wouldn't, I don't know, maybe you're right though. It just doesn't seem to be the case. Just because of the number of possible times you can roll for the axe per playthrough. I don't want to lose these humanities. So this is whack. Definitely didn't go the way I wanted it to. But I could still get them. Just gonna require some precision on my part. I think if you've been here for a while, you probably agree that <laughs> precision is uh, my middle name. Ah, simple as that. All right. Now, I believe my souls will be just above the Black Knight. Perhaps around here. There they are. Now let's wait for these two Ghostbusters. Man, what the hell? Why is only one of them climbing? Dude, it would be sweet if I could kill them. Maybe I gotta kill Saga, huh? Wait! Oh man. He's gonna reassemble. Okay, 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 okay. I got my shit. Okay. What's up, bitch? Try this! 
Oh fuck! Why did he not get stunned? Okay, okay. Heal up. Skeletons are gonna join the party soon. Don't get involved. Come on! I thought that would fucking... I got lucky that that did not... Oh, he jumps! He's dead. Give it to me! Damn, he didn't give it to me. You gotta restart. I wonder what the most efficient way to do this would be. I mean, getting this sword to kill him, that's a really good strat. I did it in one try this time. But those humanities, I, I got those for free from killing that, that guy, uh, the praising the sun guy. Go for the BKH? That doesn't sound very smart of you. I'm asking you what uh, the best way to get this weapon is and your answer is to go for a different weapon? Cool strat. Hmm. Use that one guy's save strat. What one guy? Save strap. Hey, what's up, red name? I'm nice. It's so much easier being nice in person. Don't you think? Oh my god, fucking stupid red name, motherfucker! Uh, not you, not you. I was thinking about some guy I knew back in 2023. Uh, thanks, <laughs> Thank Fufu. <clears throat> Thanks, Clam Hat and Fufu. I am. I am. Fuck. He didn't give it to me. That's a what? One in five? Someone said one in five. But is that including the humanity? Shit. Man, this game is so cool. I love it. I love this game. Uh, do you think I should go for one more? It takes like an hour, dude. Fuck it. Alright, one more try. Man, that didn't work. I was pretty confident. Man, crafting in Path of Exile is so good, dude. It is so good. I really like it. Oops. Female. Class. Warrior. Nope. Class. Deprived. Gift. Master key. Oh, can you get humanity here? Right? Yeah. Right? Twin humanity. Let me get that. Let me get one of those. Princess Leia. Bun. Oh, yeah. Name. Uh, what was my name last time? Billy Crystal. That didn't work. We need a new name. Um, Kojina. A faster kill on the... Huh? Suck. Uh, thanks again, Foo Foo. Thief Key is trash. It seems to be only good if you want to use the pine resin, right? If you want to use that pine resin early, it's good. Dolores. Mulva. Is that how you spell Dolores?
Lasagna yet. Dolores? That's how you spell that? That's not a common name. That name's extinct or in endangered. Like, um, like Prudence. Names like that. Prudence is a endangered Thank name. You. Thanks, F and Wookie. Gretchen, definitely. Dolores. I've only known two Doloreses in my whole life, and they both had huge tits. I don't know if that has any relation. I'm just pointing it out. It's a, like, it could be totally a coincidence. Very possible. got to make good time here now that I've been practicing hurry up there's a guy up here right <coughs> yeah Time for a new PV. I'm not even gonna get that shit behind that dude. Bitch. Ow. Oh! Oh god. Still good. Still good. Cameraman tried getting me, but it ain't gonna happen to me, go. You get a humanity for that too, huh? I guess I forgot. <laughs> Thank Thanks, Azrael Excelsis. Thanks. And FN Wookie. Thanks for the subs. Okay. Now, the mission has begun. I better use these souls because I'm probably going to lose them. Though I could not lose them. Uh, level up my strength, please. Okay, now straight to the Titanite Demon. Top speed. I'm finna eat some pizza as a celebration of victory pizza. This game is so good at capturing that whole concept of getting lucky there are several drops that you can get early game that really change your playthrough honestly among the millions of complaints i had about diablo 4 one of the biggest problems with that game is there's no way to win a jackpot you just can't drop like a divine during the campaign or a headhunter or like a mirror, there's no miracle that can happen. You have to get to the end game to drop end game gear. And when you get there, you're so strong that it all sucks anyway. Yeah, I heard they added stuff like bosses that you can farm to drop shit, but it doesn't seem good. Oh, damn it. You don't lose it. I didn't have a humanity on my character, did I? They're all just in my pockets. Fuck. 
Okay, good. Let me try that again. I got distracted. <clears throat> that game will likely improve, but I suspect that they are going to sell an expansion for it before it's good. <laughs> it feels like that's how it's going to go. Have you ever played Soul Reaver 2? I don't know. I think the Legacy of Kane Soul Reaver 1 was one of my... Like a game that I wanted to play. And I think I... Maybe I tried it on stream and I didn't like it as much as I thought. Or did I never try it? One of the one of those two. It's possible that I never played it, but yet I insulted people who like it. And then one day I'll like it. And then tell those people that they should try it. And it's pretty good. I think I'll do that. Oh, come on, dude. It's so fucking stupid. Okay. Nice suit. All of those Legacy of Cain games always kind of felt like bargain bin style games like cheap games no offense when I was a kid but some people seem to like them come on why you gotta do me like this yes oh my god that almost hit me be cool okay Oh, that is fucking bullshit, but still good. I got the thing. So now I have the thing. All I got to do is go sit in the thing, and the fucking thing sucks. Shit. There's humanity right here, right? Three of them. Maybe I don't need ten. You know? Maybe I'll just easily do it with, uh... Man, you know what would be fucking perfect is if I could just kill the Black Knight just like this with this weapon. I could! You know I could. That's the new plan. Forget the fucking Grave Lord sword. I'm just gonna kill the Black Knight with this weapon. Right? New plan. Have you ever read Snow Crash? I don't know, but when I when I used to read books, I only read nonfiction books. That sounds like a fiction book, if it's a book. I don't read books anymore. Who the fuck does? Moms do. Uh, but when I did read books, when I was working at the library, I only read nonfiction because, I mean, I thought, what's the point of reading a fiction book? But, you know, whatever. Everyone's different. Reading audiobooks? I guess that doesn't really count. But I don't do that either. Thank you. Audiobooks? Alright. I'm not against it, I just don't do it. Come on, yes. I'm just gonna go fight him right here. Remember the title of that Poker Stars book, huh? What Poker Stars book? Super System? What about it? I've read both of those before. What? What the fuck are you making faces at? Give what up? Do you think I want to not give it up? I mean, what the fuck is there to give it up for? There's nothing to give up. 
No one has said anything worth anything. You're lucky I'm nice now. You really are. <laughs> that guy who said nice in quotation marks is lucky I'm nice now. He doesn't know how lucky he is, obviously. He's about to get unlucky. Hey, you better start running now, you little motherfucker. Oh, okay, but the guys are going to come in here. Don't come in here. No! Well, that's fine, because I didn't have my humanity on me anyway. That didn't work out exactly the way I planned. How, what are you going to do about those skeletons, dude? All right, let me try that shit again. I didn't have any humanity on me for the best. I'm glad I didn't. How many do I have? Uh, I have four plus two. I got six. That's not bad. I could get nine if I go all the way over there and kill Solaire, but it's not worth it because, I mean, dude, even with that many, this fucking cheapskate motherfucker, he may not give me what I want. So you're probably better off taking more spins than you are making each spin more potent in terms of success. Hey, where do you get the Progenesis flask from? Is that an Uber Maven drop? Uber Maven? Damn, I'm gonna try Uber Maven. I wonder if I can kill that boss. Without spell suppression. I think I could. I've done it before without spell suppression. But not with Bone Shatter. That's the only thing. Bone Shatter is like ramp up and also losing your stacks is gonna be annoying the memory game sucks yeah but it's softcore i mean i could easily one portal that fight <clears throat> the only memory game that really sucks is the third one the one that has beams in the way right or do they all have beams in the way when when it's uber the third one only right I mean, you could die. I'll one portal that fight. Especially, you know. Because that flask is really good and really expensive on console. So maybe that'll be a cool thing to go for. I haven't really decided yet. I'm still trying to get to level 100. That's my next mission. Get to level 100. My gear is good to go for level 100, and I'm good to go. I got a second uh, Venter's Gamble for, I think, I don't remember what I paid for it. But I traded for a second Venter's Gamble, so I got two of them, and I'm ready. Humanities Habibi here? Maybe what I could do is I could lure these guys and knock them off the cliff. Maybe that's a good idea. And that way they won't interfere with the fight. Against the Black Knight. Yeah. Excuse me. Hello? Okay, perfect. Oh, fuck! Explosive bitch! Nice! Perfect! So now those guys are no longer a problem and I could go in the room and uh, eat all the humanity and then fight the Black Knight. Oh, the downside though is yeah, that this weapon you. probably doesn't do enough damage. But that's probably okay. I could handle it. 
to handle it. Okay. Uh, eat the humanity. Wait, how do you do this? Go here. Eat this. And eat all of these. Okay. Magic find boosted. Now. There he is. Okay, Let's see what kind of damage I'm packing. Uh, I still can't tell. Not much. Oh god, this is not gonna be easy. Oh fuck. That's two backstabs or one? Ooh. Get that rear. I might be able to get a free Okazumi. Damn, I'm gonna have to hit this guy a thousand times. Fucking this weapon sucks. <laughs> Thank you. I got this. There's one attack he does I don't like. my friends yes Is that enough enough give it to me damn damn Damn! Damn! He didn't give it to me. Man, this is cool. I'll try again. Maybe not tonight though, I'm hungry. That was cool. This game is so good, dude. The idea of just playing it like this or having different ways to play it is so cool. Yeah, that was fast, right? Better than going and getting all those souls and killing Solaire. I don't have to go get the Grave Lord Sword. All I gotta do, start the game, get the regular humanities that you get for free, and use the club. I beat his ass. That was pretty easy. Yeah, I could do it. We'll see. I don't know when I'll try again, but I will. You know the drill. I'm always looking out for weird, shitty, and scary ESL games and stuff. Got some Chicago dogs. Enjoy. I love those. Thanks, OG Griper and Gunny and Quimbley and Django Bay. And I like hummus. I do too. Thanks, Rip Van and Samoan Senpai and Ice Falls. Thanks, bros. It's big dinner time. Thanks for liking my stream. Um, I'll be back tomorrow, assuming everything goes according to my well-laid plan. I don't know what I'll play, though, but what difference does it make? Anyway, thanks again, uh, hopefully everything goes the way you want it to this year. I could see myself having a very good year, and I suggest you do the same. You should join me. I heard good things about it. Anyway, have a good evening, bros. I'll see you guys in the sewer. Thanks again. See ya.